Yeah. Oh, Metallica? You're going to see Metallica in Arlington this weekend? Hmm. Huh. Now that be sounding like an idea I can That's, get behind. That sounds a little familiar. It sounds like <laughs> I like that idea a lot. <laughs> it sounds like I might also be there. And maybe <laughs> as well as I. <laughs> 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 it sounds like I am going to be there. We make the journey. We'll be mm. making the journey yeah. to the Arlington. Chat, listen up, everybody. Thank you all for tuning in to the stream this evening. We're going to be watching the usual shit along with some extra shit. Shit and piss. A little shit and pissing on that beat sprinkled all in there. Amen. Well, let me turn the uh, notifications on so when you guys uh, sub and donate and donate and sub. It I thought we were muted the whole time when you said that. <laughs> <laughs> just haven't been talking at all. If you're watching on YouTube and you're enjoying, please be sure to leave a like, comment, uh, <coughs> and subscribe to the channel. You'll do it. We will say thank you. Oh, TikTok cringe. We didn't have that on the list. Thank you, Levy Divi. Good job. Thank you, Levy Divi. You've just won an all-inclusive. Pick it up whenever you're ready. <laughs> you just won a little bungee stickle. <laughs> All right, we got the Metallica. We'll uh, put that in in higher on the list to get that out of the way before it's completely unbearable. <laughs> yeah, don't make that too late. Thank you guys so much for all the, the subs and everything, all the primes, all the donations. Everyone say, hi, YouTube. Thank you for all the love on YouTube as well. All the comments. I read every one. That is a lie, but I read a lot of them. He doesn't know how to read. No, nope, someone reads them to me. I appreciate everybody, though, for all the love. Y'all are awesome, and I mean that. Someone read me a bedtime story. All right. <laughs> Let's get into it. Oh, Carton arcs is going to happen, yes. Don't you worry. Can you fart on my ding dong? Shit, Piz. <laughs> All right, we're going to fuck her. <laughs> <laughs> we're going to start by watching a meme compilation. Dexterity. Like it usually goes. Ambidextrous. Le Amphibious. Leif Erickson. Whoa, 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 whoa. Calm down. Come on now. Thanks for the $3. I'm laid back Viking and Ron. Thanks for the $5. First right. person to spell ambidextrous wins up. First person to tell me what ABS stands for when. Why would you do that? All right, let's go. <laughs> that ain't right. Here we go. Just an hour to begin. Offensive memes that if you laugh, you lose. Typical. We're getting into it. V247. Let's see how offensive these memes can get. And if we laugh, we, we lose. lose. We yeah. should do a challenge where every time that we laugh, we cut a millimeter off of our penis. I'd laugh one time and lose the whole thing. Way to beat me to it. I'm, I would I'm laugh three times you. and... I'm going to beat your millimeter. Fair enough. <laughs> I'd, I'd laugh three times and be able to play in a WNBA. <laughs> what are you talking about, dude? <laughs> All right, let's go. What the hell are you talking about? They're in the woods. They're in the woods. They're in the woods. They're in the woods. Every like, time you I laugh, like stuff like that. you shotgun a beer. I love you. I don't like when stuff comes at the camera where it looks like it's going to hit you. Thumbnail? Thumbnail? I'm just kidding. What's wrong with it? I actually dropped something on my nail the other day. Fuck you, my nigga! What the? Fuck you, my nigga! No words needed. Precious cargo. He was strapped down, I saw him. Monkey balloon! It's like us in school. Holy crap. It's like the monkey's killing a tumor in my brain. That look like DNA. <laughs> Little blued. Little blue wanted a circumcision. Holy Christ. Holy Christ, there's nothing left. Hey! 
This motherfucker got them big keys! <laughs> oh. I gotta get out of here. Hey, thanks for the ten dollars, Cody. I'm dripping. I'm dripping, bro. I'm dripping. He I'm is. Dripping. Bro is dripping. I'm dripping like ice. Correct. Like water. Fresh like juice. King shit. Come on, baby. Let me love on you. Hey! hey. Real ass king shit right there. Hey, Amen. Dripping like ice. Like water. Like liquidized penis. Ice water. Nintendo hey intro. Hey, YouTube is on my ass with taking down my videos. I made a second channel where I will be posting, so please subscribe. If you don't mind, sure please click on the video. Please leave it. I like it. And subscribe and comment, and please watch my video. <laughs> you ever play Minecraft? Huh? I feel like every time I see someone playing Minecraft, they're always doing shit. That uh, I've in never... the Nether. Yeah, they're always doing shit. Yeah, they're always doing shit. That uh, I've in the never... Nether. I've never done. Like what? What What did you just see there that you've never done? I've never shot a golden skeleton, golden armor skeleton into lava in the nether. Okay. If you want to be that specific. I yeah. saw a waffle house there one time, though. In the nether? Mm -hmm. Someone built a whole waffle house in the nether. It was fully functional. I got an all-star. So. <laughs> Brady think, wants that pie. I think you were in Atlanta. <laughs> <laughs> I did see someone <laughs> shooting a music video at a Waffle House. This is oh, yeah. in Atlanta. I went to a Waffle House in Atlanta, and they were shooting a music video in there, and I was just sitting there eating my eggs, and they were up on the... <laughs> were you not in the video? I don't know. They might have panned the camera over to me. I was just eating eggs and shit. They made eggs in the pan. So, wait a second. <laughs> <laughs> I mean... You didn't... Ask, I guess... I don't know where they made they, them. <laughs> <laughs> don't know where they made them. They panned the eggs. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> <laughs> sorry, sorry. <laughs> I misunderstood. <laughs> they panned. <laughs> There's two different kinds of pans here we're talking about. <laughs> Pan eggs. Maybe that's what the music video is about. <laughs> oh, could have been. But you didn't ask to be in the video, though? I was scared. Oh. I was okay. frantically eating my eggs. I was shaking. What, were you scared of music? Yes. Huh. Loud music in Waffle House and people dancing on the bar. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah. Fair enough. It's a little bit of a traumatic experience. You're making me re relive it in my head. Well, you brought that up. But you could have just ordered sweet tea and you'd have been all right. Just saying. Here we go again. Oh, oh my god! Oh! Oh my fucking god! Oh my god! Oh, get back in the car! No, get back in the car! Money! Money! Dude, how long is this nether meme? Right? Double recently, I was late, and this girl was just like, You know, I shaved my whole body for you? I shaved my whole body for you. And I was like, Listen, uh, I empathize, but, uh, Maybe save that for white dudes. I am Indian. I also shaved my entire body for you. <laughs> right? right, Denise? We both sacrificed a lot of Gillettes to be here. Just cut the shit. Get in the car. We're both late to Fast and Furious. Sounds like a Fruit Loops commercial. Reese's Puffs. Nah, bro. Can I have your pack of gum? The whole thing? No. Okay, one piece. Bro, I don't know what's in my pre-workout today. Slurp juice. But it's hitting different. Hey, hey! I want this bitch right here, cause I'm gonna see shit called Top 10 feet picks of 2022. Yo, what? Yo! <laughs> Crazy night. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, no way! 
people who think I'm hacking. I Fuck just the bought reindeer. a brand new PC with no cheats, and I'm still hitting clips like this. I'm sorry, don't leave me. I need you here with me now. Don't say that, our love's gone. Amen. <laughs> you already know what I want to do with that dog. Yo, Leave a comment. It's the dude from Fortnite. Eight Man, ball. <laughs> Got him. Ooh, fall guys. I love fall guys so much. See, that meme's a little confusing to me because I don't know. I'm missing all of these. I'm missing them. I don't know what dad they're referring to. Because you have two? I have two of them. And sometimes I hear that noise, but they're not always brushing their teeth. Huh. So it could be a song or it could be anything. <laughs> Watch car crashes. <laughs> Watch car crash. Me personally, I will never let nobody talk to me like that. Why is it dark in there? It's like one light. See, you need to uh, retreat a little. That is disgusting. What? Dude. Good morning, USA. It's not disgusting. How's it not disgusting? Tell me. Um, Botanist. The mycelium and the mushroom are oh so smart. Oh my god, dude. They can grow anywhere. What? You are put you mad? the controllers up to your ass so when it vibrates. You I have vibration turned off. No, you don't. I've been, Bro. You, I've played with your controllers. There's fucking I'm sure you have. stains all over them. I turn vibration off. You got greasy controllers. So that's different. You got greasy controllers and you spit when you talk. You're not, and you don't wipe good. What the hell is wrong with you? Everyone around you can smell it. You just mad. You don't know what a mushroom is, dude. What's wrong with a mushroom growing out of a controller? I'd rather them Tell me I, that. I, What's wrong with that? Why not grow them out of the console? There's more surface area. What do you mean? Do you think they planted it there? That's how smart a mushroom is. It can grow anywhere. Okay, so that's Sony called a wireless no mushroom. Sony had nothing to do with it. It's probably a Mario controller, honestly. Sony had nothing to do with it. Oh, I see what you're doing now. What? Name yeah, of the person who made the controller? No, you're being fucked up. That's fucked up. <laughs> <laughs> like Sony made Mario, right? So there you go. <laughs> Dear God. <laughs> Can you yeah, imagine? You a good what? <laughs> <laughs> what in the mushrooms? He's a fun guy. Hey. Got him. Hey. I am a fun guy. Oh, shit. Why is the alert box down there? Hold on. It's mycelium. What is wrong with your ceiling fan? Stella Simon. My ceiling fan has mushrooms on it. My ceilium. <laughs> I'm going to drop shrooms with a deer in the McDonald's bathroom and then eat a whole roll of toilet paper with it. You don't have to tell us. <clears throat> You've probably never been to a deer. you probably never even had a... <laughs> yeah. Got him! The, the hair in this game. Shit looks pretty, pretty good. Reld and ding. Look at that. Wow. I've had enough of this. <laughs> nah. Who did that? Who did that? That's my favorite one so far. <laughs> <laughs> That's beautiful. Hey, who the hell? Hey, put a four in the chat if you drive a Ford. <laughs> this punish. Have you seen this? Yes. Oh, this is so good. It reminds me of you. Thanks, Doug. He's going to stop. 
You're not gonna tell me what I'm gonna do and not do. I am now the alpha. Bro. Not how this works. I am the teacher. The alpha takes priority over the teacher. Hey. The alpha takes priority I'm on the black demon. The alpha have dickhead itis. I'm on the black demon. You are the alpha. The alpha be sharking down his own leg. Thank Lad. you for the 25 gifted. When the alpha be shitting down his own leg. <laughs> you'd be watching out when the alpha be sharting down his own leg. Oppenheimer made that burb. Over everything. Do you well, not know how that works? The teacher is telling the Barb alpha to sit in the seat right now. And the alpha doesn't have to listen to <laughs> order from its mouth. Well, you don't have to listen, but... The consequences that follow. I will hit you with a Febreze can. The alpha. <laughs> the alpha doesn't take punishment. Let's see how well that works out for him, okay? And then the teacher pulls a. Nah. <laughs> I will spray ice all up your arse crack. <laughs> we and light it on fire. We need to bring back paddles to the classroom. So they can row away? Mm -hmm. So the alpha can get in his little rowboat and get on out of there. He's got a canoe. A paddle. Hey, maybe you don't have to go to the zoo after all. They need a sledgehammer. Like there are wild animals right here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. What? Jesse, we need to ride camel. <laughs> We're I selling the a... RV for a camel, Jesse. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it was a nun. You would give your life to Christ? Jesse Nunn, man. Walter Halal. Ain't nothing we can do. Oh, what's up, bro? It's nothing personal. Huh? I'm begging, begging you. Thanks for two months. Put your love in hand out, baby. Since Everyone say, Walter. Sin City was a maybe Hey. Hold up. Not. Plants versus zombies moment. I tried this game out. I don't remember the battle bus. Not. What? Whoa! Not. Is this is yeah. <laughs> uh, F two up in the sky, gentlemen. That was RDM. <laughs> Thanks for the thousand pounds. Like three months <laughs> just from not drinking beer. Yeah, I drank Has that been tough to cut out beer? Not really, I just replaced it with vodka. Amen. Thanks for the okay, beans. Ike the ball. You gotta, you gotta hold the right trigger down. Blue 42! Blue 42! You gotta hold it, keep it held down. And then... Don't move! Don't move! Don't move! The water's about to fall off. I got a bad back. Lizard? Pal. Little lizard on the doorbell? <laughs> oh my god! Away! Oh, <laughs> oh hell oh. yeah! <laughs> Holy shit! This man That's honestly impressive. Morning, Give the man a raise. Give him another sign so he can do it two times. That's a sign to go there. Here's your no sign. He doesn't flinch at torture, human trafficking, or genocide. He's not loyal to a flag or a country or any set of ideals. <laughs> we 
already saw that one. Why are you just now laughing at it? Sorry. Delayed reaction, dude. I'm sorry. Hey! Is anyone awake in there? <laughs> ah! Yeah! I'm alive. Sweat cycle thing for the brain. Hey, y'all. Thank y'all. I've been killing bears, man. I've been... <laughs> What's that guy's name? This is Conwall McDongles. <laughs> Conwang McDongles. Cornwallis. <laughs> Isn't this Lizzo? Oh. This is Lizzo's dancer. <laughs> this is how Ethan Snapchats me. <laughs> Give me a chance. I'll treat you right. And you don't know, maybe I'll put a ring on that finger someday. Give me a chance. You're a different kind of girl. No ordinary country girl. Yeah, you Now who's gonna stop me? Speed. Okay, now that's how you do it. Hey, all the IT guys, take notes. Make you a little snack at work. Heat that sausage up on that dear CPU. That can't be good for it. <laughs> <laughs> Why is that cheese sticking together, though? Hey. You mean? <coughs> never had You know what's crazy? The worst part about that meal is the cracker because it has seed oil in it. Don't eat seed oil. Dude, crackers aren't made out of seeds. They're made out of crack. Now, this is a good one. I like the sound on this one. I think the joke is that he's going to eat the girl he brought to his house. Oh, I thought it was that he can't hear anything because he's deaf. <laughs> Fifteen thousand watching. We need to do some shit like this. Maybe we should just do that, honestly. Go live on TikTok and scream. <laughs> Have you seen all the NPC shit they're talking about? I haven't watched any of it. You really haven't? I swear to God I haven't. All I know I saw one today, I was it's like on, Thank you for the ice cream. I, dude, I saw Thank you for the ice cream, dude. Oh, heart. Love you. <laughs> heart, love I you. I saw one. Thank you for the ice cream. I saw Ooh, one. Hungry. I saw one today. I was scrolling and a live popped up and it was some fucking dude. It was like a 30 year old man and he was just like, mmm, corn. Mmm, corn. I'm Lion like, roar. Lion roar. I'm like, who the fuck is watching this? Dude, it's Who the nuts. fuck? It is insane. There's one story of a lady who was doing it and. Her daughter was like yelling or something, asking for her, and she told her she like stopped doing it real quick, went back to being a normal human somewhat, and told her to like shut up and go to her room or something. <laughs> it's insane. Yeah, I'm serious. She like tells the kid to like go. She said something about like I'll I'll give the dog away if you don't make the dog be quiet. <laughs> like live on camera. That's awesome. We need to bring back real live streams for people getting their head blown off and shit. So that was real. And this isn't? No. You need to bring back the good stuff. I think we could just do something like that. We, we don't need, need, to, we need, need to, to watch bring back AI sponge. We should just stand, sit here, and just... Yeah, Pinky Doll. That's what it was, yeah. Pinky Doll. Yeah. Okay. It's it's torturous, honestly. But she's just like... <laughs> Thanks for the prime! No, she's like... She literally sits here and she's like... Ooh, ice cream. Ooh, ice cream. Lion Roar. Thank you for the heart. Like, uh, but I'm talking about like, they do that shit for like eight hours. That's amazing. I think I'd rather just sit here and me uh, and you count down from 10 and just hit each other with a fucking hammer in the head. <laughs> and whoever's the last standing wins. But see, that's Thank the you for the hammer. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for the tier one. Thanks for the chainsaw. I, dude. Thank you for the dagger. I just don't get it. I don't, I don't know. I guess there's 10,000 people who are so fucking stupid they're sitting there watching that. I'd rather watch people shit. 
I'd rather shit in my hand. I'd rather the watch fucking run. Fart King Kyle or whatever his name is. The guy who farts and stuff. I like. I'm that. sure you know who that is. I like that kind of content personally. It's just wild that people sit there and like. To the people sending things, I don't get it. You're sending like a a lion that costs twenty dollars, so that she says lion. Like, she said it 80 times. Do you think she won't say it? I just think there's people beating off. It's fucking off. insane. There's just probably people beating off to it or something. That's even crazy. But, like, she I, does, does even look good. I just don't think you under. I don't think you appreciate beating off on uh, NPC TikTok, TikTok Live. NPC Maybe TikTok. not. I'm not as fucking developed in my AI brain yet. <laughs> God <laughs> damn, look at that GPU. Your, your, <laughs> your update hasn't come in yet. <laughs> Look at the graphics card on that one. Thanks God for damn. The, <laughs> thanks for the corn. <laughs> yeah, mama. I like to shit on her ram. <laughs> How many terabytes you got, woman? He <laughs> ran over his own groceries. You know, now you know, nigga. Dude, that stuff was so good, though. Don't even pretend like that. Styrofoam? I used styrofoam. to love it. Dude, styrofoam with a little, little mac and cheese seasoning? God damn, I just started eating the table. That shit was so good. Just put it in a bowl and, and mix it all together. Yeah, put the whole plate in there. Eat some of the table. Fucking <laughs> lick the floor. I used to love licking the school floor. Amen. Got me slobbering like a fucking... <laughs> <laughs> they got Bionicle Jesus. Mega Christ. The Father, the Son, and the Spirit all in one. <laughs> this feels like a fever dream, right? What the fuck is this? Just be making anybody. <laughs> this is how Ethan got baptized. <laughs> Amen. Hold on in Missouri, bro. What the? Did my bag just rip? And my water bottle's running away from me. Oh, no. <laughs> oh. <laughs> R.I.P. in the chat. Dude, how did it Thanks go that Thanks for the water far? bottle. <laughs> Thanks for the water bottle. <laughs> and he's like, hey, this shit good for you. And I look at this. Look at this country. Oh, my God, bro. And Timmy's like, I love banana pops. Sus. Oh, my God. That is the biggest pumpkin I've ever seen. Jeez. Oh, you got a pumpkin too? It's Christmas is coming early, huh? You need help with that? I think you need help with that. Listen, I got you. I got you, sweetheart. I got you. Thank you. Anyways, back to what I was trying to tell you.
Oh, Albert Katstein. <laughs> I would take the biggest... That looks like a good-looking cat right there, for real. I would take the biggest fucking frying pan I could find and just smack it over the skull seven times. Exactly. That yeah. You think it would let you... You couldn't hit it seven times. That thing would be gone. <laughs> that looks like a little mouse mixed and with I, a bear. I would get some... That doesn't even look like a cat. I would get some, uh, some white rice. I would saute that thing. Some you don't saute with rice. What are you talking about? No, I would get I would I would start boiling rice in a pot and then use the frying pan that I killed that thing with. Saute it a little bit with some onion, mix it in the rice and I When eat is that the next cat. media share holes? Yeah, of course you uh, would put it in. Thanks for the ten dollars. Thanks for the ten dollars. The uh, bike would Thanks beer. for the ten dollars. Chumbo. We might do a media share tomorrow. Potentially. <sighs> potentially. 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 The banquet beer. I would smack that thing upside the head with a fucking big metal object. That thing, too. That one would be all right. You wouldn't season? No. You don't need to season any form of cat. That's what all the fur is for. <laughs> That's what it's fur. A banquet beer. <laughs> Them dogs are out around a dog. Are they sitting in the fucking cage? Right? It's called a kennel. I'm not talking about chips. I'm talking about dogs. Damn! I'm so confused. Why is the ear, like, covered <laughs> up? Because they're fucking stupid, dude. And the penis covered. That dog been fighting other dogs. Is this the first video we clicked on? Yeah. <laughs> oh, my God. Hey, thanks for the tier one, Lord <laughs> Far Frog Quad. Yeah! We are hey. two hours later. I'll, I'll be making you all one of them stir fried cataloons. Hey now, you're an all star stir fried cataloon. We got more memes coming up. Hey, brother, since you're sliding on over there, oh, no, no. won't you hand your boy a little brewski? Huh? Hand your brother a little brewski? <laughs> I'll drink one. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Dude, get this motherfucker, bro. What? I don't know. Which one do you want? I don't give a fuck. <laughs> hand me a little brewski. Hey, Chad, hand me a little brewski. Hey, thanks for the five dollars. <laughs> <laughs> Your stepmom used to date the lead singer of Saliva. It was a roadie. <laughs> That's fucking awesome. Wow. That is fucking awesome. Uh. Hell yeah, dude. 848 on a Tuesday. You already know the deal. Where's everybody watching from? Opinions on eating lead paint. Lead paint chips are delicious, Chumbo. Highly recommend 10 out of 10. FDA approved. Kettle cooked. Those are really good. That's more for upper class, though. If you can't get the kettle cooked lead paint chips, you know you you can settle for just the uh, standard sour cream and onion, though. Money. Minnesota, California, Missouri, Ireland, Antarctica. I don't believe you. What are the coordinates of the last place you took a big ass shit? Put them in the chat. Mama, sweet home. <laughs> <laughs> ABS. Where's Obama shitting? We need a new acronym for today. <laughs> Tell me where Obama is shooting. Thanks for the ten dollars. Customer states. Appreciate it, Lizzie. Customer states is a good idea. Ugh. I hate that sound. A lot of people going, oh, or smacking, smacking, smack bit. You don't know how to work these things, dude. You gotta you be it, pipers. You gotta be able to bench 500 on a dead leg and be able to move these things down. You gotta squat two spark plugs. <laughs> Dude, it, it actually looks like. <laughs> it looks like. It really does look like you're gonna like fix something. 
I you can. Gotta, you got to fix the deck at I the house? I can fix your attitude in about two seconds. Buddy, I need my roof replaced. <laughs> Why don't you put them things back These on and fix it? called the attitude adjusters. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to change your gender, boy. <laughs> I think your tent's too dark. <laughs> All right. Well, loss of human life in the first clip of the video. All right. We'll be doing the skipping. <laughs> A little too offensive there. Twitch staff, listen. Why don't you suck my ass? Go ahead, ban me. I'll go to kick. I don't give Everybody's left-handed. Everybody's left-handed. Alaskan bull slut. Hey, thanks for the five dollars. Arabian beetle sperm. <laughs> I we need a new one. We need a new one. <laughs> All right. What is uh? Yeah, think of a real acronym though. FBI. Soup. Can you please explain to my boss why I'm not getting anything done at work? Thanks. Thanks for the nine dollars eleven cents. Uh, because hey, you're a listen, bad worker and you're overpaid. Joe Mama seven four four three's boss. Why don't you just fuck off already? All right. Give Joe Mama some space. Give Joe Mama... Inflation's a, up. Give Joe Mama a $20 raise and uh, give him three months vacation time and fuck off. How about that? Take him false, I said that. Amen. <laughs> I suck at everything. Thanks for the dollar danger noodles. Uh, Booga, thanks for the five months. Sniffer, thanks for the prime. <laughs> Mongol Me blood infection. <laughs> Meet V. Lewis. Thanks for the three months. Ford Bussy Inspector. <laughs> Every fucking name in this chat is outstanding. There's not a single username that sucks. I love it. <laughs> Fecal Bowel Incinerator. <laughs> French B. <be> incriminated. <laughs> Wait, what is that one? I can't even read it. Finish. Slow down. Spots. Fabulous bull intercourse. <laughs> Slow down! Free big insects. Backslash <laughs> comment section when this video comes out a month from now. Fuckable Incorporated. Is Ethan sexier as the banana or the cat maid? <laughs> Me personally, I say banana. Shut the hell up! Oh, I had sex with both of them, Rip Tide. Uh, <laughs> thanks for the $10. I'd say the cat maid. Double cheeked up. Thanks for the prime. Someone just typed anal cavity gaps. <laughs> what are you uh, typing? <laughs> fat bones incineration. Insemination. I can't read. Fat booty. All right. <laughs> uh, fungal penis infection. <laughs> Franklin ball inhaled. Florida butter injection. <laughs> I just got an FBI done. Got a Florida butter injection. <laughs> Franklin ball inhale. <laughs> Fat boner incest. Fornication beyond intention. <laughs> oh, the FBI will get you. I can't read that quick. Slow down. Oh, uh, slow down. Fat beetle insertion. Fuckable bones incel. <laughs> Flapjack Bowser. Ron DeSantis. Foreign Bush Inspector. <laughs> Forensic Bob Canatellian. Why are y'all going so fast? <laughs> I can't read like that. So st All right, no more. Hang no on, more. hang on, hang on, hang on. Free bird intro. We're still watching funny <laughs> memes. This. <laughs> That's really good. That is a good one. That's a really good one. <laughs> Free bird intro. All right, that's the winner. Free bird intro. <laughs> I can't stop looking at it. Let's get the chat up on the screen, actually. I don't know why that disappeared. Italian red frog. Like, what are you doing? What are you talking about, buddy? There we go. Chat, y'all are back on the screen. Pardon the interruption. <laughs> All right, we're still watching memes here, guys. This is shit post status, so some shit posty memes. French? Uh. 
Prince of the Prime. 6353 Wantabo, Apartment 6. Yeah. I bet you can't say I like hops without your lips touching. <laughs> this is easy. I like hot. Dude, That's probably true. I saw a, a picture of it, but it was a big ass basketball, and I was thinking, like, I was thinking the same thing, like all the homeless people eating like fucking rotten roadkill, looking up at a fucking big ass basketball. <laughs> they're like eating a fucking day old possum. It's like sunburnt. Like the price of that, they could have had food for ten years. <laughs> we need a big remember- eyeball in Las Vegas. Keep I remember eye. when you called me and said, did you see that they built a massive basketball in Las Vegas? <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know you could make screens that shape. I didn't know that was you possible. You ever been to Planet Hollywood? Dude. I didn't know you could make screens in the shape of a ball sack. <laughs> I'm going to LED little nut. <laughs> I just imagine someone tweaked out and they see an eyeball blinking on the horizon. They're like, oh my fucking God, I finally got fentanyl. (laughs) Dude, this caption is wild. It's very true, though. (laughs) Don't you notice how I get quiet when there's... What the hell? You never smelled a really good pie on a windowsill? <laughs> no. Uh, yeah, I thought cool. it was window seal. Uh, Is it window sill? Don't ask me questions about windows. You know I just lick them and go about my day. I hate windows happen. Mailbox. <laughs> we know how to ride oh. in style. Nice work, people. Let's run some BRs. Can I be beaten? Yes. <laughs> what was he sitting on the oh, second floor? There's one right there. All right, what am I gonna get? What am I gonna get? What? Oh, nothing happened. Oh no! Not again! My PC. Swag shirt goes so hard. <laughs> LA Beast is a fucking legend. I love LA Beast so much. from who you truly are. Is that eggs? Ah! 
I cannot be safe. <laughs> Where's everyone going? Bingo? <laughs> My child. Oh no! <laughs> These are good. Based on a true story. I remember this channel. I like <laughs> Pogfish. Beautiful. I'll never remember it. It's two words. It's two of your favorite things. That was the that was a joke. If <laughs> <laughs> what's so funny? <laughs> Yo, yo, oh. fire me up. Oh, God. The banquet beer. Oh, fuck. It's the banquet. <laughs> My little bottle. I hope we'll use legal calibers and magazines you while Ford I'm ball sack inspector. Going. Bingo. <laughs> My child will use legal calibers and magazines while hunting. <laughs> I've always thought, dude, if you just put a propane tank around a bunch of corn. What? I'm just saying, bro. What are you talking about? What? What the fuck are you saying? I'm just saying. What are you saying? What? What? What the Dude, fuck are you saying? If you just, I'll let you finish that sentence. <laughs> I'm just saying. <laughs> what are you talking I'm about? I'm just saying. <laughs> uh, I did not see that coming, bro. <laughs> if you know, you know. I'm going to leave it at that. He said, huh? <laughs> if you know, you know. What are you talking about? <laughs> what? I'm not going to. I'm not going to. What uh, is that? I'm not going to delve into that one. You don't even have an, uh, an ending to that sentence. I know you don't. <laughs> yes, I do. It ends with fucking boom. <laughs> what are you talking Dude, about? You just put like some... moonshine? No. For hunting. You put... <laughs> oh. Okay. It was relevant to the meme we were watching. I love um, when I have to explain what, when everything. Satan and God were talking about claymores. Yeah. <laughs> it was so relevant. <laughs> you got me there. <laughs> Country boys don't use claymores. We use propane and <laughs> corn. <laughs> you put propane next to some corn. That's all I'm saying. <laughs> the fuck are you talking? <laughs> Akimbo waffles gets it. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> this oh. page. Oh fuck, so good. This channel is good. Oh my god, <laughs> dude, let's go. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, we need to start carrying around stickers like that. Yeah. Just putting them in the most random places on people's vehicles on, on the down. bottom of a urinal. The bottom of a urinal? <laughs> Somebody would see it one day. <laughs> okay. The urinal repair man <laughs> might get a, a good laugh. He might need a laugh. I They'll probably be decayed propane, by then. Propane accessories. Inside of a toilet so the plumber can get a good laugh. He deals with a lot of shit. Thanks for the $10. Oh Come man, that's probably how they that's how they always do it. Is it? That's why there's always a gallon of mayo uh. when you make chickens. That's like a um a zombine. Right? <laughs> zombine, get it? Oh 
batteries fire! Fire! Oh my god. <laughs> when I with you I don't wanna be with you. Can you, can you come back? Get off you, brother. Get off. Hilarious. Oh my Once god. Bussy, thanks for the ten dollars. Boss means boy, thanks for the full months. Oh my god. Oh fuck yeah, he left me a chicken uh, Okay, hey oh y'all, no, you got the controls. I need to grab I swear to god, get your hand out of my controls. I am trying to save us. <laughs> What is this? Look out, John! <laughs> Look at our gun track! Get <laughs> your hands off my joystick! In a recent video, I heard you say that crane operators are legally allowed to operate while intoxicated. Well, as an ex-crane operator, I can say that that is false. <laughs> Thank you for the clarification. Thanks for the twenty dollars. Listen, you got a shitty boss. Underpaid and overworked. Underpaid, not drunk enough. That's what I always say. Oh, 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 oh my God! I guess they're closed. Oh wait, <laughs> silly me. Pool. <laughs> Go ahead. What is love? Baby, don't hurt me. Don't hurt me. <laughs> what a dark video. That's amazing. <laughs> There's no peanuts in North Korea. You're safe. <laughs> is that because oh. they were made in America? Peanuts or the North Koreans? George Washington Carver. All right. Come on, Michael. It's not real. It's not real. Look. Ahí estamos con la casi cari. Where's the frying pan? No, así de literal. That one, you just can put a fire underneath and roast it. I got the ray gun! Oh. Twinkle, twinkle, little star How I wonder what you are Up above the world so high <laughs> <laughs> I, will, I will try enjoy your language. I don't know how to start this. I bought a pran a pran of Kingles. Post an animal that starts with the last letter of the previous post. I'll start. Bearded vulture. Eagle. 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 Fuck you! Get a glass of water. <laughs> <laughs> Bow down! Give me 
ゃにゃしゅうにゃにゃとのにゃらびでにゃくにゃくにゃにゃくにゃにゃはんにゃにゃにゃにゃにゃにゃにゃにゃにゃにゃにゃにゃにゃにゃにSpeechless. I know. I feel like I like got high the last ten minutes. <laughs> like I, you snuck me an edible. <laughs> We're just vibing with the memes. So good. I'm、oh. not gonna lie, they are pretty good. Usually, I'm gonna shit myself and die, but I'm actually enjoying them. I'm having a great time.、Oh. <laughs> Chat, how's everyone doing? Oh man. Chat, where the fuck is everyone watching from? Ah! What are we up to? These memes are gangster. That's correct. I'm peeling. <clears throat> Utah. <laughs> Why is that a Facebook page? <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> oh fuck! Beautiful, <laughs> Mufasa, Mufasi. What? <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> oh my god! Oh, these are so good. Fuck. <laughs> Indoor carp farmer. <laughs> oh. oh. <laughs> Bro, I have no words for any of that, dude. Oh man, I have no words. We're watching another one of these guys' videos. <laughs> <laughs> Snoop Doggy Dog. Leave a like if you like to like、oh、if you leave likes. It's weed. That's a lot of dead weed. Fuck. All right, everybody.
It's time for a little TikTok cringe. What do you say, everybody? Huh? We're cringing on TikTok. Guys, listen. We would not keep watching this unless you people stopped fucking asking for it. All right? Everyone's asking for this shit. Don't even lie. You're lying to yourself. Everyone wants to watch some TikTok cringe. You're all right? lying to yourself if you say you don't like it. It's you. It's your fault. Blame yourself. It's your fault. Blame yourself. If you're watching on YouTube and you want more of this for whatever godforsaken reason, boy, <laughs> uh, please be sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. Leave a... I want to see taco in the comments. I like that. Taco. If you don't know how to spell it, use the Google. Taco. Taco. Put a taco emoji in there. Yeah. All right, TikTok cringe. What do we say, everybody? Let's do it. Yeah. Let's this see what we got. Play Rust. Reddit and TikTok cringe compilation. TikToks to give me secondhand embarrassment. Let's do it. Another point that's gonna piss y'all off. Rihanna is no better than Jeff Bezos. And you're probably like, but she donates. Y'all don't understand how much money a billion dollars is. Like a billion dollars could probably solve world hunger. So it does not matter that she donates a hundred thousand here, a hundred thousand there. That's a fucking tax write-off. Just because she's black doesn't make it better. Another thing, when we look at diversity and companies, this is where I check out for the we night. need to look past Good the night, fact y'all. that the people at the forefront of the company <laughs> Good night. are diverse. Thanks for $10. Because, of course, the models are black. Come on! Who's, who's her VP? Who's sitting at the board meetings? White people. It's all a scam to get you to buy into the product, and I just don't buy into it. In my eyes, Beyonce, Rihanna, and Jeff Bezos... A three-headed fucking monster. They're all the same people. Oh, yes, 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 yes,
that orange couch is literally the knockoff of my orange couch and that's my wallpaper which is fine anyone can buy it bitch people did not like what the fuck she posted people commenting like girl you're a diy channel like why girl, huh make it make sense she took the video down then posted this on her story i posted a video today that i should have continued to handle privately this isn't what i want my page to be about so i removed it liar i'm passionate about giving credit to designers and creators and i wish that could have been the case here when it was first addressed anyway she kept getting hate and then the creator she was talking about decided to come out with a video this is her response to that video I'm like not gonna be, I'm not gonna come on here and like cry and be like, feel sorry for me. But I'm, I guess I'm just like really disappointed because oh I really genuinely like this creator. And she was like one of the first people I followed on here that I was really like, wow, like this decor style is so cool. It is so colorful and so fun. And just really encouraged me to like actually express myself. And, um, we have talked over message and stuff and like she was so nice and and about two months ago she did ask me not to do any of her diys which like i totally understood and i was like that's totally fine like i really do get it um and it was just like a really pleasant interaction like i said she was so nice <laughs> and i didn't not know like we had issues or that she was feeling like this Okay, so after that all i'm saying is just think about like 100 years ago 200 years ago like people are doing their best to not die because they cut their fucking finger on like a rusty pipe or something or like they accidentally they were going to hit you know hunt a fish and they accidentally cut their foot <laughs> and they're trying not to fucking lose their foot you know and they just see this video about two people arguing over green and blue colors on the wall in the kitchen <laughs> Can you imagine, honestly? I would be pretty pissed if you copied my cave paintings. <laughs> the Egyptians are like, I painted that shit! The Egyptians and the Aztecs got beef. <laughs> they got big Listen, beef. Listen, we invented a triangle. <laughs> Y'all motherfuckers he ripping off the like triangle. He conceived in a homeless camp piss shoe. He also looks like if the thumb from Spy Kids and Kid Rock had a baby. I love you, though, baby. No one asked you, ball sack, the great. <laughs> Shut the hell up. Thanks for the $10. No one asked you a damn thing. <laughs> There's drama and everything, dude. I know. I'm just saying. I get it. Maybe back in the day they were beefing over what kind of arrow you made or whatever. But I'm just saying, you know, they were trying not to die from malaria. You know, like women were dying at birth, giving birth to their child. They were dying. Here we are now. It's like I painted my wall blue before you did. Don't paint your wall blue. <laughs> blue and green are my colors. You know what I mean? Like, dude. Yeah. It's, yeah. It's, it's very, insane. It's petty. Why do we need to be so petty? I, I invented blue and green. <laughs> <laughs> it's just crazy. I would love to show those people this video. Uh, like, did that... She's like, I'm not gonna cry, but like, I really liked her decor. Imitation is the sincerest form of flattery. So, this this girl should look at this and say, oh, wow, there's another girl who obviously enjoys what I do. And is trying to recreate it in her own way. Right. And and not be such a bitch about it. Well, especially when you are a when you are a DIY decor. Yeah, it's like you make shit for people to get inspiration and basically copy. Yeah. Right. Yeah. That's the whole point of your things. Exactly. Sensei mop, imitation crab meat. You don't hear the crabs bitching about imitation crab meat. You don't hear because crabs are must be more evolved. They're smarter. They, they are, understand. dude. Shit keeps evolving into crab. Look it up. All these, all these things keep evolving into crabs. I saw, I saw a lizard turn into a crab in my yard the other day. It's just a part of nature. People just evolve and. Well, lizards are gonna make a TikTok and be like, "Motherfuckers want to be crabs when we've been crabs." <laughs> <laughs> She thought fucking say they like salt. The story was just gonna clear everything up, and she can go back to post normal. No, then people started commenting, "Can we put the wallpaper up we buy from you, or do we need permission to do that too?" Ooh. And hell in on this story Got because on. she didn't bother to apologize on a video. But then, the company that sells her wallpaper, Auto Studio, <laughs> dropped her. Got him. Saying, as a small business, we strive to support and uplift artists, creators, and DIYers. We are disappointed in and do not stand behind the video that was posted by T B Bop regarding Karen Joy earlier this week. It goes against our values and at those of DIY community. As such, effective immediately, the Tay Bebop collections will no longer be available for purchase. We will be reaching out to those who have pending orders for these collections and next steps. That's what happens when your head gets so fucking big and can't even fit in a Ford. That's all I'm saying. <laughs> 
Just shut the hell up. You don't have to be a dickhead. Girl, now that her bag is affected, she said, let me make an apology video. That's where this final video comes in. And I can't post it because it's three fucking minutes long. I will repost it. So I'm going to post she it on my channel. She cries and says sorry. So we get it. Go on my page. And you know. Her followers were not letting up. Comments on the apology video are, I have a legit question. Is this because you lost your wallpaper line? Summary, I lost my wallpaper line and I'm getting hate. So now I have to apologize. <laughs> Jen takes the cake. I feel like a ukulele would have to let him wear, honestly. <laughs> Bitch, what do you think? Let me know in the comments. Again, I'm going to post her video after this. First that was actually time not ever a bad catching video. a stream live from you guys. Love to laugh. You guys make the desire to watch you live larger than the hairs on my asshole. Keep it up, brothers. Sincerely, Oklahoma Honky. Thank you, Oklahoma Honky. Thanks for the $10. Big appreciation time for you, guys. How hot is it out there in Oklahoma? It's just about 130 degrees over here in South Carolina, baby. You are my Oklahoma. <laughs> 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 I like this one. Is that a Metallica shirt? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Come on, everybody. Roll me up and smoke me when I die. Hell yeah. Oh, it's so, so annoying. This dude is wasted. Banned from the bar, recording butts. <laughs> Can't Just immediately record walking on the butts. street. Okay. Be in this room. I've seen this one. This is. This is. This is hard. Thirty-two dollars from Brian Cassidy. Incredible Brian probably door of time skip. Here's some more money. Put this donation towards Final Fantasy Adventure. Is the best Final Fantasy. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for the five gifted. Hold on. I think I may have seen this. I think I showed this one to you. I can't wait to see this right now, though. Here, I'll turn the volume off if I can. Final Fantasy. <laughs> so this will probably be my last chance to tell a story really quick. Um, I don't know if you guys noticed, but I've been knitting the entire time I've been here. Um, I actually learned to knit from my grandmother. Can you stop? Okay, but, um... So, a little backstory. This guy that is dressed up like Link from Legend of Zelda is... <laughs> Sorry. He is, uh... He is trying you're gonna to... you're going to say Legolas. <laughs> <laughs> he is trying to... He's from the Squire. He is trying to speed run... <laughs> A video game live on Twitch that is for charity. This right. is a, a charity event, and the girl that is knitting in the back decides to make the whole event about her. Answer a couple years ago, and there's actually pretty much a 50% chance I'm going to die of cancer. My dad's entire side of his family has died of cancer. Today. And so there are all of those is that Cosmo? This blue is the last blue of my grandmother's that I'm ever gonna have to knit with. So it's a black queen. He looks so annoyed. He's like, why? How do we need to do this right now? Yeah. Got $100 here from Matthew Beasley. 
You guys are doing something amazing here. This is my first marathon and I'm hooked. Please put this money towards everything, anything that needs it. Thanks very much for your donation, Matthew. Really appreciate it. I need it. I need that. So she doesn't have cancer? No. She just said, I'll probably get it. I would really prefer if you would be quiet. This is another good one. Oh, I, I, I know I showed one. you this one, yeah. Oh, no. Fuck, I, I, it didn't show the full thing. Oh. Yeah, that one's a good one too, though. Ryan about to get fucked up. <laughs> Moonshine Wizard, thanks for the $5. This is why it's more dangerous to drive than it is to fly. Because you could be driving by someone like this on the road. But what no, if, someone like this could never fly. What if, what if this is the pilot, though? Mm, no. No. I know it's just not a thing. I know people like this who want to be pilots. That's a funny one. But want to be and is is different. <laughs> just why I never got my license. <laughs> It's worse without music. It is. I'd rather hear fucking three days of grace. I don't want to hit, you know, hear my own thoughts. Keep up the good work. Thinking Still about how... waiting on the soup and Ethan body pillows so I can give them my monkey milk. That's actually a good idea. We should look into that. <laughs> monkey milk or body pillows? Body pillows. <laughs> oh, I'm not on board anymore. I was on board with the monkey milk. Thanks. You do the monkey milk. I'll do the body pillow. You can milk the pillow. First ever monkey pillow with the milk in it. It's like a water bed. <laughs> why has no one ever made a milk bed? I can definitely tell you why. Yeah, it'd probably turn into cheese pretty quickly. No, because milk's more expensive than water. <laughs> it would be 2%. Nah, go ahead. You could refill it. Once the milk expires, you could just refill it with fresh milk. You could buy a cow and just keep it in your room. But think about it, dude. People hit milk all the time to turn it into cheese. You could just be humping your fucking milk bed and make your own cheese. Thanks for the $10, Mr. Quick Sniper. You could actually just slaughter a cow and sleep on that. Why don't people do that? Why don't people ever kill a bear and just drag it into their room and use it as a bed? Answer me that. Riddle me this. Why don't, why not kill a bear? Can you shut up? Why not kill a bear and sleep on it? You could. I would sleep inside of it. I'd climb up in the bus. Bear Grylls slept inside of a camel. Why didn't Bear Grylls kill himself and sleep inside of his own body? Why doesn't Bear Grylls kill a bear and sleep on a bear? Why doesn't Grylls? thing that's been really, really annoying me lately. This is going to be, it's Let's do an ASMR them, stream. You single want mom version. So something that's been getting under my skin is men not understanding what it means to be a single mom. So Let's as learn. a single mom, a single working mom, I have my plate full to the maximum, right? I don't have free time. The time that I do have free, I just want to relax. So one, I get it. I'm single. Yes. Do I want to date? Sure. If I meet the right person, right? But if you invite me out for a dinner um, or drinks, especially during the weeknight, come on. You know I have things to do. I'm sure you have things to do the next day. I have a child to take care of. I can't just go out late at night just whenever, right? Um, so you have to take that into consideration. So if you're really going to invite Where's me out, Zuck one, Monk Man. make it worth my Love time. Love the content and everything you all do. Keep kicking ass and taking names. Yee yee, Marika. Thank you for the $10, baby. Appreciate it. And what do I mean by make it worth my time? Joe's just don't invite me out to dinner and drinks. Get creative. Invite me out for an activity. Do something different. Do something that's going to be worth my time and effort. So beg you. I am we need to beg you. No. Beg me to come out and Listen. have everything planned and pay for it. Fellas. I am the queen of England. Fellas. You're a shit boy. If you're trying to hook up with a single mom, take her Barbie Jeep racing down a mountain. All right. Make it interesting. And bring the kid. Yeah, bring the kid, put him in the fucking Barbie Jeep, and throw him down a mountain. Don't buckle the kid. Ethan looks like the kind of guy who could peg Lizzo sideways all night. 
not because he's strong, but because he has the ability to get so fucking wasted he wouldn't feel the crushing pain of a three-ton whale sitting on his pelvis. Love you, Ethan. Frank, we used to be friends. <laughs> Frank, what thank, happened to you, Frank? Thank you, you for right. ten dollars. We used to be friends. <laughs> thank you mm. for giving Dallas money to talk absolute dog shit about me. Appreciate that. <laughs> time out of my evening to meet with you to go and enjoy your company you know to see how things work if we're i love compatible, this though, really i'm making an effort so i expect you to make an effort so i no no no. she just said come up with the idea be creative and then she said i'm making the effort i'm confused can you uh, do you know the answer i, I don't, don't know i don't know anything Fair enough. I mean, I, I should have known Don't that. just assume that I'm going to be able to drop off my child somewhere because most likely I'm not. So unless you're offering to pay for the babysitter, I'm not going on that date. Also, and offer to pay for the babysitter. That's going to make me more receptive to want to go and spend my time with you. And another thing, do not just assume that you can invite me and my daughter out. No, I do not introduce my daughter to guys. That's a no-no. So... There's she seems that. very and also, simple and easy to be don't with. Don't just assume that you're going to invite me out for drinks and I'm going to show up. Um, what makes you think that I'm going to put my safety in jeopardy by drinking and driving? So unless you're going to offer to pick me up and drop me off or Uber me there and back, it's a no on the drinks during the week. So moral of the story is, come on, guys, if she's a single mom, she already has a lot on her plate, so don't add to her plate. Don't make her life more stressful. Don't make her plan out the date that you want to take her Ethan on. Dates like single moms that's not going to happen. The kids. So all I'm going to say is do better. And to everyone asking me out on freaking dates lately, literally, if the shoe fits, then it fits. Okay. So I got to say. I can't imagine why she's a single mom. It yeah, really dude. blows my mind. I, I don't understand how that's possible. How's that possible? Why don't you just invite them over and play Xbox Live? I'd rather get dropped off in the middle of the ocean and have to find my way to the moon. Hey, single mom, come over and play some Xbox Live. Hey, single mom, if you beat me in Fortnite, I'll beat you in Fortnite. Hey, single mom, look at these pit vipers. <laughs> hey, single mom, let me take you out to Pizza Hut and then fuck it sack. <laughs> No, that's fuck shit. Don't forget about it. Fuck shit, South Carolina. <laughs> I grew up in fuck shit, South Carolina. <laughs> Take a wild guess of what we did there. Pizza Hut. <laughs> Dude, do you know that there's a town in South Carolina? Listen to this. This is for real. All right. You know what I'm about to say? I don't know. It's called... You ready? I'm ready. Ketchup Town. <laughs> I'm being dead serious. Oh, the long lost cousin of Tomato Town. <laughs> <laughs> They're going to put that one on the map, boy. It's right next to Mayonnaise City, baby. <laughs> it's also next to Penn Island. <laughs> Ketchup it's like, Town. It's in Relishville. <laughs> no, seriously. Next to Hamburger. There is a place called Ketchup Town. I'm There's not joking. There's a place called Hamburg. And it's spelled Ketchup Town. They don't Town. make burgers there. I'm being for real. <laughs> Tater City. <laughs> Ketchup Town. <laughs> there really is, bro. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck me, dude. Nah. I'm going to get a relish gov. <laughs> uh. Mustard opia. I want to go to Bitch Lake. <laughs> we also have a uh, lake of oh. alcohol and drug abuse. Oh, that, no. Yeah. Or something like that. No, it's, it's, uh, it's, yeah, it's something, <laughs> it's like alcohol and drug awareness lake or something like that. No, it says abuse. Does it? Yeah. <laughs> alcohol That's and drug abuse That's where I live, baby. Lake. <laughs> you know I live there. <laughs> If you bathe in that, you're hammered. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Ketchup Town is real, bro. I ain't lying. Lake of Blind Men. <laughs> Coleslaw County. <laughs> Coleslaw <laughs> County. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, my God. I know that there is a... Uh, 
Hot dog house. <laughs> uh, anyways, I know Peruvian puff pepper pavilion. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there really is drug and alcohol abuse lake or whatever. <laughs> Jalapeno hideaway. <laughs> oh, <laughs> Captain Rock Cox pirate voyage. Oh. <laughs> All right. Salt settlement. <laughs> Pepper Palace. <laughs> Chick-fil-A County. Barracose Baines Village. <laughs> <laughs> Chemo Keep. Baloney Building. Up. Baloney and Boulevard. Down. It's in the celery and settlement. Please come down. <laughs> ah! I did not don't. mean to do that. No, no, don't. No, don't. <laughs> don't. Whoops. Yeah. All right. You know what? This is a good time to transition. I'm cutting my dick off. No, but for real. <laughs> I was going to make that joke. Um, you don't have a tissue anywhere? Uh, I just I got, dumped that in my nose. Here you go. I'm not doing that. Is this not good enough? Blow your nose on it. You, you really don't? Bitch. Blow your nose on that monkey business paper, you fucker. All right. <laughs> Two activities. Hemorrhoid handler. In Indiana, we have a chocolate store called Uranus Fudge Factory. When I was waking up, they said thanks for picking Uranus. <laughs> That's awesome. Uranus. Uranus Fudge, Fudge Factory. Thanks for the $10, Silver Slayer. Ted Cruz Township. <laughs> thanks for the prime. You want something? Uh, no, I'm good, dude. I, I gotta piss... But this is a good time to transition. Speaking of uh, people running on all fours, um, I saw uh, I saw a man. Uh, I've seen different articles. I ain't never believed you. But apparently, he paid sixteen thousand to twenty thousand dollars to make himself look like a real dog. Um, so, if any of you guys are interested in that. Yeah, let me just show you guys this real quick. I have it pulled up. I'm watching it right now. Oh, here it is. Oh shit. We'll start with this one. This is from Times of India. Are you not going to piss? I'm gonna piss after this. I'm a little. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. This is a man who paid a lot of money to look like a dog. This is real confirmed. I've never seen this. You haven't? No. Hyper-realistic costume. All right, this video kind of sucks. Let's go to the... This is the actual upload by the guy, I believe, who uh, bought this outfit. Very good Halloween costume. Amen. Amen. <laughs> People don't even know, do they? No, probably not. I love that the real dogs are always like, Motherfucker ain't real! 
Like Skinwalker. <laughs> Skinwalker. <laughs> yes, literally Skinwalker, two words. Hello. Oh my god. I know, it's fucking creepy. Duck down a little bit. Show him. Show him the dog waving. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Look at that. Look at his paw. That is fucking weird, bro. <laughs> I would love for another dog just to come up and start just humping the ever-loving shit a out of it. A Doberman comes out of nowhere and just bites his head off. <laughs> <laughs> Put him into a pack of wolves. Yeah, 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 yeah. You could Why is that lady hiding behind the chair? She's probably scared. <laughs> Succulent Chinese meal. <laughs> yeah, let's go. Let's skip forward. Why yeah. was she hiding behind that, though? It's when he met more real dogs. They could be real. I don't know. <laughs> yeah. I don't know anymore. I, I'm going to fucking shoot every it's dog It's actually I just see. a three-year-old who had a dream of being a dog. <laughs> <laughs> imagine this guy was... The parents paid for the surgery. Imagine this guy was... Wearing this costume and just walked in the road, and a fucking jacked up truck ran him over and just kept driving. <laughs> <laughs> just fucking nailed him and kept driving. I don't do. Apparently, he can't even walk in the road. He's on a fucking wagon. Look at him. He's like a disabled dog. <laughs> I want to know why that lady was hiding behind <laughs> that chair, though. Well, she was scared of this. No, I don't think so. It's like that was weird, bro. That's the weird part in all this. I mean, a lot is going on in the fucking picture, but, like, why was she, like, ducking down like she's, like, Secret Service? I mean, this lady's... Maybe it's, like, this the Prime Minister of Japan. This lady's dressed up like <laughs> fucking Dr. Evil. I don't know. That's what I'm saying. Maybe she's got a couple There's two eight. people in the trench coat, apparently. <laughs> she's got armed security in there in case the little dog wants a little hump. All I'm saying is they're wheeling this fucking fake dog around, and there's, like, a little Chinese lady stuck behind the bench, like, hiding... Like she was like secret service. I don't get it. <laughs> I'm confused. <laughs> Everyone is skeptical. <laughs> the dogs are like, is anyone fucking seeing this? <laughs> I love that the dogs that aren't even used to one another are like ganging up. Like, what the fuck is like, this thing right here? <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Oh. Do you think she has to pick up his shit? It's a good question. A little doggy bag. So fucking weird, bro. He's hiding from the FBI. I love that they had to wheel him around. I like that his mouth moves, too. I bet it smells so bad in there. I bet it smells like fucking turd cum. The swass, dude. His piss is just his swass coming out. Look at the dogs, dude. Dude, that white dog is looking around at everyone like, there is no fucking way y'all believe this is a real dog. <laughs> Look at the, I mean, just the look on it. It's like, y'all don't really, you're not buying this, are you? Do you ya? think he takes his costume to the dry cleaners? Like, how do, how do you clean that? How do you, I want to know the ins and outs of this costume so I can get one. 20K? I think that's what he said, 20K. I love that it's 20K, but they had to wheel him around like he's luggage. <laughs> like, that's hilarious. He's like, now to get wheels put on, I gotta save up. <laughs> Thanks for the five dollars. <laughs> he has like a handler. That's the lady that was hiding. <laughs> he has a nice dog. He is like my new dog. I don't know what he's doing now. Local. I hunted down with the Oklahoma. 
The swamp ass that is produced in Oklahoma is enough to make even the bravest cowboys consider taking up synchronized swimming as a more dignified profession. Beautiful. I feel like I just read a riddle. I know, right? You got a fucking English teacher sending in donations. <laughs> Thanks for the- the Even seven. the bravest cowboys may take up swimming to be dignified in, <laughs> in the hottest times of the year. Thanks for the $7. Amen. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, yeah. Should be named Loco, not Toco. <laughs> That's insane, man. I'm pretty sure this is their channel. I want to I want to be animal. Yeah. They got a whole channel based off of them becoming a uh a dog. Yeah. That's insane. I love they had to cut there. You know, someone's <laughs> yeah. got to come in with a fucking shovel. And yeah. Fucking put him back over. Someone had to grab him, like, gaff him in the side and pick him up. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like it's AI. Do he get a red rocket? That's a good question. I don't know, man. I'm, we're just listening to like jazz music, <laughs> freeform jazz, uh, like a miniature, like Asian man is dressed up as like a border <laughs> collie. Like I, the handler is like behind the camera, probably hiding with her mask. I just don't understand, like, what is the lady there for? So whenever he he gets on the side, she can get the little shovel out and flip him back over. Like he's and, a fucking turtle, dude. He, he <laughs> uh, yeah, he basically is a turtle. You paid twenty k for what? I don't understand. To look like a realistic dog, and he's living out. So his, is he stuck that way? Does he unzip it? I don't know, dude. I, I think he he just shits and pisses. If I had a costume like that, I'm shitting out of the ass of it and pissing out of it like a dog. Same here, dude. There's like a dick hole for me. Yeah, I don't get it. Yeah. I, I'd I try don't it. Know. I'd try it. Does he lick his own ass? Probably. If I was, if I had a dog costume, I would have access to my ass and taters, and I'd be licking them. You think he sniffs people's crotch? I think he. he Maybe could, that was the grand conspiracy. He could get away with it. No one would be like, "Oh, stop that, little Asian man." Let me tell like, you something. They'd be like, oh, it's a little dog. It's fine. Let me explain something to you. If that thing came up to me to sniff me, I'd kick the dog shit out of that thing, dude. <laughs> it probably would shit. I would kick the... Dude, I'd shit on that dog, and I'd kick it across I'm the fucking telling you, sidewalk. He's going to get hit by a truck, and they're going to keep driving. They're gonna, probably he's so. Gonna, he's going to get ran the <laughs> fuck over. Yeah, imagine he runs in that little... Uh, you know that dog show they used to do? Yeah. But they run up the fucking thing. I think they still do that, but yeah, where they jump through the hoops and everything. Of course they do. (laughs) I'm sure they do. They got people that, anyways, yeah. I'm sure they do that. But imagine he entered in and did it. I think he could. That would be discrimination if they didn't let him enter. (laughs) I I agree. I agree. I'd like to see it. There'd be a big argument. (laughs) You mean to tell me? (laughs) (laughs) Oh, man. Oh. No, you're right, though. It's beautiful. I would love to see that thing enter into the, uh, whatever you call that, the dog awards or whatever. Yeah, these people are going to enter in as well. (laughs) That's what I'm saying. Now, these are the people that go to the horse thing. These are the kind of people that when real animals see them, they run up to them and start biting them and growling. (laughs) Yeah, Ah! Yeah, exactly. (laughs) (laughs) Thanks for the $5. (laughs) Look, they're doing it. 
They're, they literally jumped over this That's what thing. I'm saying. That's fucking awesome, dude. That's the same thing as like the... If I was a human dog, I couldn't fucking jump over that. Michael Jordan, bitch. I couldn't jump over that. <laughs> <laughs> this is really impressive. Thanks for the $5. I want to take this. What was the other thing we were talking about? Oh, uh, the lady uh, mad at the decor, the wallpaper. I want to take those two things, put them together, and I want to go back in time. People always want to time travel. They want to go in the future. Take me back 200 years. I want to take this video and the one about the wallpaper, and I want to show it to the motherfuckers <laughs> who are dying from mosquito bites and shit. <laughs> I want to show them this. I want to see what they say. I guarantee it would be the greatest thing you ever did. It would be the best thing ever. Show George Washington this fucker right here jumping over center blocks in the front yard. He'd probably be like, ah, ah, and then pull out a musket and shoot you in the head. <laughs> He'd say, did you know? <laughs> He'd probably be like, what's that machine in the background? I'd be like, that's an 09 Subaru, Bubba. <laughs> <laughs> like, you see that horse you're riding around on? Yeah, imagine that, but times like 100 of them or something. <laughs> <laughs> Take me back to when they was dying from malaria. Take me back to when they was riding midgets around. I want to try it out. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Oh. So why don't we ever get back together? We should. No, I think we should. Are you sure? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Why do you say that? Uh, you crazy as hell. I woke up at night for my for my toes. But that was, but, but that was the reason, too. What the reason for that? You're a liar. Oh, I'm a liar. Because you always get caught in your life. Because two plus two doesn't equal four with you, baby. It's equal to six and something don't add up. So what do you want me to do? She's got a bat in the cave, boy. <laughs> <laughs> she batting 500. <laughs> yeah, I'm not trying to kill me. Well, sometimes... People time come to an end, and I just felt like, but you know what? God came by my side and told me it wasn't time. God said it ain't 1230. So you wouldn't it's want to 1231. <laughs> God said you're going to be a horse. Okay, what about the good things about me? I ain't hear nothing. Put that on some propane. Here we go. Ooh. One take, no tricks. The V34. Color corrector live in action. So here we have Lily and Caleb. Lily, just a mid video me, ad. And now we'll see if we can get any results. Perfect. So we're just going to load this brush up here. Perfect. Make sure we've got a lot on there. And we're going to brush for 30 seconds. Now, the deep violet tone should instantly conceal the yellow stains. Oh, yes. I think that'll do there. Perfect. That'll do, donkey. Lovely. So you might be thinking, a one-off maybe. Let's try the V34 on Caleb here. So if you get sat down there, and we'll just give a quick brush on Caleb. His shirt's the, yeah, wet. his shirt is just soaking wet. He's got this shit all over his lips already. Yeah. This is the fucking 30th attempt on Caleb here. <laughs> You're going to brush him down into the fucking gums. <laughs> You're going to remove his front two teeth. Making sure we're getting some good coverage there. Kind of Good uh, coverage. It looks like a fish. Hey, Caleb, fucking blink. And then we'll just wash that. There we go. Away. Blink twice if you need help. And we get it. You're not used to seeing results quite that quick. One of the reasons why people don't typically let me drink coffee. And it's not because I don't like it. It's because now my husband has to deal with me all the way home and we still have another <laughs> three and a half hours left. <laughs> Get off the rings. Get off the rings! Get off! Get off the rings! Get off! What? Oh. <laughs> Smack her with your spear, lot. <laughs> 
<laughs> smack her with the spear. Upgrade your damage and smack her. <laughs> I don't even know what to say to that. I don't either. Oh. Well, gooey, aren't you? <laughs> oh, wow, what is this stuff, though? What's that? Thrush? Mmm, <laughs> that's quite nice. <laughs> I don't mind that. What an ending to that. Holy shit. The bazooka bu I'm going to piss. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god! Uh, it's time to go take a little piss out. Oh. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, you put a fucking W in your chat if you take any piss. Alright. Open for saliva. Uh... I was... Fucking... <coughs> shitting and pissing myself. Yes, sir. Waiting to tell you guys, and... It would not be possible if it wasn't for you crazy motherfuckers coming out and supporting. So, are and, awesome. and watching the videos. So, if you want to come out and watch us open for fucking the saliva, tickets are available in the description or on my band's Instagram and shit. So, W's in the fucking chat for that one. I, I cannot, dude, saliva is one of those bands that you grow up listening to and, uh, the fact that you're going to open for him, that is insane. Yeah, dude. I don't... That I don't is know. unbelievable. I'm, I'm, not, I'm probably not even going to be able to fucking play. <laughs> I'm going to be so fucking... I'm going to be shaking. It's going to be unbelievable. <laughs> I'm going to be slugging beers. <laughs> I'm going to be fucking going nuts. It's if you be, see me there, you didn't see me there. It's going to be pretty wild. I, I just can't <laughs> believe that that's actually happening. So... Oh. Y'all better be there. If you, if you are anywhere within a 12-hour flight... You better be there. Yeah. W's in the chat for you guys because nothing, this shit would not happen if it wasn't for you fucking absolute maniacs. So you thank you. Awesome for real. Thank you so much. Anyway, I want to watch <sighs> crackheads get chased by a drone. <laughs> <laughs> that shit's going to be insane, bro. Yeah. Oh, man. So, I, you know, we do research for this channel and I've been doing... <laughs> <laughs> analytics the analytics team <laughs> we have been doing research we've been reading i'm actually head of the analytics team and i've been doing my uh research <laughs> cross-referencing we've been using snopes we've been using uh fucking what is the other one what's the other one we uh a to z lyrics no <laughs> we've been using <laughs> ultimate guitar yeah yeah <laughs> We've been using the library's uh, website. <laughs> been reading tab books. According to Wikipedia. <laughs> Tune your guitar to 432 hertz. <laughs> so I found somehow... Turn it down a little bit. <laughs> yeah, sorry. You told me to turn it up. For the music, not to hear you breathing. <laughs> I'm going to breed you. Yeah, baby! So if you guys didn't know, Ethan's house got robbed by crackheads. So Ethan's gonna I, I did this for you, I want you to know. When it I did saw, get robbed by crackheads, when but I, I don't saw find this, them funny. When I saw this, I'm I immediately, I I immediately of thought of you because I'm like I feel like I'm gonna I, I wanna get you a drone so you can do this. Does it actually no never mind. So uh we're gonna watch I have a deep hatred for him. I am not even gonna hide that. <laughs> I don't give a fuck if you say anything about it. <laughs> you're gonna like this. When I see him, I wanna swerve, baby. I'm just kidding. You're gonna I'm like messing around. <laughs> you're gonna like this. <laughs> you're gonna like this a lot. So this is a guy who has a, a drone. I guess abnormal humans is his name. I don't know. It's a good name. <laughs> <laughs> Barely. Never mind. <laughs> Slightly accurate. <laughs> 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 And he basically Someone just, say crackheads won Ethan Zero. <laughs> Don't worry, baby. <laughs> it's early in the game. <laughs> <laughs> basically, he flies a drone at them, and they uh, they don't like it. Good. I hope this music isn't copyrighted. All right, the music is copyrighted, so we'll just add in like sneaky snitch or something. That's fine. Anyway, you get the idea. I wish they had audio. You don't audio. need the music. You don't need the music. No, you don't. This is what they do. They're like, the fuck is that thing? They probably think they're I'm tripping. gonna get you. <laughs> that thing's good eating. This is when you click the button on the RF receiver. <laughs> 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 oh my god. 
<laughs> I wish they had the audio, the actual audio. The government. See if they do on like a different one or something. Or not a different video, but like. No, they don't. All right. Thanks for the five dollars. Oh, look at this. <laughs> it's Popeye's cousin. <laughs> <laughs> they get so angry, dude. Oh, it's beautiful. Don't record me begging for money. I'm talking to the red box. Get out of here. <laughs> they look like you know what they look like? It looks like, like oh. it looks like some fucking like low tier skeleton in a dungeon. <laughs> if you, when you go in like no clip mode, it really does. And they're just like standing in the dungeon with a sword, like swinging around, wait, waiting, waiting on, on their on their act to begin. <laughs> You know what I mean? Yeah, like, literally. <laughs> like, it, it, He's not here yet. It's like the Truman Show. It's like, wait for it. <laughs> <laughs> when you fucking no clip when Skyrim and you go into a dungeon and the NPCs are just like walking around with their fucking swords. Yeah. Just... <laughs> mm, ice cream. Mm, ice cream. <laughs> it's fucking <Ooh>. Gandalf. <laughs> Look at this. With the fucking Marlboro Red in his mouth. Look at this, what dude. Do you, like, take a tree limb and take the bark off? Oh. Average Walmart parking lot. <laughs> oh, he hit it. He actually hit it. Damn. He's good at throwing them binders. <laughs> it's so fucked. <laughs> I like this guy's haircut. Or is that like a GoPro? He's hand? like, I'm going to sling Doritos at you, buddy. <laughs> it's so fucked. Oh, my God. It's so fucked. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> Look at this. Get off me, property. This is such a good idea. Oh, that was close. <laughs> oh, what a throw. I know. Why aren't these people like in the MLB? It's John Cena. Why do they all want to throw shit at it? I don't know. The government's trying to watch me. <laughs> the government's watching I, I me. I think I would poop in my hand and throw it at it. I would just, I would glue a sign to it. Look at the mustard bottle. I would glue a sign to it that says, you owe 20% in taxes. <laughs> <laughs> We're coming for you. <laughs> the squirrels are watching. Oh my God. Imagine waking up to that. <laughs> He's stuck. <laughs> he just runs away. <laughs> <laughs> Prop hunt. Where'd he go? Hide and seek. It's actually a U.S. congressman in California. <laughs> uh, the UFO going to get him? <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> Big rock. <laughs> Get the big rock. That's a fucking rock right there, buddy. Holy shit. Imagine they threw one and it hit him, like, landed on them. <laughs> Imagine they throw it and just hit someone random. Just yeah, like right? walking into the gas station. I love they all hang out in the red box. Oh, he's hiding in the gas station.
With the Colorado State flag on a shirt. <laughs> oh, you almost had it. I wish there was audio so you could hear what they were saying. Maybe some of them have it. He's going to cast the spell. Be careful. <laughs> He's upgraded magic and intelligence. Thanks for the prime. <laughs> Not outside the Carl Juniors. He's like, I'm going to hit that thing. I'm going to throw my big lighter at it. <laughs> this is amazing. Damn, dude. <laughs> 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 I'm going to bushwhack him. <laughs> oh, there's two of them. I'll be chopping your propellers off, lad. Oh. You'll be a little submarine by the time I get you. <laughs> Dude. He has a hundred faith. Watch out. You have a crossbow? It's a homemade crossbow? I oh, don't know. It's just a water bottle. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> don't fall over, Gandalf. Don't show your weakness. Tom Glavin with the pitch. <laughs> <laughs> Why does he not look like a crackhead though? He looks like he like <laughs> he looks had, like he used to be like finance in Manhattan and he just, just people recently camping. decided yeah. <laughs> just people out camping. <laughs> not the Chihuahua. Oh my god. I'll be poking you with me pipe. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. Threw it up in the fucking power lines. <laughs> this guy's got a level 100 helmet on. I was like one of my old roommates. I really wish you could just hear the audio <laughs> on this. I do too. I man. wish you could hear what they're screaming. Why would they not put audio in? I'm gonna look up drone trolling. <laughs> that's a nice tent. I know. That's what I was thinking. That is like a new looking tent. A few hundred bucks, right? How much is a tent? Two hundred dollars. I feel like a tent is kind of like a lot of money. Pissing off golfers with drone and RC car. This oh, looks, there we go. This looks awesome. Let's see what this is. Oh, boy. Ah. Hello, folks. Bay on the Veen here. Back with a new video. And I am so, so I excited for y'all to see this one. We uh got a drone and RC car. Took it on the course. And, uh aggravated some golfers we duct taped a walkie-talkie to the car just so i could talk a little Thanks smack the prime have some fun you know our our day begun in milwaukee we walked into the store as usual filming and they kicked us out immediately for nothing nothing at all actually i didn't even say it was a ps4 they just kicked us out milwaukee baby tommy g is in complete camo shopping we're back in milwaukee you know <laughs> Baby, right. <laughs> good old Tommy G. <laughs> yeah, let me give you a good hug. What happened? I just can't have you filming here, so don't worry. Okay. Okay, I'm just gonna ask you to leave at this point. We're not gonna play that, so you guys, we're, 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 we're literally buying a drone. It's a private business. 
We're I didn't do shit, dude. Drone. We're trying to buy a drone. I don't care. At this point, I've asked you to leave. You didn't even talk to me. I'm talking to you right now. I'm telling you to leave. Or I'll for what? For don't call the cops, bro. Bro, you came up to me. You said turn off the camera. I'm not arguing. I didn't even I get time. I didn't even get time. It doesn't to matter. Film him. <laughs> Got it. Just had to show it off. <laughs> What was that? A These boys brought us a fucking drone. Yep. And then the RC car. Should we do both? No, if we get the right golfer and he's got a fucking drone and RC car at him, it's game over. No way! You have a fucking GoPro on it? And there's a, there's a camera on the drone, right? Yeah. Step up from last time, huh? This went from a one inch winger to a girthy winger. Oh, yeah. Dude, last time we did this, we had this little fucking $20 RC car that would die every five seconds. Now we got a drone with a camera on it. The fastest RC car I've ever seen with a camera on it. And a fucking ghillie. Those drone crackhead videos were gold. Hey, thanks for the $10. Cheers. 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 This is the most technical we've got with a prank. Oh, Tommy, you could call the front and act like our dad. Yeah, act like fucking yeah, pissed. Smart. And you could be like, yo, my kids are fucking around. Hello, this is Andrew. Hey, Andrew. Uh, it's, it's Tom. How you doing? I'm doing well. Hey, sir. I know my, my son just got into a spot of trouble with some golfers on the course. They were being really annoying. I want to send them in to apologize and to get back the RC car. It would cost me about $350 for his birthday. That, that's fine. I, I just went out there to see if I could find them to give the golf cart back or whatever that thing is. I just tried to give it back, but they were gone. And I'll tell you right now, I called the park patrol. They're yeah. on their way. Yeah, so we'll, I'll send them in. I'm going to give them a call. And they'll come in and apologize. But and thank you for so being you know, professional about this. That, that's fine. Yeah, I, I'll give them their car back. Yeah, I'll but just probably so spank know, them like when the they come home. They're flying the drones right over their head. And they kept on oh, saying, this hey, is so no, embarrassing. I did not raise him like that. Thank you for bringing this to you my know, they, attention. They, they they're lucky he didn't break the cart. Because that's what I would have done. It, I'm going to call um, all their fathers. And we're spanking them. I'm surprised he didn't. I'm going to spank their bottoms red. Sir, I'm going to call them right now. And I'm going to get their fathers involved. I apologize this happened to you. But I'm going to send them in right now, okay? All right. All right. Thank you, sir. You guys go in. Even just two or three of you. So what's your version of what happened? I thought there was five of you. Yeah, the rest, you know, they left, but we want to do the right thing. Dad called us. He said he's going to absolutely spank me. In the county sheriff's department. They're on their way. Okay. Just so you know. I'm not saying that nothing's going to happen to you. I'm going to kind of shoot them. But just so you know, on the golf course, the first thing I would do, i call them. Yeah, yeah. We were just Take driving it around. All fun. right. All right, bye. It's not often you run into great guys like that. If we had to total off how many times authority has talked to us. Right, I feel like I've just been in that same position. So many times. <laughs> it's like not even, it's like a flashback every yeah. time. But hey man, just don't Jeez. do it again. <laughs> and every time we don't learn our lesson. Every fucking time. Look at Tommy Gina's natural habitat in the stew cooking up wraps. A young Wayne used to be my favorite rapper. You know, still is. This video took a very different turn. Like, what is happening? I don't know. They pissed like, off like three people. I feel like that's something we would have done when we were like 14. Yeah, for real. Yeah. Before I had my license, this is what I was doing. Yeah. I mean, right, probably when I got my license too, but still. Yeah. <laughs> yep. I don't know. You know what's funny though? What's that? I don't know if I should say this or not. I want to say it. I was at the Post Malone concert. I told you this? No. I met a dude. He said that uh, he paid. I never heard of this guy before. He said he paid for his sons to go meet this guy. Really? Yeah. <laughs> and I never heard the name before, but now you've just brought it up like out of nowhere. What are the odds of that? One in a billion. Like a shooting star. One in 472,397. It's like a shooting star. Post Malone is slack, y'all. <laughs> Didn't ask. All right. Yeah, yeah, I just thought that was funny, though. I never heard of this dude. And then he uh, he said he paid for his kid to go there and watch him or whatever or meet him. I, I think they did like a live thing or whatever. And then you just brought him up. What are the odds of that? Uh, what are the odds? It good, ain't real, Dallas. Good, good odds. Very good odds. Drone be crazy. Drone trolling funny time. Knock off Darman. Tarzan and Jane drone video. Homeless prank. <laughs> cool story. Don't care. Y'all are mean. I just wish they didn't have music over them. I wish you could hear what was going on. You can probably only hear the drone. Don't you think? 
I could be. I don't. I Wait. Don't know. What is this? Flying a drone in a little. A little war pipe. Damn. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't know if it was going to work or not. All right, starting oh, okay. the series called Send It Sunday. Um, if I pull this off, or when I pull this off, you guys need to um, drop in the comments what you want to see the following Sunday. I send it. But today, this is what we're going for. Let's do it. Be, uh, could be disastrous. Let's see Here it. Go. I believe in you. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Kidney stone POV. <laughs> A couple of run-ups here. Gotta be able to come into that throttle. Woo. I need to get one of these. On the Ekbox. Ekbox drone. Man, it's gonna be tough. No, it's not. I don't know anything about drones, but I feel like I would maybe slow it down. I think the point of it is to be quick. I would not be. Possible. There's a guy standing by the truck just watching him. You see him? No. See right there? The exit chamber. <laughs> It's actually perfect for a drone. Come on now. Get in the hole. Doo doo POV. Thanks for the tier one. This is fucking sick. I need to get a drone. That's what I'm saying, man. I just need to fly it into a fucking traffic. <laughs> All right. It's gotta be the most perfect dive. I wonder what the battery life is. Cause you can't falter. What is the range? <laughs> One way or the other in that dive. It's so tight. Mm. Tight little drone bussy. Send that thing in that hole. Tight little drone bus. <laughs> Put that thing in the hole. Put that drone in me hole. <laughs> They, dude, they should fly a drone in your pee hole when you have something wrong with it. They, dude, give them ten years, they'll probably do it. Here it goes, here it goes. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, I already saw that. Attempt numero uno, failure. <laughs> Holy cow, dude. There's like ridge after ridge after ridge Ooh. in that thing. And my video blacked out for a sec. Oh boy. Still got, oh yeah, she's still recording. Woo. Get in the Holy hole. Cow. Propeller still working. Woo. Woo. Some props, dude, dude. How did I make it out of there? So many ridges. Like ruffles. <laughs> <laughs> so many Me. of the things. <laughs> Me after my first bite of ruffles potato <laughs> chips. Ah, uh, uh, uh. <laughs> uh, do it again. I don't know. Thanks don't for know. the tier one. Man, uh, I didn't realize there's like ridges all the way down that thing. Just admit you can't do it. You can do it, man. I believe in you. You're just getting banged. Oh no, go bro down. Dang. Smack that motherfucker. Well, we done for the day. Jeez. We are done for the day.
Damn, boy. Ah, oh, no. All the things are gone now. <laughs> I'll be back. Excuse me? Jimmy Hoofa? Who the? Jimmy Hoofa? Who in the? Come on, man. Oh, little birdie. You just stabbed a little birdie. This man is going to destroy his drone out here on a 200-year-old smokestack. <laughs> the, old, the old cotton mill. Thank you for the five months. That's fucking sick, though. Drones are cool. I really want one. Fly one up my little bungus. Shoot. I, I think they have a thing that you can, like, wear... And you can get a drone to follow you. Fly it up my little bungus. Think about how cool that would be, though. Yeah. To I don't know if I'm yeah, right or wrong on that. Fly it up your bungus and have it go out your fucking mouth. Oh, we got it. Just have it fly up, up your bungus. <laughs> okay. You know, that, that smokestack was kind of scary. You know what else is scary? Scary shit. We should watch scary videos. Oddly scary things. Oddly terrifying. And I... I will always love you. Oddly terrifying things. Oddly terrifying. You know what it be. You know what it is. You know how it do. Oddly, I'm terrified. We're going to watch some oddly terrifying. R slash oddly terrifying. So, if that sounds interesting to y'all... Uh, yeah! Uh, yeah! Here we go. You want to stand up and watch this one? Sure. Or we can just sit on the floor. We could. Just act like we're sitting. Oh, fuck. I love a little... Never mind. A good little pretend sit. Hey! A little pretend sit! Instinct Knight, thank you for the 20 gifted. Big appreciation. We pretend we sit, but we don't sit. We stand. And when we stand, we don't be the sitting. The wreck of the Titanic from afar. I'm gonna be real with you. This feels like kind of a not great post to start off with on Oddly Terrifying. Why? <laughs> because there's nothing Are you scared? oddly terrifying about this. Oh, the fuck? It's as simple as that. It's terrifying. It's scary. Even if you don't consider the fact it's, what, 12,000 feet down underwater in complete crushing pressurized darkness, the story of the Titanic alone is enough to be terrifying. I, would I can't not say squat oddly. like that. No, no, no. My knees see, are going to pop. Just looking at this image makes me poop my pants for every single genre of horror the Titanic story is scary. Place surrounding this image alone. First aid manual of what to do when someone First is AIDS? choking. Oh, I've seen that before. Yeah, I'm just going to reach my entire fist down there real quick. <laughs> Was this before the high... Should we practice? That's how... If you're choking on a little bean, let me stick my little cock down your throat. <laughs> I'll grab it with my foreskin, boy. Well, that, all right, class. Now everyone practice. Everyone stick your foreskin in Johnny's throat and get that big bean out of there. <laughs> Turn to your left and practice with a neighbor. <laughs> Lick maneuver was this a, a little too old? I love, when was the Heimlich maneuver? I love that they <laughs> drew in the teardrop because <laughs> they're fucking choking their ass off. <laughs> <They're> fucking <gay. laughs> you may experience a mild amount of discomfort. <laughs> I love that. Like it took a doctor to be like, now if somebody's choking, what you gonna want to do? Stick your whole goddamn hand down their whole damn mouth. I love that his, his and grab it out of their damn throat. His index finger is like uncomfortably long. <laughs> like, how do you get your fucking curl it in there? My my like, my front knuckle can't move like that. I can't, I can't do that. I don't have that. You can't. Yeah, you can. I don't have that feature. Extend it out. I don't have that feature available. The less revolved. <laughs> and their problems. <laughs> if I'm choking, I'm fucked, dude. I don't have Unable that. to save you choking that, people. You got that finesse hook. <laughs> That's what they always call it. <laughs> <laughs> Discovered. 
I don't think it can be used in all instances. Should have been a guitar player. I thought it was pretty universal by now. <laughs> I need to re-up my education on that maneuver just to be safe. Sinking of Amoko Cadiz in Brittany Cadiz. 1978 looks like a giant whale surfacing. Wait, <laughs> the what? Oh, oh, what the hell? I had no idea. What? What is this? I'm sorry. I kind of want to look more into this now. I don't remember like this event happening at all. Is that a Pepsi that sign is, on this? That is a hell of a photo. How far away from the shore? It, it looks, looks like a fucking Pepsi logo on the front. On a Colombian it's like an old magazine cargo ship. Posted the 30th of May, 2001. God. You have got to be <laughs> kidding me. There is no freaking way. Although, actually, I guess there would be a freaking way. Because hadn't planes crashed into what? buildings before not frequently by any stretch of the imagination but wasn't it something that did happen every hmm. really really the signs were all in front of us this is may 30th 2001 that are yeah 150 passengers i mean little tiny guys like this one I, I don't know. Maybe I heard wrong because I'm dumb. Abandoned house's porch looks like a mouth with fangs. Yes. Yes it does. Another house that uh, I don't really see it. Really cool it's like a snake. The Monster House. I'm sorry, that movie's just awesome. I'll find any way I can to talk about it whenever it comes up. Abandoned Diner. Okay. <coughs> oh. That looks like a cod really, map. Really cool <laughs> it does. Too. That's, That's not that terrifying. That Colash looks like a cod shelter. map. I'd probably <laughs> just, eat there. It feels like the classic diner diner, you know? And it's, it's not that scary though. Like this. It just I looks like a waffle a house. Yeah. Probably every day. I'd be there every morning drinking coffee. Concept art for Bruce from Finding Nemo. Oh, bruh. <laughs> Man, the only reason the concept <laughs> that is oddly terrifying is yes. because of the significantly larger, Do some sexy yoga together. Some sexy yoga with the Bruce concept art in the background. You, you guys are the first people to ever see sexy man yoga with Bruce concept art in the background. Yeah, do this. Do some sexy yoga poses. Damn, every fucking Lizzie, thank you for the twenty bucks. We're doing our best. Hoover. Hoover Greyhound. Hoover you gotta really feel this one in your glutes. Hoover Greyhound. <laughs> Although I'm pretty sure the and that was free. Blood, his eyes kind of look like. Yeah, let's make Bruce look a little the less uh, like a demon. His face is a lot longer, whereas in the movie it's a lot flatter looking. I don't know. He's got a I like Bruce. vibe to I'm him Bruce. in the final product, regardless Ooh, of the teeth. Fish or friends, that that's good. Fish or friends, not food. Scary. I'm not really seeing much cute in that art at all. My dog Nemo. was pretty Looks nervous about heading down this trail for some reason. <laughs> well, uh, don't go Zoom down in. that trail. I'm sorry. It looks really cool. But I don't think you're going to make it past a certain point. I've got a sneaky suspicion that you'll end up in the Black Lodge, or worse, if you go that way. In the Black Cock. Always cack. trust the animal's instincts in <laughs> the Black like Cock of the Amazon. Machine for simulating childbirth. An obst obstetrical mannequin invented by Angelique de Caudre de Caudre during her travels in France where she spent over 20 years midwifery from 1760 to 1783 <laughs> teaching poor I don't be midwives. teaching the midwifery today <laughs> hi whoa oh, Jesus <laughs> Oh man, Dobby. this would be way creepier. Though. Looks like Dobby. Honestly, Looks like that movie where she gives birth to a no, demon. I'm not going to describe Ever seen to that? What I was expecting because I don't want to think about it anymore. The OG but, hey, flesh. This looks like it would have been an flashlight. incredibly educational tool. So good on you, man. That's a potato sack, boy. <laughs> oh, it is. It is still creepy though. X-ray of a Chinese woman who underwent foot binding. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, that's Oh seems my like a really god, they're like eating practice. each other. Uh, totally healthy. It looks like we need to do hand involved. puppets on the wall. <laughs> <laughs> you ever notice that stuff like this is always put on women? Found myself lost in a home improvement <laughs> store. Most of the demo doors don't actually open. Uh, you're gonna die in there. Fuck Welcome that. Welcome to doors. It's just doors. We looks only like some monsters ink doors. shit. It really Dude does. Suddenly wakes up. Game over. Oh, good god. Well, that's why they make sure not to let him wake. <laughs> Now there. That's what it looked like when they were taking my adenoids out. <laughs> I got my tonsils. That's when you got that wisdom teeth surgery. 
<laughs> when them tonsils got cut out of me, <laughs> the photo they took. No, when when you have wisdom teeth surgery, you go to sleep looking like that, and then when you take your wisdom teeth out, you wake up. You Make like sure that. they hook up them gorilla nippies in case he starts <laughs> lactating. We got to collect that monkey milk. <laughs> Look I love at the size of that fucker. I love that they have his fucking nipples hooked up in his ball sack. It also it also looks like he's like chained down. <laughs> like they got like a little leather strap on him. Hey, it'll be all right. Can you imagine that thing wakes up, dude. I would be gone. I throw a stun grenade and fucking run. <laughs> throw a flashbang and run. Much like with us, he's being pumped with enough sleepy, sleepy juice so that they can get through whatever. They, they got an to iPad do. hooked up to his nuts. Is counting down how much oxygen is left on the lost submarine. Okay, so we're well past the submarine being gone. And honestly, I did not like this Twitter account at all. I saw it, and all I could think was, wow, that's morbid and gross and altogether inappropriate. Because and it real. didn't really feel like it was trying to be educational in any way and be like, hey, by the way, this is how much time's left, we gotta get on it. It felt like it was trying to make a spectacle of a bunch of dudes that were dying. Even though we later found out they were not dying a slow and agonizing suffocation death, it was a fraction of a second and it happened so quick that everybody involved didn't even know that it happened okay only like one or two people down there may have gotten their just desserts least of all the kid who went to please his dad so i don't know this account just rubbed me the wrong way all right the packaging of these barbies mm, they really really didn't need to put tape <laughs> around their mouths <laughs> and legs Look, just like getting the plastic wrap around him and taping it in the center. I've seen something like this come out of a shipping container one time. <laughs> <laughs> Same price. That's fine. But what was the purpose of Have it? Have the Disney logo that? on and everything. Do that? <laughs> Creepy statues all over town. Not funny, not funny. At 2 not funny. Not funny. Why are those all Yo. over your town? Where the hell do you live? And might I suggest moving? Six-year-old paper boy in 1910. Yeah, you want to know why this is oddly terrifying? Dude, he looks 30. Yeah, right. It's like Hasbulla. Like <laughs> yeah, Hasbulla's uncle should be a delivering papers. They should not be out on the corner, even if it's for their family's store or newspaper route or whatever. They should, they should be children. They shouldn't be out there working, whether it's the coal mines or up at whatever time. They can't sell papers, be, uh, but throwing newspapers uh, at people. I get it. It's gross. Children should be children. We should Forget all be about allowed it. to retire. We should all be allowed to live our lives. And yeah, I'm, I'm sorry if that's controversial for you, but it's true. This water park getting built in Qatar. Yeah, it's that controversial. Totally seemed like a horrifying death trap. No, that's catch up and that's in catch up town. Built <laughs> then again, I don't live there. Maybe you that all looks actually fucking awesome. Please, please, giant... please react to Barfly 7777 <laughs> on TikTok. You'll be bewildered by this guy. He's like a mix of Jimbo and Shoe Nice. Thank you for the ten dollars. Lick me. Horrifying water park that will probably <laughs> kill at least one person within the first year. That looks fucking open. fun, dude. Unless that looks like twelve octopuses. That open. thing on the right looks uh, like the shit that's in your case, ear hole. By the way, I'm not rooting for anybody the to cochlear? die. The cochlea. The uh, cochlea. Sometimes it may come across that way. I don't want your ear to drum. get hurt. But look at this thing. What do you expect to happen? X-rays taken by the U.S. Mexico Border Patrol. Ooh, ooh, man, that is oh actually. Oh my god! Just, yeah, that is scary. straight out of it's Breaking scary, Bad. Man. It's scary, and it doesn't make me happy in any way to see that people need to do this sort of thing. Okay, it, they're just playing they Mario Kart. The need to do this sort of thing, just. Whew, good God! Okay, how did this guy not make it through? <laughs> <laughs> to be as oh fair as my possible, God. this one is not very, or rather, it, it's not as good as the other two. Especially the one uh, with, what was it, like a giant gas tank of sorts? This this one's not trying quite as hard. I mean, it's a piece of luggage. They're gonna open it, all right? Oh, oh, oh. now that one. Sneaky, that sneaky. Could you imagine you hit a but speed man, bump? This dude's like cheap. playing Angry Birds on his phone. his phone. I like to <laughs> yes. imagine he's getting this x-ray and he's just like checking Twitter like, oh, sick, I can't wait to make it through. A dummy that was I'm invented going to in McDonald's? the 1930s to train dentists. It's called a dental phantom. Yeah, I've seen this one before. Bruh. Honest to Christ. That Oh. oh my god. This would be a fantastic bit of inspiration 
for an enemy in a horror game, okay? Dead space looking uh, shit. Masahiro Ito, the artist or creature artist, character designer. Artist, I like it. Whatever is actual. I like it. Robocop. On me you look good. Game. It would be awesome to see him create a creature using this as inspiration. Unfortunately, I don't think the man watches MK. I do not necessarily blame him. He's MK. got more important things going on okay. right now. But come on, don't you agree? The man that gave us Red Pyramid thing could give us something utterly amazing with this monstrosity. A lighthouse perched up on a rock pillar in the Westman Islands, Iceland. I don't know if it's oddly terrifying, but I would oh never, ever, 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 ever feel safe. There's no chance. Also, how do they get supplies up there? I'm just a little bit How do they curious. get there in general? Does That's a helicopter awesome. have to drop it off? Because I don't see some elaborate little staircase that goes down to a dock, which how would that work? Look how high the water constantly hits this thing. The only thing I can imagine is flying out. Oh, well, maybe there's some they weird pull out their umbrellas. utility that I'm not seeing here, but still, I would just never feel safe. It's like Fortnite. They, just little, they do a little... Be on edge. <laughs> Brian little Pools Mary Poppins the down there. The oh boy. Ah uh, yes. I've we seen all these. Do love images from the bottom of the sea. Those are great. Also, the lighting here is really weird. How's this happening? It looks badass. I don't imagine this would be anywhere close to the surface if it's at the bottom of the sea, right? I have and, seen. I don't this. know. This is really cool lighting. It's very, very interesting. Found on the front porch at 4 a.m. Oh, let's see if we can get down to the business with these ramblings. I'm not very good with this type of chicken scratch because it's like half cursive, half not, it almost looks like. So, no, no, this is incomprehensible. Oh, I thought I saw sorry. a word. Normally, I can read stuff that looks like this. Aloe vera. I don't think they were writing words. I see the word the. I think I see serve or. Um, La sultry. No, no. Or so. I see so and tell. Fire. <laughs> yeah, that's about all I can really make out here. When you hide some private files for your eyes only and see this the next day. Right, hold on a what second. What's Ethan's Twitch? knows where you put that file. <laughs> Thanks for the $50. Ethan. <laughs> Ethan, what's your Twitch? My Twitch is called Ethan Twitching. Came up with that myself. Ethan Twitching. Yeah, that's the name of Write it. Write it down. <laughs> put that in your calendar. Write it in cursive and put it on someone's porch at 4 a.m. Tattoo that on your dog. <laughs> Ethan oh, twitching. What? Is Bing going to, <laughs> I don't know, blackmail me? Because Bing better not do that. Because I'll kick Bing's ass. I don't suffer fools that are only used for searching up naughty stuff. Cherenkov radiation. Blue light inside of a nuclear reactor. Mm -mm -mm. Just give me a big old dose of that. The nuclear sure reactor in general fucking scares me, dude. And in due time as well. That looks you know, awesome. I'd love to go for a that swim like a in computer. the radioactive pool. like a battleship. This person's Randy room. You know, I knew exactly what Randy it was going to be. I really did. I completely did. And I understand absolutely adoring the hell out of a character from a show, especially if you love the show. I love Randy, but he is a complete. Is this the guy that says, uh, no, this isn't the guy from the Tooth Decay. Integrity Farms. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was thinking the Tooth Decay. That's Mr. Mackey. Never mind. Echo Path. You have to remember that. Wrong well. guy. So being this obsessed with one of the meanest, nastiest, most psychotically not taken care of characters in the world. I don't know. Now, I can't put him on the same level as Cartman for incredibly obvious reasons, but this man's supposed to have, like, what, a PhD in fluvial geomorphology? He is a geologist. I don't he works know for if the this gets asked a lot, but are there plans for a slack jaw tour? Thank you for the ten dollars. Some stuff is in the works. <sighs> That's all that can be said. We be working. Thank you. Colorado Geological Survey, yes. And I'm going to play Call of the Wild soon, don't you worry. Clifford? I am a huge South Park fan. I think I've mentioned <laughs> that before. I don't like the show enough to have anything, even remotely this weird, dude. Active volcano oozing lava near the resort we're staring at. Hell yeah. Ooh, okay, well how... You know what? Never mind. I kind of like that, honestly. How near? Uh, but to be fair, volcanoes don't need to be near to destroy all kinds of things. 
Again, I wasn't alive when it happened, but my hometown did get absolutely douched with ash after Mount St. Helens exploded, and it was clear on the other side of the state, as far as I know. A restraining device used to immobilize infants during circumcision. Yeah, what that's fuck? not something horrifying at what? all. What? Now, Bro! Now, going into this topic... And that really looks like a, a toilet for a person with four fingers. <laughs> <laughs> that looks like a ball sack washer. <laughs> For you and three friends. <laughs> <laughs> you got four scrub daddies on there. Hey, Manscaped, I have an idea. <laughs> yeah. oh. Where's the lawnmower? <laughs> That's insane. That is fucking horrifying. Oh, my Man. God. Probably have One size fits all. Being sent very nice comments of, I thank you for saying that, and a lot of other people being incredibly mad that I was dogging on something that for some people is tradition and completely normal. So instead of doing that, I'm just going to say, I don't really like circumcision. Bottle sack okay, washer. This, but anyway, that's just me. That's just me. If you do, <laughs> okay, that's fine. Let's move on. This thing, I'm going to get oh, you wait, one Before now. we do, though, we do have to admit, this thing looks scary. I'm sorry. Even if you are on the side of supporting that sort of thing, you can't look at this looks and go, normal. oh, it's just so many memories. You have bed. to think it's creepy, right? What rip currents look like? Yeah, that's not horrifying at all. Get the hell away from the beach. No, I, I think they'll be okay. I'm on the sand when something like this is happening. Hell, you know what? I'm not going in the water at all. I've seen Jaws. I'm kidding. Please don't take movies like Jaws as some sort of reason to go out trying to kill animals or anything, because that's kind of what happened. <laughs> I love that every <laughs> picture is a political a statement SMUV for this guy. Dash 110 submarine from 1918. Oh, okay, okay. I don't like this image. For Slack big Jaw reason. on There's World just... Tour with so, Iron okay. Maiden 2023. You... It's on Metal Injection. That would be... I would shit myself and then grab the shit and rub it in my eyeballs. <laughs> <laughs> I would run full speed into a brick wall. <laughs> they... I'm not even in Slack Jaw. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for the $50. <laughs> this looks like one of those like uh, painting things where this, like everything looks like it's melting. I thought you were going to say, like, find the hidden object. That, too. The <laughs> mini game you play on the plane. <laughs> Where yeah. you just end up just clicking the whole picture yeah, until it's, like, losing points. correct. <laughs> <laughs> But it looks like a, a painting where everything's like <laughs> melting away. Can you just there. imagine, dude? What year did he say? Nineteen fucking. Can 18? you just imagine it's nineteen eighteen and your commander's just like, "You want to grab the left rudder? You want to steer it to the right?" Yeah, and he's he's yelling. You're like, all right. He's yelling that at you through the little door that opens. <laughs> he's like, "Grab that one over there!" He's like, "Turn to the northeast. <laughs> Turn left." And I want you to put the poop deck on the bottom. You're like, "All right, see ya." <laughs> the hatch just blows off. <laughs> you guys ever played a what is I mean, it? what could What could this one right here? What could that one be doing? That Seriously. one that one you obviously don't know your submarine lore. No, I'm not a fan of it, every one of those is connected to the letters in submarine. So like one's <laughs> a, you got to spell, you got to twist it until it spells it. Yay! Hey. <laughs> Shouty! <laughs> Thank you for the 50 gifted. Appreciate it. <laughs> Every one of those is connected to like S U B M. I don't know how to spell the rest. But the. <laughs> <laughs> you got to twist them. It's like Jeopardy. All right, but. Okay. You got Tom Segura coming out that little hatch. How about this one right here? Bottom left. What's that one doing? That probably goes to the E. That's probably the last letter. <laughs> <laughs> These obviously, the top one, the top row is one for each piston in the engine. All right. It's a V8. Okay. Actually, a submarine is probably like a V10. I don't uh, know, dude. Nah, it's V10. It's probably electric. Have, you know, it's a twin turbo. VR thing they did it's a they BMW the submarine. <laughs> it's got an eco <laughs> boost. Out a bunch of fun games. Uh, something sort of broke. What kind of gas mileage are you getting under there? <laughs> but it wasn't just the head kind of turning around or, you know, whatever it was. It played their unique little stinger, the music, whatever it is. I still don't know. Who made that? But it was just a room full of valves, and it looked like this. I hate this image. I don't like it. It's a very overwhelmingly scary thing. And you know what? I hope the guy that made Iron Lung and I hope Markiplier saw this image at some point and are taking some kind of inspiration for their little movie because I'm excited. Deserted. House. I want to know. I want to know this. What the fuck did the person who welded all that together think? 
Yeah. When they were like when they were making all that shit. Bro, they probably had a gun to their head. <laughs> He's probably like, You will put the fucking <laughs> You know? <laughs> like <laughs> <laughs> we will tell you where to put it. <laughs> you will jig do, do the jig well. <laughs> oh my god. Mm. He's probably like, I don't know what the right uh, like, dude. I, I can't, just can't imagine. Maybe they, maybe they were just pranksters. Maybe they, like some of those just did nothing. <laughs> no, I, I was thinking that right. No, I swear to God, I was thinking that. Actually, none of them do anything, right? Right, yeah. If you look at this picture, which one probably does something? If I if I had to take a guess... Take, I mean, everybody take a guess right now. Everyone take a guess. Which one of these actually does something? I'm going to say me. the top four and then the two on the right-hand side. That, okay, that you are might, way off from what I'm thinking. It, okay, I'm going to say... So the, maybe the, it's real. The top four, the two on the right, and the one, the one in the middle that looks... Not this this one right here. That thing, this big no. that that big ass one does absolutely nothing. I think that's the only one that does that, anything. It's warped. The, so the we're gonna get in there warped. and argue is what's gonna happen. Viva asked the question. No, it's for real though. I'm saying I'm I would grab this motherfucker right here. No, that does nothing. Where's it at? Right that there. That one's warped. That, that one listen to me. You're an idiot. <laughs> you just killed everyone. <laughs> this is the only thing that does anything in the whole room. And you know what it does? It steers the motherfucker. Uh, were there like 17 people in there working on this at one time? <laughs> I'm saying, I'm telling you, the top four up there, the two on this side, and, and then maybe those two that look legible. This one and, and this one. <laughs> those are the only ones that did anything. Can you imagine the little, the little small guy? This little fucker. That's the only one. <laughs> this is the one that steers the whole thing. There's someone down there like, oh, shit. I'm going to turn to the Northwest. <laughs> <laughs> I'm telling you, that one right there, though, Rod, he, and Mike. That's the only one that does that, anything. No, that's a decoy one for idiots like you because it's warped. That one is what steers the that, whole fucking that, thing. That's, that's the one for the guy who's like, please let me ride on the submarine. <laughs> <laughs> That's the one they're like, all right, little guy, you just pull this one back and forth. He's like, yay, yay. <laughs> it's like, yeah, I'm just sitting out there doing this the whole day, and it's doing nothing. <laughs> yeah, I drove that submarine, that, that's boy. Like when, you, when you hand your little brother the unplug controller. <laughs> exactly. The Xbox. They just got me out there. <laughs> that's what that one's for. He's like, go to the control room. It's just me steering left and right. Nothing's happening. I promise you, that's the one that steers the whole ship. That's all I'm saying. No, it's not. Like it? It's a very the top four don't do shit. The top thing. four. Look what at What are us. you supposed to steer, reaching for the sky? What if you're four Iron foot eight? Dude, look, four Markiplier foot eight. Try crawling through that little fucking <laughs> hole. Well, that's true. That's the truth too. Is if that hole trying, is the size of a human and that fucking fit wheel right fucking there, fucking Lizzo through that thing. <laughs> They'd have to fucking get the Jaws think, of Life to get Lizzo out of there. No. She'd try and get her fucking forehead through that thing, and the Jaws of Life had to come out. I don't know if 1918 is submarine is letting Lizzo in there. That ain't happening. It's look at. I want you to look at the size of that wheel. <laughs> if that's a wheel a human's supposed to grab, there's. Uh, you have to be selected to be on that submarine to <laughs> fit in that. I probably couldn't fit through that fucking hole. I mean, based on that picture, I couldn't either. I put my you had to send that circumcised little thing. I'd have the to last. attach a little gripper to my big toe and put it in there. <laughs> put your croc in there with a little fucking... <laughs> 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 have to fly a drone in there. Maybe they were smart. They kept little people on there with them. All right. And they, you can only control that shit if you could fit through the little I, gap. I love that the sign behind that fucking warped ass wheel is in German. It's like Schleither fucking. Because you know what it says? Steer the fucker. <laughs> <laughs> it says that this is the only motherfucker that steers the whole. Steer summary. the fucker. <laughs> it says good luck. The sign <laughs> says steer the fucker. <laughs> yes, yeah, <just> good luck. <laughs> we don't know either. <laughs> <laughs> we don't know what we're doing. You know, I didn't even notice that. That is the sign that says "Rod he might." Rod he. Look how off-centered it is. That's what I'm saying. It looks warped <laughs> as fuck. I think it might be the photo. 
<laughs> you think so? <laughs> <laughs> the photos, the one that's wrong. All I'm saying Blame is... Blame it on the photographer. Inspiration. The guy, I'm the guy taking the, the photo is like, look at this fucking bullshit. I gotta click <laughs> one button. <laughs> I can take a photo of this with one button no. and they're manning a submarine. There's like 47 valves. <laughs> the top row can't be used for anything because no one can reach it. Okay. Uh, if no you're, one's reaching if that. you're fitting through that little door, you're not reaching that. No. You need a little. Fuck you no. you got to step on one of those wheels. <laughs> no, no, you got to step four. on three yeah, of you them. You got to climb up the wheels to get up there. That's, that's why they're there. Yeah, you got to climb up them. So, so you, you actually like, do right, steer I got to reduce the, the pressure and you're fucking the submarine's like. <laughs> <laughs> You're like, whip it to the left. You're like, hang on. Hold on, guys! <laughs> it's like, I'm steer, sorry! Steer to the right. The submarine's like rocketing out of the surface. <laughs> it's like a fucking dolphin jumping yeah. out. <laughs> Everyone has to go in those decompression chambers. They didn't have that back then. Ain't no Look way. at that picture. You think they had that? Everyone that got off that submarine alive was fucking throwing up <laughs> everywhere. Image at some point and are some Maybe one of those valves is a cheeseburger dispenser. <laughs> 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 Well, yeah, deserted houses are always going to be creepy. I mean, that's kind of cheating, though, right? Uh, this is a teddy bear made out of human placenta. Okay. The placenta uh, is slight and dive in, in order to cure it. <sighs> creepiness. And from the German out, submarine to this. It's an emulsifying <laughs> mixture of tannin and egg yolk to make it soft and pliable. <laughs> then it's crafted into a teddy bear. Right. <laughs> Isn't that so nice? Does anybody else want to... Might sit down for that one. Bear? No, 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 no. Anybody? You, you motherfuckers would see this at Hobby Lobby and pay 40 bucks for it. I don't want to hear it. <laughs> <laughs> it's called art. It's modern art. You wouldn't understand. Dude, that looks like a uh, recycled football. <laughs> or like a rugby ball. Tom Brady's going to kiss it. <laughs> you know, why did you put it in a Aussie jar? Aussie rules, Mike. Why is it in a jar? <laughs> Get it out of there. I don't want it in there. It's so much worse. Knowing how it's made, knowing what it's made out of. And you put it in a jar. Looks like it's made of fingernails. Oh, the mummified head of St. Catherine of Siena, 1347 to 1380. Balenciaga. At the Basilica of San Domenico <laughs> in Siena, Italy. I hope I said those uh, words correctly. And honestly, she's looking pretty good for uh, really, really old. Sorry, I actually can't do that type of math off of my head. People sat on the... The what? Clock tower? The something something bait uh, clock tower in Mecca. Again, words that I'm not going to mispronounce and uh, make anybody sad or offended or think I'm dumb. You know, you know what I'm saying? Also, holy <laughs> How big is this clock tower? Seeing these guys, they look like Lego minifigs. Maybe and they're just really tower, tiny and it's like it's a grandfather clock. It's gotta be the clock. size of a continent they're sitting on here. Holy crap. It is huge. Unattended toddler what? crawled inside an x-ray machine scanner. <laughs> what the hell? Who wasn't attending to the toddler? Bathroom over an abandoned 15-story lift shaft. Why? Wh wh why? <laughs> but why, though? Shit or die. lost his shed in the tenta the ta tantalin? Tantalin or tantalin wildfire? This Halloween mask was all that was left. Mm, it would be. It would be, wouldn't it? Not A bad. nursing home flooding. What? Yay! Uh, Grandma getting sturdy for a second. Uh, this is incredibly distressing I was not to okay. look at. And look at that woman right there. What is she doing? She's knitting. <laughs> she's, Leave her alone. She's just knitting in the flood. She's showing a little shoulder, oh. trying to find her a little shark to fornicate. Oh, Gertrude <laughs> just taking a big old whopper. Yeah, and Helga's over there like, let me show some shoulder so I can get a little crocodile pussy. <laughs> She's sitting in a recliner. I'm not sure what she's fiddling with, but it kind of looks like she's just said, Gertrude's taking knit. a shard. What else is there for me to do? Gertrude's at definitely time. shitting. This is That's called a floater. Ooh, there's something about flooding in particular. <laughs> is that a popcorn that machine? Just messes me up. It Hell more yeah, dude. Than most things. Better this homes and gardens. Down around them, and I wouldn't be quite as just icked as all the Looks like the gardening it. section at Lowe's. It's, it's just, like the garden of Eden. Is so unique at destroying things and harming people and just being Someone get the lamp out of there. Everywhere. It permeates all. At least the couches off. are leather. Oh, she's sitting is on her walker. coming to get them, by good. the way? And the cat? Look at the cat! Help! My eyes started Cat's doing right. this really cool-looking thing. Or, oh, sorry, really cool-looking different sizes thing. 
turns out it's a tumor. <laughs> oh, that's more subtle than I was expecting. I mean, it's not subtle subtle, but it's the type of thing that you'd really have to be looking into someone's eyes to notice. And that's the type of thing I might blink and miss in the morning brushing my teeth. So it's good to know that if something like this ever occurs, go get it looked at, like immediately. Ethan, I got because you on 50 <laughs> sub next tumors time are things to be stream. trifled with, of course. PS Ford is inferior. Hey, now. Amen. Hey, shawty. Amen to that. Take your fifty dollars and shove it up your ass and one dollar at a, a time. That's a matter bet. of fact. Take that to the bank and put it in nickels and put them up your ass. <laughs> that is a bet, shawty. Uh, I'll stream soon if you're gonna say that now. Come on, thank you. For Fuck the them Fords. <laughs> Thanks for the fifty bucks. <laughs> First, oh man, oh my good god! I'll put that on my truck I payment. Thank you, shorty. There's good news at the end of this. There's nothing at the end of this. Oh man, you know what? I'll have to assume that they got it out perfectly. What and is that? that? That's a tumor. Ass. That's a chicken Skeletal nugget. Cancer aftermath. Isn't there a specific term? Oh my god! Looks like that's a, what happens when you don't get the chicken nugget out of your eyeball. Looks like a claymore went off. It's just a McChicken nugget in your eyeball. Is it really, though? That's what happens when... Honestly, I didn't know that. I learned something new. That's what happens when you go like this to your butt hole. Do I look like I have a tumor? <laughs> you look like you can cut a mean lawn. <laughs> <laughs> My boy said, I use a push mower. I ain't cutting no good lawns. <laughs> they gotta talk... <laughs> they gotta talk... I like it when you mean to me, Mr. You look Lawn. like a weed whacker. <laughs> I like it when the lawn's mean. You like them dirty talking lawns. <laughs> I ain't gonna cut you if you're gonna be nice to me now. <laughs> I bet you be trimming edges, ain't you? This is what happens when you try and hold in a fart too long. Your eyeball blows out. No, you know, honestly, though, that is holding in a sneeze. Good call. It really is. This like is when what your eye pops out of your head. This is what happens if you sneeze without blinking. Is it true that if you hold in a sneeze, your eye could pop out? Do you see the proof? The Do proof you? The proof is in the nano pudding. <laughs> Look at that snaggle tooth. <laughs> <laughs> that person was left-handed. <laughs> they could eat a mean uh, carrot. <laughs> For this type of cancer, I'm not 100% Not a sure. nice carrot. I know that a lot of cancers will have their own names, <laughs> Dirty talking carrots. Regardless of how rare they are. But there's something about this one that feels... Like it needs the like just the snorting too much time, wizard all it deserves it. What the hell is this for real? That's what happens because when you don't it, put it's a cod map. That's what happens when you don't but use I diesel eye drops. That's not what happened? I know this slowly happened to him, and that, that does is not the look most like a human. scary thing that we have seen on this subreddit. It don't look like it happened date, slowly. A tunnel dug by the giant ground sloth in Brazil for I don't believe 10, this. thousand years ago. <laughs> the giant. What? It's like that thing from Do SpongeBob. Do you mean that sloth from the city? <laughs> the Alaskan you know bullworm. Yeah, yeah, about, yeah. Right? You know exactly <laughs> what I'm talking about. Come on, she's in Bikini Bottom. <laughs> yeah, you, come you on. Read you read that? That's book. Mass Square we're back no there. Other billboards for miles. <laughs> Smile. It'll be the last thing you ever do. Honestly, that's nice though. I like that. I know, I know what you mean by it being oddly terrifying, especially because there aren't billboards around for miles, but you've got this nice landscape, albeit flat and How a little more boring, that terrifying? but it's still the windows pretty background. And nice, and the only billboard is not someone trying to sell uh. you some shit, just a smile. I like that. This one's not really terrifying me. This is something I drive past and go, hmm, this road trip just got a little bit better. Can't wait to get the f out of Nebraska, though. Largest black hole versus our solar system. Imagine one night you go out and be like, where are all the stars today? Ah, uh, yes. Check that shit out, huh? I have zoomed in as much as I can, and there's like maybe 10 pixels that make up our solar system in comparison to this. But hey, look, if we Did ever you scratch your ass enough, I don't give I don't give a fuck what you say. This man went over there to scratch his ass. Let it be known, ass was scratched over there. I would do it on Twitch if they wouldn't ban me. You give. <laughs> What, what are you going to say? You Look get, at that picture right there. Yeah, it's a whole solar... You're liking my picture. That is a whole solar system, and I'm telling you, I know the Mexicans built it. But you give them, <laughs> you give them a case of Modelo, and the Mexicans will build you a solar system. That's what happened. It's in the middle of fucking nowhere. No one can explain it. It's not in the... 
Well, that's us, though. Is it? That's what they said. That's us. Don't get into a philosophical debate now. I'm not trying to get into a philosophical Apparently, debate. Apparently, that's us. That's us? Yeah, we're right there in the middle. The Mexicans built it. Take a look, everybody. I wish the fucking camera would let me. Right over there, mate. Right over. Right there. That's us, though, yeah. Yeah. It was built According on, to research we've done. It was built done. on a dream and a 24 case of Modelo. <laughs> In the hot, bearing sun. Not on a rainy day or a Sunday. But listen to me, though. All right. You told me uh, not to get philosophical, and I talked about Mexicans, and you're talking about fucking... I don't even know, dude. I'm not talking... Exactly. I haven't said anything. Go ahead. I'm saying... Preach, Ethan. We've done a lot of research. All right. Here we go. We have. Here we go. We have equations. All right. We do. And that's us. We're right there in the middle of that thing. And that's right. us. Okay. It ain't that hard to understand. We did the research. <laughs> we did the equations. We did the quadratic formula. We did the Pythagorean thing. And we're good. The pumpernickel bread. We did uh, A minus B squared equals C squared. We're right there in the middle of nothing. This motherfucker and, knows the alphabet. And and it all works the way we understand because we did it all. We already know. I that's have us streaming as much right as now. I can. And, and like everybody, maybe that's everybody ever in the fucking world ever. Who? It's right there. Everybody. You don't know them. We ain't never met them all. Ten pixels <laughs> that make up our solar system in comparison to that this. That looks like a well, ring. If we ever, at some point, that get like an egg. into hey. this, it's not really going to matter. You're not too high for this. Listen, it's simple. We did all the research. We did math. We did, like, we did. We studied shit. We invented, we invented bread. Yeah, bro, come on. We got the sword. We invented boats. We, get the we, fuck out of we here. We learned how to make pasta. You, That's what you, I'm trying to say. You wet the dries and dry the wets and wet the dries and dry the wets. Dude. They we invented, learned how to do that shit. We got sticks that you fucking push them down on something and it all leaves a mark and you can write in a certain way and it becomes a fucking... You can hear it. You can read it. I was just trying paper. to talk about Mexicans and you told me not to get philosophical. That's fair. I'm just saying we do all the research. It's, it's very simple. That's us right there. Come on. Because... I mean, come on. Oh. We're eaten up by the cosmic greatness that is the universe. Exactly. That created us in the first place. I can't we did all that research. More poetic than that. <laughs> all right. Look. Someone made this like in Microsoft Paint. 100 quintillion years when the universe re explodes into life. Exactly. We'll get to have this discussion. We all, again, but for it's now, very simple. Big black hole. It's coming for us. Okay. And you need to be ready. Uh, amen. It's be exactly. It's very I'm simple. Per, I'm prepared. Nine it's simple. I've been years. preparing my whole Mystery life for nine the big old black years. hole to come for me. <laughs> In a children's hospital. <laughs> He's hungry. <laughs> that is not Miss Piggy from the f***ing Muppet Show. Okay, I don't know what Look at that, that kid. Hell the kid's that like, is. you gonna eat me? But no. Uh -uh. Uh, <laughs> Freddy Fazbear. The kid thinks he's about to get bitten. The Five nights really Freddy. <laughs> I just looked it up, and she does look a little creepier. She's got those really high set eyes that are ripe and ready for analog horror. However, she doesn't look like this. What the hell is this? <laughs> Uh, kids like get the hell away the from me. Hospital's idea, you know, like a, like go out and just get a pig mask. We'll call it Miss Piggy, okay? This dead spider I found in my basement cellar. <laughs> what the fuck? I'm pretty sure it's they cummed on that thing. Uh, no, 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 no. They crystallized that bitch and cum. That's the chlorine update. <laughs> That's, Come on, that is the cum spider. <laughs> That's the thing that cr crawls in your pee hole when you're sleeping. I'm telling you, it went too far into the nut and crawled back out and died. <laughs> Fuck that. I think it's just a little salty. <laughs> That's a saltwater spider. Come on now. Oh, You can catch that on a hook. <laughs> saltwater. That's a little buzz bait. Is that a snake around it? I don't know, dude. Looks like a hose pipe. It does. You're right. It's a hose pipe. Snake. <laughs> is covered in what looks to be a fungus, though. I wouldn't, I wouldn't take that lightly. Do you happen to have a little jet lighter? That's Falcor, like a fucking the dragon delicacy. From the never-ending story was found in a storage unit 39 years after the film released. Okay, now before I move I'm on, I'm just saying. I, earlier in the video, the guy says 
you know, you shouldn't be just killing animals from Jaws. And then he says you should jet lighter a white spider. That's all I'm saying. I have seen this image. And honestly, together while things, it yeah. is terrifying, Don't think too I'm hard. kind of impressed that he's not destroyed. Why does that look like a monkey head. and a dog? It does look like there's been it's some Falcor, shoddy restoration the work here and there. And if I you was walking past this shit. open door, I would absolutely scream. <laughs> but it, it, once I realized it was Falcor and he's a friend, because he is... I mean, just look at the big guy. He is still looks scary. Like he a always human looked a dog weird, monkey. But then again, it's Barney. Practical puppetry is going to do that to you. There's something. It's Barney the white ape. At so least familiar. He's not Hoggle from the labyrinth. You saw what happened to my boy Hoggle? You know what? If you're a bit squeamish, look it up anyway. It's great. The first photos have been released of the remains of the Titanic sub being taken ashore. I did see these as well, and honestly, I, I just. <laughs> We shouldn't really be discussing all this. I think I already mentioned it in a... We should hide it. ...prior, regardless of how you feel about the other guys on that sub, especially the CEO that caused all of this with his arrogance and hubris. That 19-year-old that did not need to be there, and he didn't deserve any of that whatsoever. And the only solace I can really take in this event is that, again, it happened so fast, they didn't know it happened. And they will never have to know that. So it we happens. should never talk about Ella it. Ella super deep borehole. Don't is learn from under it. The cap, forty thousand feet deep. Uh oh. Okay, I've I've wondered Cola about this. Cola cap. I I feel like I've That's where they keep the secret formula. <laughs> I think some vague memories are coming back to me. At forty thousand. That's where you fly deep, a drone down. Is that down. hole? Is it possible that it is indeed a continuous hole still that deep? And the reason I ask that is because of things like continental drift mm, and yeah. earthquakes. That's why he's asking. 40,000 feet deep is amazing. He's like, like oh, yeah. I want to know about the biggest hole on the planet. Is it I still, like science. Is it still the biggest hole? <laughs> just curious, you know, for science and stuff. <laughs> It just, I like science, and I'm that's just, my question is for science. I'm just a, I'm mildly interested in a really big hole. <laughs> the deepest hole. <laughs> now, theoretically, how oh. big of a hole are we talking? <laughs> <It's> like, <laughs> I like science. That's the only question I have is for science. <laughs> but can I see the hole? <laughs> for science! Dear lady, please, I want to see hole only for science. <laughs> You'll show me 40,000 foot hole right now. <laughs> that's taller than now. Wow, that's pretty wild, right? But is it still? You may think I'm stupid. I'm sure there's some people rolling their eyes. This and going, is a crazy oh, of question. Of course not, you idiot. Or, duh. But no, I'm, I'm being kind of genuine here. <laughs> I've always wondered: Does it still go straight down? Personal 40, inquiries. Feet? Is that possible? <laughs> Subtropical swamp in Louisiana, USA. <laughs> that is oh, sick. Man, I, was, I would never yeah. want to visit here. But yes. I've had this. Dude, it looks like they. F oh, god damn. What? Shrek would fuck that place up. <laughs> I didn't know. I thought you farted or something. Shrek would fuck that place up, dude. Yeah, well, let's not pretend like you like Louisiana. What are you even saying? Because when we were driving there, you were all against driving over water. No, it wasn't. Yes, you were. Yes, you were. You didn't want to drive over water. I respect Shrek. You didn't. You were Can scared. Can we get that on a shirt? I respect Shrek. That doesn't Dreamworks make it happen. I'm not gonna disturb the man. You want to go? You what you want to do is take your gas-powered motor and destroy, oh. destroy oh, the, the problem, the environment. Okay, we'll get an electric motor and then we can go. I'm not gonna disturb Shrek with any kind of motorized anything. All right, let's walk it. He wants to go. <laughs> I'll go waiting in it. The longest bridge over water is in Louisiana. Isn't it true? And it's a, an atrocity. You and your Bucky's t-shirt. You don't give a fuck about the environment. What are you talking? What? <laughs> what are you talking about? You know what? I wouldn't say shit about Bucky's. You know, you know, you're right. I'd be careful. No, you're right. I'd be careful. You see this photo right here? I'd be careful. There would be a really nice Bucky's that could go over all this environment. Why Bucky's we, would never do that. Why don't we just take a big old fucking machine? Bulldozer. Just, yeah, one of you those. You got it. Whatever it is. <laughs> why don't we just take one of those and level it and put a Bucky's there? You'd like that, wouldn't you? 
No, let's because, just let's uh, take no because there's not a lot of traffic no, there. You know what? Fuck I don't a bulldozer. Think any, I don't think we need Oppenheimer to drop a fucking nuke on Louisiana. <laughs> I don't just, think the let's supply turn and demand Louisiana would be there. into a Bucky's. Okay, the supply and demand's not there. It fuck doesn't that. look like a lot of people travel you know through what? that area. The Indian Ocean, blow it the fuck up. Let's you know put what? a Bucky's all over it. You love Shrek so much. We'll Ask put, him. We'll let the Ask eighteen him. wheelers in there. We'll blow up the Indian Ocean and let the 18-wheelers come into Bucky's. Listen, I'm not sponsored, but I want you to tell me right now, Shrek wouldn't like Bucky's with fucking no, beef he wouldn't. jerky. No, he would like what's on the screen right now. You're smoking crack. Peace and, you and think- tranquility. Not people like, where's the beaver nuggets? Scratching their ass. Oh, they got nice bathrooms here. Go smear my shit on the wall. No one does that. You've, you've read propaganda. Have I? Yes. I've been to Bucky's. Bucky's bathroom's cleanest in the nation. Yeah, you know why? Because they could level 15 acres. Like, okay. <laughs> All right. Well, our look. bathrooms are so clean they take up a quarter mile. You're the one that brought up build a Bucky's here. I would never do that. Level and Bucky's it. would never do that either. They would level it, build a Bucky's. Fuck it. Way to change the subject because you're scared of driving over water. <laughs> Strange obsession with how the bayou looks. It feels. Shut like the hell up. Turning land into Bucky's. <laughs> Again, I With wouldn't go there because I like to not be eaten alive by bugs of many kinds and alligators and all that fun stuff. Whatever, but, man. I mean, look at it. It's got a really crazy beauty to it, doesn't it? Mm. Anyway, let's move on, shall we? On the sidewalk in New York City, abandoned walker, keys, and what looks to be a switchblade. What okay. happened here? Honestly, anything on the sidewalk in NYC is probably just not something not we should be thinking odd. about. So let's move on. Vintage forbidden candy <laughs> identification <laughs> chart. Yiddish candy. Forbidden candy. Oh, oh, because for some strange reason, a lot of medicine and candy looked identical. Um, wow. I think a lot of candy and medicine might still look pretty similar, but they've gotten pretty good about very perfectly describing the medicine that comes in your bottles and making sure that it stays that is in crazy. Said bottles and all that stuff, so your kids don't pop them open and go, hmm. Whatever the hell's in there, I don't know what you take, but yeah, that's just, damn. That explains why one time I thought I was eating M&M's. Oh, here we go. <laughs> yep. My big toe enlarged. <laughs> yeah. If you guys ever wondered, why is he the way he is? I want you to just read the diagram. I'll get out of the way. OxyClean and Clorox <laughs> are my... <laughs> you deserve to be in that picture alone. OxyClean and... <laughs> Tide Pods ain't that bad. <laughs> I like Skittles. <laughs> <laughs> oh, me too, good boy. <laughs> I, I like Reese's. I like Skittles and gum. I like when Billy Mays told me, <laughs> happy, happy white pounder. <laughs> so many of these are just straight up. Someone Bro, is copying look at the these other. things. Who's copying who? Are the candy companies making their candy look like medicine? Or are the stupid pharmaceutical companies making the medicine look like candy? What's the difference? Either way, it's really or are they owned by the same people? Sorry, just eat no them both at the same time like and they cancel each other out. You don't want to blow your own mind. Doll collection. There the are same people hundreds. don't own them. Don't worry. Guess who inherits them? Well, if you do, you'll be able to find a psycho out there who's going to pay a lot of money for all of these creepy little creatures. <laughs> Unless you really like them, too. You can keep them. I mean, if they're coming to you. This person's house, okay? Whoa! <laughs> that is an overly stimulating home I'm looking at. Looks like in Canada. I can at this all like, uh, and targets. still not see everything that's in this picture. Difference between the interiors of the, the AO Exploration Submersible, as shown in National Geographic's Ayo. Back to Titanic documentary, versus Ocean Gate's Titan. We have got to get off this subject at some point soon. And yeah, look at that. It's very, 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 very different, is it not? Again, I think we've talked about it into the ground, but just know that the Ocean Gate Submersible was made out of uh, seemingly expired products, mainly carbon fiber, which you shouldn't really take that far down into the ocean meanwhile look at that guy look at that guy I, I i don't know i don't know i want to wash my hands of this from now on if i do see another ocean gate post i'm just gonna move past it because what's been said has been said you've There's got it really all figured out we can truly talk about in regards to it underwater tunnel connecting denmark and sweden huh, oh that's kind of insane as a kid people used to tell me about like big underwater tunnels and stuff you know there's one of these and chat someone tell me maryland virginia i told you about it that shit is crazy 
Yeah. You been through it? Mm -hmm. All right. Stuff like that, and I would never believe him because I thought, "What? How's that possible?" And I took I'm my bass tracker right through it. I think is what? What do you mean through how's it? How's that possible? I and do want to know how that's I feel possible. Like I've a roller coaster. Seen the process a little bit for how you would construct something like this, but I can't even make a tunnel underwater in f Minecraft, let alone comprehend. <sighs> Moses. Oh my God! Came out with a staff. All right. Yeah, we all hear stories and we believe. Well, how do you think it was made? Huh? How, I mean, what? You want me to like give you an explanation how they did that? No, I'm just saying. I know Moses had a staff one day. He walked. Who all up, was on the staff? He walked up and said, "You know what? There needs to be chief of staff. There needs to be an intersection. <laughs> we need some red lights and a bridge." <laughs> That's not an okay. It's not an intersection. What is it then? It's a tunnel. What's the difference? You got me on that one. It looks like a stingray kind of. In all seriousness, it looks I like would like to know. You know, they said, they said, look, we're going to find a stingray with autism and build a big ass thing based <laughs> off of it. <laughs> Seriously, bro. You build the bridge, okay? We get done with the bridge. Mm -hmm. The bridge goes down. You call, you call Badlands Chugs. He gets his big ass extra reinforced straw. <laughs> talked about me going off camera to scratch my ass. He walked off camera to fart. Don't In even. case someone had a thermal camera. Don't even. You never know. Don't even. Badlands Chugs did that. He, he could. Well, they better pay him a lot of money because that shit's crazy. They built the bridge and they're like, all right, Badlands, come out here to the end of the bridge and suck it up. And he just said, I just would love to know. <sighs> Chugging the world. <laughs> one bottle at a time. One ocean at a time. One One bay. I want to know how they get, when they get right here, right? Okay. Boom. Here we are. We're right in that area. Project begins. I want a tunnel underneath the ocean. All right. Go ahead. Let me know when it's done. Boop, 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 beep, beep, beep. <laughs> Hello, Biden. Get me Badlands Chugs on the phone. They go through their little directory. Badlands Glugs. Badlands Hugs. Boom, there he is, Badlands Chugs. Boop, 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 beep. Sir, we're going to give you $20 and a GoPro. Come out to the end of this bridge and suck the ocean up through your reinforced Why would they straw. want that on GoPro? They don't want They don't want anyone to know about that. <laughs> they used lava. That's actually a better explanation than what no, this fucking not. idiot is Badlands saying. Badlands Chugs can handle it. You're just a non-believer. That's your problem. You have no faith. Yeah. <laughs> Spell that. How some of the smartest people on the planet do something like this. It's smart. It ain't real. No, That's the whole thing. It ain't real. Dome. Marshall Island. It's actually a portal. I don't like that name. Wait, That's a oh, UFO what is this? that Wait, fell. A cactus dome? Hold on. Are we sure that's a cactus dome and not an extraterrestrial saucer? You know, like the one used in Indiana Jones and the Kingdom of the Crystal Skull. One of my favorites. <laughs> I'm kidding. It's not one of my favorites. I just enjoy it. Anyway, look. What am I looking at? I UFO? feel like I need a more up-to-date photograph for this because I am not. I should pressure wash that thing. Of the imagination <laughs> going to believe that this is anything but an alien flying saucer. You know, red man. Men from Mars? No, not red men from Mars. It's green men from Mars. That's like not a that bad idea. Of, like retro <laughs> futurism sci-fi. That's what I'm getting here. The brain of a common bottlenose dolphin. No. Nope. Oh, here we go. Right, and a wild boar brain on the left. Okay. Hmm. Good God. Don't they say the more wrinkles, the smarter? Or, well, because damn. Okay. The dolphins really are flexing out here. All right. It's not much bigger than ours. All but right. Yeah, look at all those wrinkles. Okay. It has to be said. <sighs> that was like a fucking nutsack. Human on the is right. Is that what you were going to say? That no. was like my fucking nutsack. I it does to actually it. look like one. Maybe that is what I was going to say. Dolphin, uh, dolphins, oh, they're so smart. They got nutsack brains. Go ahead. Tell me. Oh, they're so smart. They know how to recognize other dolphins. Ah, uh, no, 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 I'm not going to tell talk, you a little. They can talk to each other. They're the, in, only mammals the that, water. they're only mammals that surf or have sex for pleasure or have different cultures around the world. I can text someone in listen, Syria. Listen. I can text someone in Syria right now and get them to make a hot pocket. Okay, that's fair. But 
the frontal cortex of a dolphin is five times larger than that of a human's. Okay, if these creatures uh, dude, were dolphin, conscious, get a dolphin to spell to brain, or just like we are. So that's the like, that's how you measure out, intelligence. I'm a dolphin. I want you to you measure a, intelligence by if they can spell an English word. Ask a dolphin how to spell brain in dolphin language. What do you mean in dolphin language? They have their own language. They can communicate. What if they don't spell? What if they're like dolphins spell, know how to make mayonnaise well, under the water? Fifty thousand well, years they ago, they can't spell brain. Well, we used to spell, but you know that was like you know fifty thousand years ago. Yeah, now we don't spell. We're just out here. Like, we don't understand. You must not be as smart as us. We don't get it. We have nutsack brain, but we can't spell it. That's like going up to an uncontacted tribe and being like, can you spell brain for me? Actually, it's not. It's the other way around. Actually, I fucked that up, but don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. <laughs> I'm just saying. They're pretty All I'm saying smart. is they have a blowhole. I'm going to fuck it. And their big ass nutsack brain ain't going to stop me. But they're going to tell their friends. And when you go back there 40 years later, you are dead. You are dead. Dolphins ain't going to live that long. No, but they passed the story down. <laughs> <laughs> like, what, what is that one over there? That's like that's a wild boar. Regardless I don't know why the fuck they put that in there. Round, we May as well put a cucumber on that side. Very quickly, okay? <laughs> they would figure out a way to get at us very soon. I mean, look at what's happening with the orcas. They're training each other to go after the rudders of frickin' fishing boats and... Honestly, I kind of wish they were just targeting yachts and giant rich people sailing boats and well, the mega yachts as well. Because I think that they could band together and go after a certain billionaire's mega yacht just to fuck with it, you know? Not to destroy it or harm anybody, but just to make it inconvenient, right? Wouldn't that be nice? Anyway, that's the last post for today. I'm just going <sighs> to move on over to my next set of... Oh, God, I'm doing what sub next? No, no, no. What Dear a God. nice lady. I You smell like Donkey Kong. Uh. You smell like Listen. You smell like I wanted to show you that because I wanted to make you scared. I wanted to terrify you in an odd manner. All right, well you got me. That was it. That was the video. I know, I'm scared. You what do got you me. what are you scared of? Dolphins. Dolphins. Yeah. Bottle and uh, tunnels built by Badlands and uh, white spiders. So you learned your lesson. Everything's learned. Stay away from cum spiders. If you need to build a tunnel underwater, call Badlands. Amen. And dolphins have nutsack brains. Yeah. All right. It's pretty simple. That was my goal. Glad we achieved it. Did I pass? You passed. Oh, thank God. I want to watch you pass a kidney stone live on Twitch. Piss one out right now, you son of a bitch. You think you would get in trouble if you did that? Probably not. It could be like, it's educational, I'm going to piss out a fucking... How to piss out kidney stone. How to piss out a fucking mineral out of my dick. Lionel. Is it a mineral, though? I don't know. I don't either. Ask, a, ask your dolphin friend who knows how to spell everything. <laughs> yeah, because you're only smart if you can spell English words. It makes sense. That's yeah. pretty damn smart to me. If you can't spell English words, I mean, you may as well be fucking stupid. All right. Tell them to write it in Mandarin. I don't give a fuck. Tell Why do they have to write anything? Tell a dolphin to write kidney stones What if they said, Mandarin. imagine writing? We used to write 20,000 years ago. Imagine writing shit down. How are they going to tell you that? Their nutsack brain? They say it to each other. They make yeah. fun of you. Really? When you're up on, the, on your jet ski and you're like, can you write the word brain? They're like, yeah, I remember that. Oh, my great, 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 great grandfather told me about that shit. Yeah, now we're just swimming do. around and where you guys dump y'all shit and batteries. Well, we're actually living in the largest place on we're earth, just which is the ocean. We're just swimming around and where we're you guys We're actually living where, old... you know, most of the earth is water, which is where we live. Yeah, my, my best friend Dave got shocked by lithium ion battery. Some cart knocks in this hoe. You mean some <laughs> dolphins are dumb? dollars <laughs> Yeah, I believe it. Meanwhile, we got humans that are throwing rocks at fucking drones. They're like, yeah, y'all got us. You can spell pot. Some just of saying. us can. I can't spell it. Hey, I'm just saying. Listen, I might be jealous of dolphins, all right? You just want to fucking make me feel insecure. On my they life. live in the biggest place on earth. You just want to embarrass me. That's fine. In front of all the dolphins. <laughs> <laughs> Just trying to get if you're a dolphin watching this, though, fuck you, bro. Hey, if you're, you're a, shit. if you're a dolphin, leave a comment. 
If you're a dolphin, why ain't you golfing? If you're a dolphin, leave a comment saying <laughs> brain and mandarin or something. You're so fucking smart. Yeah. You're all so fucking smart. All the dolphins leave a comment. Come on. Yeah. You got this. Where are you watching from, dolphin? What what ocean? You're so cool. They're like, yeah, well, I remember when we used to call them oceans. <laughs> They're like, yeah, I remember when the... side died in the toilet. I Oh. If dolphins are so smart, dolphins have the same brains as orcas. They're an orca is a dolphin. They're in the same subset of animals. If dolphins are so smart, why can I blow them up with a gun? That's a philosophical question. Is it, dude? Because I never asked anything about Phil or socks. <laughs> I was talking about dolphins. Soft. But that's the same thing as saying, why can a dolphin eat you alive if you're swimming in the ocean? No, it's not. And what does that I say about you, you why, that why people would I kill not, a dolphin and they wouldn't kill you? dolphins are so smart, why? I could go up to a dolphin tonight right. with a stick of dynamite and put it in its blowhole. Well, you couldn't really do that, no. I could do it. Mm, you couldn't do that. SEAL Team 6 did it. SEALs are smarter than dolphins. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe the SEALs on the team... Why are they called Dolphin Team 6? <laughs> They're so fucking because smart. Because they don't want you to know about that. Uh, Why would they want you to know that? Dolphin Team 6. Exactly. Yeah, the CIA is about to blow my head off through a window over there since I said that. If it was Dolphin Team 6, there'd be no problems in the world. <laughs> and I'm just saying, you can say I can shoot a dolphin with a gun. Boom. Why A dolphin could eat you alive on the beach. What point have you proved? Uh, there's no point. I'm just asking a, a Phil Sock question. Well, the Phil Sock is, dolphins would never do that. A dolphin could they're way a, ahead of us. Dolphins don't even wear socks. If That's you, all I need to know. If you landed on Earth, all right, listen, all here right. you come. <laughs> Boom, fly in. Bam. Welcome uh, to you're Earth. You're already more advanced than dolphins because they can't fly. No, you didn't fly in. You landed. You just, boom, woke up. On on land? It's or like creating in, a character. On land or in the water? Right on the coast. All right. <laughs> <laughs> you're soaking wet, but you can feel sand. You're right on the coast. All right, just like dolphins. Which, that doesn't even matter. Okay. All right, I'll tell you this. You land on the moon, and they say... All right, just like the dolphins. They say, look, you're going there, and they point at Earth. And don't worry about who they is, but they say, look, you're going to Earth. What do you want to do? What you want to do? Like anything? What? Look at all of Earth. All right. You want to be a caterpillar? Like, are you asking? You want to be a dog? Are you asking me what sentient sentient being I want to become? You have to go to Earth. Okay. You got to be a part of that shit. All right. What you gonna do? How long of a time do I have to choose? You go to Earth in ten seconds. Go. Ten seconds. All right. I want to be. Well, I'll give you thirty. Thirty give seconds. You 30. All right. Um. I want to be a molecule. That's not a. That doesn't even make sense. I want to be an atom. Okay, you have to be a living creature. All right. Uh, <laughs> an atom is never... Dude, you would be an atom forever. Uh, it would just be there forever. I want to be James James Hetfield's... Uh, I want to be a... No, you have to be a... Cre you have to be... A oh living being. Oh, my God. Dude, All forget right. it. All right. Just forget it. Um, you have to be an animal. You have to be an animal. Okay. You have to choose. You have to be one. I want to be a T-Rex. They're not there, so, so you're dead. dead. They're not you there. You haven't been past the ice wall. Oh, my God. Get the... F <laughs> Skip. <laughs> Brady, edit this out. I want to be... <laughs> I want to be Mark Zuckerberg. Boom. You All have right. landed on Earth. You All don't right. get to choose. All right. All right. I'm going to be, be the richest person who does whatever. You have to say, like, oh, I am this. I am an animal. You have to... Live a life. You have to live a life. All right. And then when your life is over, you're done. Okay. What are you going to do? Um, hmm. I can't pick dragon. Okay, dude. Uh, All right, no, I real. understand you're trying not to say dolphin. But I'm not going to be a dolphin. Just think about this. I want to be a silverback. Why? They have to fight other things. It's a horrible life. It says who? Dolphins Either have to get, fight? No, they don't. They get it. They're in a pod. Oh, yeah, they're, they're good. in a pod. They're chilling. They got the E pod. If you become a silverback, you have to fight something. Okay. 
There's MMA fighters. They're doing that for money, though. Silverbacks are doing it for bananas and shit. I don't know. It's, it's all like relative. That. That's fair. All right. All right. Well, boom. Enjoy your life as a silverback. I would love it. I'm sure you would, dude. Swing from those trees. Get some fungal infection and die. Fucking lose your foot. Get eaten alive by a chimp. Have a good life. I'm swimming around in the goddamn ocean, dude. I am living life. I I, mean, I'm I, following you boats. Said I I'm eating free fish. You said I couldn't be Jeff Bezos. So I'm you don't be get a, to pick like I'll, I'll be this. I want to be Jeff Bezos. All right, I'll be a silverback. You don't like any of my fucking choices, dude. I'm just saying. You're not. Picking. I want to be a Zen pouch. <laughs> a randomly selected Willy Wonka Zen pouch. I'm gonna be a fruit fly. Twelve days and I'm out this fucking yeah, thing. Yeah, you just fucking eat shit. You're just <laughs> eating other people's fruit. And I wouldn't shit. even eat. I'd be a. I. I tell you what. I'd be a fruit fly that's fasting. I'll live 24 hours. <laughs> <laughs> And all the other fruit flies are like, the fuck is wrong with this maniac? <laughs> I tell you what, I would be... Oh, a, they can talk all of a sudden? Well, dolphins can. Why can't fruit flies? You just make up the rules as you go? <laughs> How do we know dolphins are the only ones that can fucking talk? They're underwater. You ever tried to talk underwater? It sounds like... Because you're not a dolphin. Okay, well, you're not a fucking fruit fly. All right? You don't know how they, how they talk. I know how dolphins talk. How? Tell Dolphins me. have names for each other. Brain? Chat, someone tell this man to shut the hell up. He doesn't even know. I would Fun be, fact. If I would be a pimento cheese salesman. A simple life. <laughs> what are you talking about? <laughs> it's a simple you life. You don't sell pimento cheese. You make it. Out of what? The Dolphins know. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Thanks for the... You'd probably be you'd probably be a fucking clump of kelp in the ocean. <laughs> That's not that bad. <laughs> That's what you would be. I'd be fine with that. You'd be one of them seaweeds that gets hit by a boat prop and floats away and rots in the sun. I'd be a jellyfish. <laughs> <laughs> That's actually smart because they never die. Really? I don't know. <laughs> I'm fucking. I'm just fucking yapping at this point. This is a horrible so, idea. All right, Brady, you, delete all of this. Don't leave it in. If, you're gonna, <laughs> <laughs> if you were going to be um, a mammal, zap down to earth. I would be Kirk Hammett. <laughs> <laughs> That's not what I said. I said I'd be Jeff Bezos. I was going to say that I was going to be a... Uh, so you would become Jeff Bezos and what? You'd do the same thing he did? No, I'd let the Amazon workers piss in, uh, in like bathrooms or something. So you'd... Get all the way to where they make Amazon, but you would just change the rules on where they can pee. Yeah. Hmm. Put it in this bio. And then I go out there <laughs> with my custom-made Amazon harpoon gun, and I'd blow the head off of every dolphin I saw. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> And they'd be like, oh, right, Jeff Bezos, why is Amazon so evil? <laughs> now we're say, getting somewhere. Because before God let me choose what I wanted to be, some asshole lectured me on dolphins <laughs> for half an hour. <laughs> so now I'm going to kill every sea turtle I see. <laughs> Plastic straws for everybody. <laughs> it all makes sense. You know now. what? Amazon would have, you could order plastic straws for free. It would come with every purchase. <laughs> every, yeah. Yeah. And with a, your a order used car prime. battery. Yeah. <laughs> Throw it in the ocean with proof for you 50% get a pack off of your next purchase. <laughs> Send us a picture of 12 straws would, in the you ocean. You know what? I would become the CEO of BP. And when the oil spill happened, I'd say, you know what? You guys can suck my ass. And I'd get every trucker in America that was hauling oil around to back up onto the fucking beaches and just let them hang. All right. Now we're on the same page. i say, figure it out, dolphins. <laughs> And you know what? They probably would. <laughs> I'd say, hola, basabala. <laughs> Figure it out, motherfucker. They'd be like, this ain't the first time we've seen this shit. You're so smart. We don't need Don dish soap. We need dolphins. It's the truth. <laughs> I'm just saying, man. Look, they're smart fuckers. I don't know what you got against them. I might actually become... Um... Why would you not become a dolphin? Tell me that. I don't know, man. I... Give me a reason you would not want to be a dolphin. Because I might want to be like a clam. Not because you want to be something or else. Or a hermit crab. 
I want to be a hermit crab in Indonesia because no one's fucking with me. Someone fact I wanna, check that. I wanna make me a hermit. How many hermit crabs die in Indonesia every day? I want to be a landlocked hermit crab. Because someone would someone leave a comment. How many hermit crabs die in Indonesia every day? No, make me a hermit crab in South Dakota, because people would see me and they'd be like, "The fuck, that's a hermit crab. Like, that's probably rare." I'd be a blue hermit crab because blue is like the rarest color in nature. A blue hermit, neon blue, a neon blue hermit crab in South Dakota. I'm, I'll be honest with you. Who's with me? I can't argue with that. I cannot argue with that. <laughs> Me and you would be, we would never meet. <laughs> I'd be, I'd be over in the ocean. Uh, I want to be a landlocked. I'd be like, I heard tales of a man. He's a blue crab. A landlocked hermit crab. I'd be like royalty. So For about four hours and then you would die. You'd either get ran over, stepped on, or I mean, you would, there's no water. Exactly. That'd be great. The mayor of wherever would be like, holy shit, that's a neon blue hermit crab. <laughs> Dude. Not. 6% ain't right. <laughs> All right. Yeah. All right. Well, uh, you got me on that one. I hope you enjoy your life as a neon blue hermit crab in South Dakota. <laughs> Brady, take all this and delete it. <laughs> a neon blue hermit crab in South Dakota. Someone tell me, give me your opinion right now in chat. What are y'all saying to this? This is unbelievable. I want to be a left-handed billy goat in Wyoming. All right, <laughs> we're going to watch some carton arcs. Oh, unbelievable. South Dakota doesn't exist. It ain't real. No, I would be a neon blue hermit crab in North Korea. <sighs> we're gonna Actually, that's not, you know what? Nah, I can't say that. But let's just say I'd be the leader of something. <laughs> <laughs> Let my people go. Oh, man. Neon blue dolphin. We can meet in the middle. <laughs> <laughs> I'd be a neon blue dolphin in South Dakota. <laughs> I, I would be the red lobster. All right. Hey. I'd probably be one of them redwood trees. So I could just sit so there. So people can saw a big hole in you so a Kia can fit through it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. What a grand life. Oh, my God, I'd dude. I'd be a neon red tree in California. Hey, everybody. I'd be a white tree so they'd make the Hollywood sign out of me. <laughs> I'd be Will Smith's pet slug. <laughs> oh, I'd probably become the uh, Taco Bell theme song. <laughs> All right. Hey, I'd want to be an Arabian camel in the Amazon. All right. Hey, everyone's, you got a free choice. What would you guys want to be? Leave a How comment. About, comment that. Boom. You crash into the earth. What are you? What you want to be? I'd be Ed Sheeran's pinky finger. <laughs> <laughs> you could be anything you want. You get a choice. Oh, that'd be a Santa Claus beard. Only be used once a year. A bald eagle. Ooh, Flamingo fl in Kansas. Yeah, that's a good one. Jack Black's dog. A blue whale in the jungle. Fair enough. Hey, you get a free choice. Oh. Y'all are fucking hilarious, bro. For real. <laughs> Ethan's foreskin. <laughs> a meatball, garlic bread. I want everybody to know that stream that we did with the ABS thing. That was one of the funniest things I've ever been a part of. That shit was hilarious. You guys are hilarious. Chat, what does OZB stand for? A Z? Oh, man. OZB. 
You should have done OCB. It's all right, though. I forgive you. I want to challenge him. That's a good idea. OZB. All right, chat. If you're watching on YouTube, be sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. We're going to watch some cart narcs. You guys love this shit. We love it. We're going to get back into it, baby. Cart oh, cart narcs is legendary. He's uploaded a lot of videos, so we have a lot of shit to watch and uh, catch up with. Mr. Cart narc, if you ever see this, I'm a huge fan. Let Don't us, listen to the haters. Let us be a cart narc. Yeah. Let me come work for you. I work for free. He's uploaded a lot of shit. So let's uh let's see what's up. Orange zebra bacon. <laughs> How many videos? I mean, yeah. I will physically assault you. But that's against the law, sir. A man in the maroon. He's got a cart return there. Oculars. And he said, "No, -uh. I'm on a split spot a right there." Next to the Obese Wait, zoologist pussy. Oak Resort. That's bitches. not where the cars go. <laughs> you got a car return right behind you. You're right over there. You can't be leaving the carts right there, uh, laddie. Not outside the Ralphs. <laughs> what are we going to do? It's just like a fucking knockoff Walgreens. It's Ralphs. Excuse me. Did you not hear the story? I forget. Cal about Wait, where is this? Sorry. Oh, the Dolphins made it. Do oh, Dr. Dolphin Ralph made it. He said, you know what? People need a, a pickup walk-up pharmacy. And they also need to buy freeform shoes. You want me to say I hate dolphins? Ah. Uh, Where is this? Says I don't return my shopping cart like. I'll talk to you over here. You left your cart here blocking this spot. Now it's harder for people to get in and out of this area. And you shouldn't drive with headphones in either. It's unsafe. It's also illegal, I believe. Would you like to take your cart back, sir? Are you, are you pulling up a Lazy Bones playlist? <laughs> <laughs> Songs to be lazy by. Is that a Spotify, <laughs> iTunes? It's really scrolling through there. Pandora. Is that still around? iHeartRadio. Omnipotent oh. zebra bacon. Oh, yeah, yeah. See, I said I don't return my shop. I'll show you. So they don't return my shopping cart like a jerk. Because you left your cart right here. When it belongs back, get the cart return. Take that off my truck now. But you understand that you're sure you're take that off my truck now. What if or I said else. take your cart back now, but I was more polite than you? Would you do it for me? Take that off my truck now. Why do you think I did it? Did I break your brain, life. sir? <laughs> Don't hit the cart. Oh, you gotta take your cart? Oh no, I caught it. <laughs> Got another one for you. There you go. Oh no, got another one for you. Up here this time. Where'd you go? <laughs> Didn't see oh. it. Baby, hope you don't have any shrapnel. This guy's well, thank you for getting out to take your cart back. I love it, sir. Would you like to give me a hug? I'm glad you've seen the error of your ways. Chop! Block your tech. Now, sir, you understand when you leave your cart out, it can be damaging to other people's cars. Here. I thought one more time, I will physically assault you. But that's against the law, <laughs> sir. It's against the law for you to put that on my truck also. What law do you, would you say I'm breaking? Got him. See, fake out number there, knock tears. Now, sir, you fell for the fake out that your, your ego's got in your way in there. Also, I'm very scared of you, clearly. Because you're a big tough guy, and I don't want to fight over the cart. I want you to take the cart back, please. Will you be a sweetheart? You know why they have cart returns, right? Uh-oh. I won't hurt you, I promise. <laughs> it's quite a mean mug you have there, sir. Thousand yard stare of laziness. See, I got a other one for you right here. You can't be falling for the fake out, people. Take out again. Just return the cart. And we ask you something? So we want to Oh, these are guys from, uh, from a German TV show. What the fuck? I'll go put the uh, cart back on. Right back on since he's driving. What is going on here? There's a German in a Cracker Barrel t-shirt. <laughs> Dude, I would be Actually, like... I didn't even see that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> this is like a fever dream and a half. <laughs> this is wild. You got a Holy return card. Oh, watch out, guys. Be Thank careful. Thank you for the thousand This beans, is a lazy bones. He's already threatened me before. These are Germans. They're very fast and powerful, though, sir. So be, I just want you to... We're never, no one's going to hurt you, though. No one's going to hurt you. Watch out behind you. A car the behind Blitzkrieg you. The Blitzkrieg is coming. Be careful. 
I know lazy bones don't like uh, looking right before they leap, so to speak. But um, at least he is looking now. Uh, unfortunately, Narcoteers, you know, it's not a terrible, but it does, you know, there's this much. You can't park where you would have been able to open doors and stuff. Sorry, have you thought about what you did? Goodness gracious. I'm sorry he wouldn't talk to you guys, but that's quite... Uh, how are you doing, sir? Just hanging out? <laughs> sir, will you take your car back now? This guy's bumping some killer tunes. Well, I've already got the one. <laughs> Deputy Claire. Watch out, Deputy Claire. He's a confirmed Lazy Bones. Who has threatened? I was in the bathroom, but I heard all about it. Is it true that you're a lazy bone and did not return your car to the car return? He's he a man of two words, Deputy Claire. Be careful. Why don't you return your car? All right, watch out. It's the responsibility of some other than yourself. Anybody notice the one of this music is, Narcoteers? I'm not familiar. <laughs> you know this song, Deputy Claire? That's one of my favorites. <laughs> Thank you for the consideration, Hello. sir. Well, we'll do, uh, for folks who don't know, these are some fan, fine guys from uh, RTL, that's a German network. And uh, thanks for the five dollars. I think what you guys saw there is when you went to talk to him, he was talking to me, and you'll hear on my audio that he said, if you put another magnet on my car, I will physically assault you. That's what he said to me. But I think the thing with Lazy Bones is when they see there's a group against them, they know that, oh. You think these people upload this to like only German speaking people? And they're just watching, like, what in the fuck is going on? Mm -hmm. I bet some people still get it, though. Cause I mean, actually, I bet most people would still understand what's going on. Yeah, probably in Germany, they got dolphins that take the groceries out for them. He's such a hater. Oh, I am doing the wrong thing. I can't bully <laughs> me. In that case, he was—he he specifically said he would hurt me. Um, but when he sees the group of folks, he crime. knows, uh, not only am I wrong morally, ethically, <laughs> But now I don't have the physical advantage. Not that he had the physical advantage over me, obviously. But uh, and that, <laughs> but you kind of see human psychology at work. That you guys, he's like, oh, I'm being shamed. I, he knows he did the wrong thing. He had no explanation for why he did what he did. These guys are just like, I have no idea what he is. <laughs> they're just sitting there like, what is he saying? I don't know. <laughs> like, very much, yes, very much. Da. <laughs> Other than I'm going to hurt you. don't touch my fan. So. What's the explanation for the behavior that it's always the same? Instead of just bringing the car back, people start a discussion with you and saying they don't have time, but they stay like 10 minutes more. Because they, they go to the easy excuse because they are used to people believing the easy excuse. They, they, people usually just, oh, okay, I'll let you go. But I, I've heard all these excuses. I know they're lies, essentially, and just that, excuses. Amen. So when I hear that, I, I counter with arguments and logic, and that kind of breaks down. They're like, uh, I don't have... To the point that in this case, he just threatened to beat me up. He said, I will physically assault you. <laughs> Although you might have seen, I, I put the magnet on there. I fake magnet on there. He gets out and he looks even dumber when he's like, oh, darn it. Uh, but then again, peer pressure. Oh, how's it one. going? People are yelling cart narcs. <laughs> uh, peer pressure. Again, he knew, he knew, but again, he knew he was wrong. The peer pressure of, oh, my other fellow human beings are shaming me because this is the wrong thing to do. And he knew that the whole time. But again, he wanted to be a bully to me alone. At this moment, when he threatened you, like, oh, I'm, gonna, I'm going to beat you, this moment, how did you feel about it, you think? I wasn't scared of him for several reasons. Number one, no offense, he's a middle-aged man. And uh, look, I'm no spring chicken myself. Uh, it's an American phrase meaning young, you know, young chick. Uh, but at the same time, I'm bigger, stronger, faster than him. But I guess another human psychology thing. They think if they threaten violence, even someone like myself, I don't, I don't want to fight him. And I told him that. They think that's enough to bully. That's that classic. That is bullying. People say, oh, the cart narcs, you bully. No, that is bullying. Threatening to beat someone up over a magnet on your truck, that is textbook bullying. Amen. Oh, how's it going? What's your name? Eric. Eric, nice Sebastian. Yeah. These are some guys from uh, Germany. They're here to like film like a piece for their news oh, channel or whatever. Okay. Uh, would you like a sticker, Eric? Yes, please. My head. Germany just has nothing interesting going on. <laughs> We will go to America. <laughs> there is crazy man who does not let people take their cars back. We must go film. <laughs> I love it. Oh, it's beautiful. It's a good point he's making, everybody. They got take their, your cart back. They got their work visas to go over and film the dude doing cart narcs. It's, it's a lovely world. The rock we live on is lovely. <laughs>
You have chosen to be an on-cart returner. I am a dolphin in the ocean. <laughs> <laughs> Dolphins don't have carts. <laughs> Thanks for the hundred beans. That my dad actually watches you a lot. I'm trying to have him answer my freaking FaceTime. Oh my god! I know. <laughs> das Ado! <laughs> das Ado! <laughs> The German is on the fucking Segway, boy. Yes, sir. Oh, my God. Look at these guys styling. That's legit. We got the dude in the, the jeans. Look at the faded denim. We got the, the German with the cargo shorts and the Cracker Barrel shirt on the Segway. We got the motherfucking Ryan Seacrest of Germany in the jean jacket. Amen. With the black fucking skinny jeans walking around. I mean, look at that sexy motherfucker. And then you got the cutoff German over here in the short shorts, long socks. And the tank top. Oh my god! I don't god. know if he's from Germany. They didn't say. The only the he only said the other two. He were. was holding a microphone. He's with the fucking network, dude. All right. These well. are some sexy ass Germans at the route. Uh, oh my god! That is Otto. Das Otto, baby. <laughs> <laughs> Look what I got here. How's it going? What's your dad's name? Eric. Pardon? He's fucking FaceTiming DJ Khaled. Right. Hey, how's it going? Bring out the whole ocean. <laughs> Bring Thanks, out all yeah, your, Germany. Your son's, uh, he's, he's being a good guy. He learned that not to be a lazy bones from you, right? <laughs> yeah, right? Pick up your toys. Clean your room, right? <laughs> Take your cart back. It's all the same thing. <laughs> oh, thank you, sir. My thank name. you for the support. I gave him some stickers for you. Yeah. All right. Thank you, sir. Yeah, Have absolutely. No, thanks for stopping by, man. Yeah. Really appreciate it. Thanks a lot. That was wild. Amen. He makes a good point. If you you're mad not about it, get better content from anywhere. If you're mad, then you're not a cart returner. It's that simple. It's beautiful. Look, that's how the terrorists win, is when brave men do nothing. Is when... when terrorists in the Target parking lot? Buddy, we have New Jersey. That's a, look, they had a cart return right over there. It's right on the other side, but it's all the way on the other side. We skip. Your cart's right there. You left your cart blocking the spots. We'll see. I think she's getting out. I'm with the Cart Narcs. We're a highly trained group of sexy agents who help folks take the cart back when they momentarily think about leaving Makes it out. Six months. Blocking other people. Good question. I would like to, but I don't. But I could be anywhere, anytime. Point being now, we have this cart here. Can roll away and hit a car. But you guys are great people who are gonna turn. I'm sorry? I understand. I've been there. You've oh, you've been, you've been had your car hit by a cart? No, no I've worked pushed like cart. in the cart. Oh, right. And, other right. And so, yeah, eventually the cart returners will be out here, certainly. But in the meantime, that cart is loose. Yeah, today, I still have to wait. No! <laughs> At least you didn't lie about it, though. Yeah. But don't you want to feel better? You know how good you'll feel at home? It's like when you, you, you always, like, oh, I don't want to go to the gym. But when you're done with the gym, you're like, I'm glad I went to the gym. You know, some people have, like, hipper, like, health things that Shh. you shouldn't, like, ask about. Have I asked about your health yet? No, but you don't know if, like, someone is unable or... That's true. They need to take advantage of the... Absolutely correct. But what I've seen so far... You should talk to people, but not, like... Nicely, like I am so far? Have I been, haven't I been sweet? Trying to like stop us as the, as we're truly present. I'm just, I, I just waved you down, that's all I did. I, no, I'm not trying to say that this is a bad thing. Like I'm not yes. at all. Thank you. Look at that man, look what he's doing. Look, he's doing the right thing. Great job, sir. Kind of maybe approaching it in a different way where you talk to people about like, hey, did you know that a lot of carts are less? Like, Isn't that what I've done so far? Like you, like, stop right, right. I got your attention with my wand, so for safety, make sure you knew who I was and what I was talking about. I feel like I've done what you're asking. <laughs> when I see someone She's like mind you blown. In the parking lot, like I not. Laughing. It's very hard to That's understand. That's why I'm very open about who I am. We've got cart narcs on our chest. I explain perfectly what we do, right? I understand. But... So now that now that we've had a great talk. Like, instead of trying to tell people like you're a bad person, but I didn't say bad person. I mean, that's kind of instead of maybe just educate people like 
the statistics of how many cars get hit by cars. It's, it's not good. Maybe talk about like the actual facts and information rather than right. standing in front of someone's car. Right, but I can't, I gotta like wave you down because I can't talk through your window, right? I have to like, oh, hey, pardon me. Right, you can talk to people who actually want to come up and talk to you and you can say like, this is what we're here for instead of... I'm not, I'm not quite, so how would you... Uh, I'm gonna be fair. How would you do it? If you were me, how would you? If you saw someone leave their car. Set up like information and have <laughs> like a booth or something. But like, but lazy bones don't wanna come to me. They wanna be, they wanna scurry off and be lazy bones. No, I, I'm not, I totally agree that it's a issue. Like, right there. Where? Oh, yeah, we, we, I was just over there picking up carts when I saw you guys. Yeah. Like, I can total. I'm not trying to say, but like coming in front of someone's car and like waving in front of them to like, so you would, uh, to be to be fair, so you should I should like set up a booth, like with information. Like we were, like us not, you know. So I'm um, just so I would have like a like a booth that said, hey, here's why you should return your. Then go into Target and be like, some guy just approached me like out of nowhere and. Not out of nowhere. I didn't jump from the trees. I, I waved. I was like, hey, how's it going? And I pointed <laughs> to the cart. I'm just saying that some people are not really open to talking to strangers. But you've done a great job. You've done, you've done, may I say, an excellent job for both you guys of, of having a great conversation. Of course, but we kind of have somewhere we need to be and like... What about that cart? Are we gonna get the cart? I mean... See, the problem is no one wants to admit their wrongs and right their wrongs. They want to argue over it for 10 minutes. Whereas if you just got out and returned your cart, there would be no problem. It's not hard to understand. That's all I'm saying. Is he? Yes? He does not want to. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm saying, be the better person. De dig deep inside your heart and say, you know what, today I'm gonna pick up after myself. And I'm- Today I'm just being crazy. But we've had like a five minute conversation. We could have- no, I understand, I understand. but like it's I'm funny on because- your side. We're Yes! Trust we me, do this I'm all the time. Side. And then the one time that we're like, it's really gross out. My shoes hurt, like... Your feet hurt? He doesn't want to do this. <laughs> He's a, I'll so give... One day that you're going to come up to us and, like... That, but that's the point of the cart arts. We're, like, we're, we could be anywhere, anytime. And we're not forcing... <laughs> Sorry? <laughs> I don't believe in, like, car and stop. And it's like, I don't think you guys should, like, go out of the way. Like... Stop, the stop that, crying? Like, the way that you, like, came up to our car when we were clearly, like, I was talking to him, our windows were closed, like... Should I have like taken a number and wait for, wait for an, a conversation opportunity? What I'm saying is maybe people who are open to the information instead of like flagging people about like something, maybe just give people information and have them do what they want. Them. Like a pamphlet on the windshield or how it what? Like I'm honestly asking. Yeah, no, I'm saying like maybe have some like the booth idea or like maybe little business cards with information, like. Give it to people who are interested in your... Well, I do have a sim something like a business card. It's a magnet. It says Lazy Bones on board. But you don't want that because you guys, you guys aren't going to be lazy to do it. Take that. Ah, you want... Like, I'm saying... No, no, it's, you can have it if you want to. It's got a phone number. Oh, but like... Did you like it? I mean, a business card. I've got... Well, I've got different versions. I got that. I've got a... Uh, oh, and i got a giant one so they don't return my shopping cart like a jerk. But you don't want that one, do you? But what I'm saying is like maybe something that's hand out where people come up to you and ask you for information about but uh, to use your analogy about crime stoppers you know if you go to a if i set up a booth outside of a bank and it <laughs> says reasons not to rob the bank a bank robber is going to be like oh let me go over there and talk to them about <laughs> that so, again this is not bank robbing obviously in a potentially like i mean crime is a very different thing than just coming up to someone who's not putting their cart away that is a civil liability though if it, if it were to hit somebody else's car, it would be your fault. Not Nord, that it's, it, not that it's going to, but I'm saying hypothetically, there are, there, you know, like, a small claims court has these sort of cases all the time. You can see like judge Judy cases where somebody left their, you know. Right, but I'm not going to tell you to go stand in the middle of like a standoff, like crime stuff. That's not what I'm So I, th I think we've had a pretty productive conversation. I do like the pamphlet idea, the, the booth idea. But now, let's get back to the point at hand. Are we going to take our cart back? I'm not taking it back. He's not taking it back. The way that back. you like approached and like flagged us down, like that immediately, when I see someone like, I just, usually I don't have 
the greatest inter interactions with people just like yeah we get it you're lazy but you, guys, but you guys were nice this was a fantastic interaction we both we've shared information we've had a nice conversation but i've had some pretty bad experiences with people just like oh yeah sure like so obviously this is not a card sure this could be a solicitation or a carjacking i get that but that's obviously not what's happening. I, I'm very clear about what I'm talking about. Obviously, I don't want I don't want anybody to be scared. Obviously, I mean that that's not open. What do you mean? It just says Cartnarks on it. I I'm not into anything like that. But like that, you know what that vest is, right? Yeah, it's for my protection. Right. Exactly. So you're admitting yourself that you need some protection by just walking up. Well, unfortunately, not you all, because you all are lovely, but there are some lazy bones who have gotten a bit angry because they're like, you can't tell me what to do, and I'm, that's that cart, I don't give a two rats a... You're putting yourself in danger. Like some say I'm a hero for that, but I'm, I, I don't say, I, you don't use that word. <laughs> <laughs> you are a hero. That's a big statement, man. Like, I, okay. Get him, Mark you Mark. Get him. Thank you, sir. Get him. Thank you. So that's one of our fans right there. He's uh, He knows what we are. Agree yourself with um, like, Well, it can be. That. It can be, Why but. You just go stand and have people who want to talk to come. But that's who. I don't need to reach the people that want to talk to me. I need to reach the people that don't want to talk to me. Again, you hey, all are lovely. Oh, I have that. Okay. Here. And that's where, like, that guy probably sees our YouTube or our Instagram or. You've had issues if you're wearing a vest like that. That's true. Absolutely. So maybe rethink. Look, that's how the terrorists win is when brave men do nothing. Is when when Paris in the Target parking lot? All right, cart, you're getting a magnet. Uh, cart terrorists. Obviously, we're being a bit hyperbolic with that sort of language, but <laughs> that was probably the longest. I've had some long conversations with people who were like, want to talk, which she he is did. a hero. Exactly. Got to watch for a second. Sometimes they stop and throw the magnet off, which I believe is what's going to happen here. Oh. Hey, did you want to talk? It. Do you want to reconsider that little conversation? <laughs> No, you can keep it if you want to. Don't litter. But you that, that, I'm saying that so you take it. I don't want it. Well, you can. But don't you want to learn how to be a better person? I'll get out of the way. See? Don't be a litter bug. I just had a nice conversation with you, and now you're telling me I'm not a good person. Well, for for the moment, yeah. Uh oh, I think it was something to the effect of "f off." Until just now. So was I. I'll let her go. There's a, she's getting in the way of traffic. Um, <laughs> I think... <laughs> she's like a little philosophy on you there. Right, but I think... But her philosophy was... Again, her philosophy was... We went through it pretty well there. Was preach to the already converted. Preach to the guy that drove by said, Hey, go Cardinals. <laughs> That's not what Cardinals is for. The, the people preach who are responsible the and who are converted. picking up with themselves... This guy gets them, it. But that's not who our message needs to get to. Our message needs to get to her. And yeah. and I don't, you don't know if you heard really well because her, uh, I guess, boyfriend was in the far side of the car. But he at least was admitting that, like, I'm just feeling like I'm being lazy today. Like, he didn't, she kind of gave us that we were something, we got somewhere to be. You hear that? Like, she got somewhere, we got things to do, which clearly they didn't because they had plenty of time to sit there and argue with me. Thank you for your work, sir. Appreciate it. <laughs> um, also suggesting a booth, set up a booth. <laughs> an information booth. No, but what she brought up with a panel about, like a pamphlet, I should say, about like um, information about now. like the average cost. Because I get messages from car guys, body work guys, like, oh, I've had X number of people bring in dents, you know, dented doors and stuff, and it costs, you know, anywhere from five hundred bucks for a little scratch up to, you know, sometimes thousands to pull out a dent. Which are the more extreme cases? I get it. Actually, we had one case where. A lady, she said, that looks like a nightmare. That is a nightmare. So someone has to clean that up. I mean, email with a bunch of photos where the parking lot was kind of up on a hill by like near a road. And one of the loose carts went down the like the entrance to the store. She was just happy to be driving by, rolled under her car, like totaled her car. So that would be the most extreme case. But I do enjoy encounters like that one. Because it was, it was just talking. You know, she was wrong in everything she was saying as far as how to convert to people. She was trying to, again, pretend like I was a danger. Again, if she felt like she, I was... Uh, Ain't nobody in the car. But they could be inside doing Instacart. Oh, it's <laughs> no, it's, it's, it's ridiculous. Leave your cart out, I agree. They're from Germany. They're nice people. 
I agree, it is ridiculous. How are you doing, sir? Thanks for the support. <laughs> Thank you, sir. I'm, I'm trying to Karen it, guys. Don't be a Karen. I, 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 that, what is this? Hey, hey, let me go out the way, please. No, you're, that's, in, that's in somebody else's way now. Hey, this ain't, I didn't even do nothing, bro. No, I'm, not I'm not blaming you. I'm not blaming you. I'm not blaming you, sir. Bro, don't even do all that. This is hey, my hey, car. Hey. It has nothing to do with him. Sir, it's quite all right. Don't worry. It has nothing to do with me. You're fine. That's, we that's, we that's, don't blame you. We don't blame you. Trash. We don't blame you. We're not, we're not blaming you. You're a good guy. No matter how it goes, it's gonna look like I was involved. I'll, I'll, I'll say for the record, you were not involved. I, for the record, he's not involved. You're not involved. Not hey, can involved. I ask your name, sir? You good. No, sir. We're, we're saying you did a good job. I didn't do nothing. We're not. We're not blaming you. We're not blaming you. We'll he's get out of the way. Fan. He's fine. He's fine. Oh, you're a Bills fan too. We'll get out of the way. Thank you, sir. Did you know about us beforehand today, or are you just? No, I don't know the country. Oh, well, thank you. So, new fan. I appreciate that. Yeah. But did you see that? Like, breathe in. See, I was just explaining this to them. Like, I, I got to do this only part time because if I did it full time, I would like stress myself out. Because right. you're like, <laughs> as much as people like you are nice, guys like that, that the car next to him just couldn't leave at all. You, 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 look, you can lead a horse to water, but you can't make him. <laughs> I think we kind of made him drink, though. I think with your help, yeah, we yeah, made him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, we drink a little bit. We drink a little bit. <laughs> he took a sip. <laughs> he took a sip. Enjoy it. But did you see what he, he left it in the handicap spot after that? You know, so. If, if it's not today, it's tomorrow. But hopefully we're planning this season, and hopefully next time he'll think. This guy's Thank you for being third supportive. eye is open. <laughs> yeah. Oh, would you like a shop a sticker, sir? Of course. Thanks very oh much. Fuck it. I'm gonna put this right <laughs> on my window. <laughs> Sorry, your name again? <laughs> I'm Kyle, guys. Nice to meet you, Kyle. I appreciate it. He said he didn't know who the cart narcs were. He just lives in the neighborhood. And... Oh, okay. All right. Thank you for supporting. Can I get you a sticker? Can I get you a sticker? I take a sticker. That, did you see what that guy did? did you see where he left that car? I did not see it. And I, then he I left love, it. I watch your videos, man. I'm I could use a guy fan. like, if a guy like you was with me, uh, guys like that would probably not be as, uh, you know, I, I love they'd, probably, they'd probably be nice, more nice to willing you, to man. help out. Nice Thanks to for stopping. You. Thanks for saying hi. Appreciate it. Yeah, people often say I should get like a couple of those, like big like wrestler types with me, and yeah, it would guards. it would get people a little more uh, <laughs> agreeable. <laughs> hey, bring me at, bring me and Ethan out there in a mankini. Yeah, don't you worry, buddy. Put I'll us, wear my speedo out there. Bring us out there in mankinis. We'll, I don't we'll even need on, a top. We'll baby. put on pit vipers and tire hair up and pigtails. <laughs> I'll wear Put a, your cart back, brother. I'm going to wear a trench coat and have an RPG on my back. <laughs> you going to walk that cart back to the cart corral let me, let me or you going to regret it for the rest of your goddamn life? Let me ride in on a mankini. I'll be riding a donkey and I'll have a wrestling belt tied to my forehead with my pigtails up. Don't leave that there, brother. You're not going to want to leave that there, brother. That's bad news for you. <laughs> Even though he didn't try to fight us, <laughs> and that, that's, that's the first time I've said, had a guy do that, where he's like, I don't want to be involved. I know. <laughs> I have nothing to do with him. <laughs> he really threw him under that the bus, funny. too. <laughs> All right. That was interesting. True friend. Hopefully it ended well. Now, Narcoteers, our man in the green hoodie over here. How you doing, man? Don't worry. You're not in trouble. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this. Oh, no. Perfect example. Somebody had already put their cart over there. And, ah, oh, that's not where the carts go. There's a cart return right there. And the front of the store's right there. Wheel whip skip woo See what he did, Narcotier, is he blocked uh, part of that. Well, he blocked the doorway opening to that spot over there. So what you'll see and notice is that somebody had already put a cart over there. So it's the whole monkey see, monkey do thing where somebody else did it. He knows the cart returns at the front of the store right there. Oh, they're just talking. <laughs> they're talking about me. This is getting a, uh, a lazy bones on board magnet. Good job. Got him. Um, oh, he's honking. <laughs> I mean, good. For, how's it going, sir? <laughs> oh, he fl I, if you can see, he flicked us off. Oh, did it blow off? Oh, no. Okay, it's good. Uh, see, that guy, you know, if you heard. Sir! Well, don't leave your car where it blocks other people's cars, sir. Oh, that's littering. Here's a littering. I got a uh, one for your rear here if you'd like it, sir. The same thing. Oh Let's see my the for the fake god! Out. <laughs> I work for the cart narcs. Hold on, got him. Uh, and he left his cart blocking the uh, the area where people have to like open their doors to get out and stuff. She's like, no. So like, let's take, sorry, should I take it back now? Be a nice guy. Oh, you're littering again. I got more for you here, sir. Thank you for the beans. Ah, good toss, but it fell off, obviously. Now, sometimes he might not even know oh, he's out of here. 
typically once they get on the main roads, I'll let them uh, let them be because I don't want to cause any kind of. Oh yeah, you felt it didn't go on, sir. You missed it. <laughs> you fell for it, sir. Not really intentional. Oh, he's flipping me off again. <laughs> Take your card back next time. Oh yeah, yeah. Uh, anyway, so for folks who didn't see what he did, and actually you thought the magnet fell off, but he thought it didn't. So what happened is, somebody <laughs> left this cart here, right? And he left his cart here. So you can't, now nobody can park here, even if it's a smaller spot, obviously. Or if you need to, oh, how are you doing, ma'am? Um, or if you want to pull through, now it's, it's blocking a few extra feet. Again, it's not a huge big deal. This wasn't a giant violation, but definitely not where the cart goes. And it's obvious about that. But he wanted to flip me off and... Who they always the say, well, don't touch my car, and the point, obviously, is lost on them that when you leave no your car out, unsecured Higher by production. the way, yeah. where this is, there's nothing to keep this from going downhill, the wind picks up or whatever, but they don't care about that, because they're always only thinking about themselves, not anybody else, and that's what the cart narcs is hopefully here to change. The cart returns right here. This lady, kind of old, but she left her cart right here when the front of her... Not the old the lady. That's not where the cart goes. It's right there. Right there. Well, this cart, now it's... Cry. Don't cry. <laughs> don't cry, madam. You have a bad leg. Then how'd you get your cart all the way in here? You didn't? I saw you. Whatever. Oh, you spent enough money. All right. I'm sorry. Have a good day. It's going to be hard because now it's harder to park here. Oh, I'm getting a cart narcs magnet that says I don't return my shopping cart like a jerk. I'm gonna put that right there for you. Um, don't get out so with your bad leg. We, that it's wouldn't probably be hard good. to hear for all the engine noise around us, but there were a couple of excuses there that were, um, you know, basically not applicable. So she said, I have a bad leg, pointed to her disability placard. First off, <laughs> there are spots that she can run back. But also, we saw her uh, walk into the which store. Which could be out, falsified information. Here. I'm sorry? Oh, this is news, this is news footage. Uh, not for, yeah. Oh, okay. Not a problem at all. And then she leaves the cart here. What, by the way, her trunk was not here, so she didn't have to push the cart. She could have easily just gone right over there. Or, uh, oh, yeah, yeah. What, what the, the fuck what is weird, the dude with the GoPro? Weird, News footage, she, oh, dude. She's going to throw it off. One second. Ma'am, can I help you? News channel 9. <laughs> oh, she's moving nice and slow. Now, have you reconsidered your... Have you reconsidered, ma'am? Reconsidered what? That that's not where the carts go. That's too bad. It's not too, it's too bad for the next person. You know what, honestly, leave me alone, take your thing and- But ma'am, when you leave your cart out, it's bad for the next person that wants to park there, right? Okay, then let them move it. But that's, but it's your cart. So what? What, you, so do you- Oh, come on, I have no time for you. you Yo, I did ah! not expect that. Ah! <laughs> oh, so what? I have no time for you. It sounds like that old news, or that old show, you remember? Where they had the people on. He was like, our next person is, you never seen, I showed you that. Like, our next person is so-and-so. He's like, there's some other, there's some other. he like busts out laughing and he gets in trouble. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> I have no time for that. She sounds like fucking Batman. Or Jason Bourne. Yeah, 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 exactly. <laughs> I gotta go save somebody. I'm sorry. I have a busted leg. <laughs> My organic eggs aren't gonna make it to the fridge on their own. I hate guinea pigs. <laughs> you had time to get out. My Trader Joe's you coffee. You had time to get out. And since you turn it on the ground, I'll give you a special litter bug magnet that says you're a litter bug. Leave my car alone, otherwise I call the police. What are you gonna tell the police? That you are harassing me. And I'm gonna tell them that you harass people with your cart. <laughs> All right, here you go, man. Life. This is. Life. I wish I didn't have to do this, but the carts are my life. And I have to pick up after lazy bones like yourself, madam. El seven. That's unfortunate. You now. I think El I might be seven. having five different excuses now. The, we have easy lazy bones uh, seven. My leg hurts. Uh, Eccentric someone lazy else is gonna bones. do it. Who cares? I bought enough stuff. I bought. Oh, that, that's the worst one that they give. Is I paid a lot of money or I bought enough. I paid enough. This is not about. Again, you'll notice in our, my videos, I don't bring up the you employees. You paid the large corporation money. I don't bring up that it's hard for the employees. Thank you for the beans. I bring up that it's hard for Betty. the next customer because when you leave your cart, in that case, kind of splitting the back area, if someone else had to get back there and unload, you know, a minivan or a truck, you know, that's it's harder for them to or put a put a car seat in. They have to now maneuver around her cart. Fart nart. <sighs> that's what we do. We get thermal cameras. And people that fart in grocery stores, we become it's like fart narcs. Sir, excuse me, but do you really think that that is appropriate to do in the produce section? Yeah, it's like you don't dude. think someone's gonna buy that apple. Whoop, scooby, whoop. 
Boop. Sir, you farted in the produce. Your flatulence is all over the broccoli and cucumbers. He's like, no, I didn't. Do you have proof? It's like, sir, we saw you on the thermal cameras. We are the fart narcs. Yeah. We're a highly trained gas they laugh. organization. They're like, huh, you're for real. Sir, we can smell it on you. We are completely serious we, right now. We're going to bring out the canines. They can sniff out the farts. Amen. Sir, did you have and do you really a slice think? of pizza for, for <laughs> breakfast? I am smelling chorizo. <laughs> Again, she's older, but it made no sense that she couldn't put it right back over there. Um, Three more candidates. Yeah, uh, goodness gracious. It's just, it's, you know, it's, just, it's classic. How are you doing, sir? Yeah, I was just noticing what you guys are doing. You guys are doing a good thing. Well, would you like a sticker, sir? Uh, you don't have to have one if you don't want to. It's card sure. This is a guy, from, they're from a German TV station. They're documenting us weird Americans. Have a great day, sir. Oh, that's what but that's it is. that's sort of classic. And people say, I can't believe, He's especially like, if you're not from America, they'll say, I can't believe people will go to such mental gymnastics to defend what is obviously <laughs> laziness. But that's you saw it in real life, in real time. That's, she went through like the five stages of not grief but laziness. <laughs> uh, and you know, and, and I'm, I'm of course rebutting every every uh, excuse I've heard before, laziness. so I have an answer to all those excuses. But eventually, it was just like, ah, I don't have time for this. Which she did, of course, which is a lie also, because she had time to stop, stop. talk, argue. Oh, yeah. yeah. Then, then, oh, we, we caught another one in there. I'm going to call the police for harassment. Look up, and because this is a thing I get a lot online. Google arrested for harassment. And that's actual, like, going to people's homes and stalking and things like that. Conversations and a magnet does not fall up under harassment. <laughs> or I would be arrested... In literally every state in America. What if you were a stalking magnet? <laughs> uh, because I provide all the evidence what of this What if you just happen to be magnetic, harassment. but you didn't stalk um, anyone? But what again, people, they, they want to find any reason to be right, <laughs> as opposed to, not magnet. all, but some just saying, I'm sorry, my bad, you're right, sorry about that. I was being lazy, so. Cool. Classic example right there. <laughs> Although, thankfully without violence, which is, which is nice, because, <laughs> yeah. Which I can't always guarantee, of course. <laughs> How are you doing, sir? Great, man. Thank you, sir. Where are you from? Can I ask? Long way away. Long, would you like a sticker, sir? I'll, I'll take one. These, these guys are also they're from Germany. They're doing a documentary on uh, Americans and why we don't return our shopping carts sometimes. Well, you know, there's worse things, but I dig where you're coming from. You know, that's the whole point. Is it's yeah. you know you can you can find the cure for cancer and the cure for the common cold. So like. Yeah, there there are worse things in life, but let's we can focus on what we can focus on, you know. Totally, I'm totally with you. I watched and I was like, yeah, <laughs> give us some shit. <laughs> Amen. I, I'm not being nice. I'm not. I'm not you giving her. You're not, you don't have to cause trouble. It's just. Right, I'm just. I, 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 I give him the. I give him every opportunity. Let's get out of the way. Thank you, man. But thank you for stopping, sir. I appreciate thank that. You. Thank you, sir. Card out. Where did all these people go? Amen. <laughs> oh. Amen to you. Not bad. That was a long one. What is be careful? Be careful, cartnarks. A man here in the gray shirt. In Virginia. Hopefully he's headed to this cart return right here or that one. Average over there. Walmart and BJ's. And not splitting the spots like he just did. Ay, ay, ay. Terrible, really. Oops. Keep dropping your things. Wee -wee 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 -wee. That's not where the cart goes. Cart returns right there. It's your fresh magnet. It says uh, "Lazy Bones on board." Let's go. Uh, let's go right over here. Right that. That area right there. The solid one. We'll alert your fellow drivers that you got a Lazy Bones here. Hey, how's it going? Hey, you left your cart out blocking these spots. You ready to fix it for us? I'm not the only one that did that. Put, put one of those close by. It's right over there. Be careful, yeah, there's lazy bones around. I gotta watch out. <laughs> Eef, my dad overdosed on Viagra and my mom is taking it very hard. Any advice? Um we think we think about that one. What do you have to say, buddy? Um There's a couple things you could do. Are you looking to help your mother? Is that what we're looking for? I would say uh, get her some WD-40, soften her up. <laughs> Stool softener. Yeah. Hey, you know what? That's even a better, that's a better idea. Mirror relax. Get her a laxative. Soften it up. 
She's taking it too hard. Thanks for the ten dollars. Yeah. Or just get them both a <coughs> pound of. Eh, never mind. KY jelly. <laughs> Buy your granddaddy some Plan B. I can't hear you. Oh, you threw it on the ground. Later, bug. I got another one for you. See, you left your card out. What? I'm going to call the police. You can't hit me, sir. You're very old. <laughs> you go pick up your litter. I mean, he. I, don't, I can't. I can't hear you. I work for the Card Narks. We're a strong group of sexy secret agents who help patrol the lots and prevent lazy bones from leaving their carts out, like just like you did. I think what he said there, Narketeers, was something is. If I hit you, you'll say, oh, you hit me. First off, he's not hitting me. Number one. Hey, not to the BMW. Statue. The Virginian BMW. Either taking photos of me or videos. <laughs> or oh, seven. Phones, the phone fell down. So you left your card out right here like a lazy bones. I don't know who's calling. It's either calling the warehouse store or the uh, discounts chain. I guess you call it, whatever. You... And uh, I think his, if we go back to his first excuse was, uh, lots of people have already done this. But well, you know what? More people, and I'm counting like 20, that's another 10, more it's people actually need to use the fucking car return. ever. So to use your logic of, well... That's the AC. Uh, or just be in front of my Buddy, buddy! Hi, did you reconsider? Right here. Yeah. Hello, hi, my name's Adrian Sebastian. He's got the, uh, Cart Narcs. Please don't come next to me. I'm right here. Don't I'm watch behind you, sir. Behind you, sir. Don't, don't talk to me. No, I need to talk to you because you're being a lazy bones. No, I have to because you're being a very lazy bones person, sir. See, what you did is you left your card out in a place where it can damage other vehicles, and now you're being a lazy bones and wasting either I don't know whose time. Oh, yeah, you are lazy. That's correct. That's why you have a lazy bones <laughs> bone board magnet. And one in the back he too. He called me lazy. <laughs> How dare he? <laughs> He's leaving. He behind you, there's a person, me. there's a pedestrian back there. I know you're too lazy to look often and you don't care about other people, but um, <laughs> Thank you for I mean, the beans. No, I'm saying watch, watch out for this guy. He's a very lazy person. He might back into you. Just saying, be careful. Oh, no. For, not for you, for him. For him. I think it'll be fine. Oh, yeah. Just want to make sure. He's the type of guy that'll leave his card out in the middle of a spot, you know, and not really. Do you know the guy? Uh, unfortunately, I've become acquainted with his lazy bones ways. <laughs> and, uh, yeah. He's, uh,. <laughs> He lets his uh, car out, see how it kind of like makes it harder to park in these spots so it can roll and hit other people's, yeah. Yeah, uh, lazy, some people use that word, I, I just say lazy bones, but I hear, I hear what you say, but that's why I said... I'm not employed here, uh, <laughs> I could say anything. <laughs> Neither am I. Thanks for your support, You're sir. Not? No, no, I'm just a, oh, I'm a, there's a cart and sticker, that's what we are. We're a volunteer organization, we try to help change the tide of lazy people. So. Okay. Oh, you don't want it? Okay, cool. So you harassing people who oh. leave their carts? Polite ask, we're not a harass, it's a polite <laughs> ask, polite ask. We're, we're, we're sweet and loving about it. Very polite. We're not threatening. So you guys actually made an organization and volunteer and go out and say, hey, put your cards back. In a sense, yes, sir. Wow. Like, you know, it's like adopt a highway sort of thing for the, the side of the road. I waste my time on lazy bones. That's, I agree. Lazy bones do waste your time. How's it going, sir? Uh, you know, you kind of feel, we've talked about this many times in Arcateers, but uh, Amen. you run into lazy bones like this, you kind of feel, oh, the world's against me for a while. Local but parking lot guys like that, the bystanders, you have no, no idea what's going on. <laughs> <laughs> Great job, sir, by the way. Uh, warms the cockles of our cart and heart. All right, again, we're going to, uh, if anything else happens again, if he comes back out or does whatever, anybody else shows up, we'll, we'll pick things back up. But in the meantime, to, to put a little uh, coda on this one, Narcoteers, he's taken off now. Uh, whoever he was on the phone with, be they management, police, or whoever. You uh, can't be leaving your carts out, lad. Uh, real time? Uh, coming, coming up on 10 minutes of him just wasting time and not taking his cart back. <laughs> but uh, he didn't. I it is crazy how long people sit there. there. The covert like, I rear bumper magnet. <laughs> how y'all doing? Uh, it's not been removed either. Oh, it's talking to some of the people. <laughs> you guys are fine. Yeah, the cart returns right over that way if you're looking for one. Uh, I see, like, here, I'll show you. I'll walk, I can, I can, I'll walk it over there for you. Like, right over there. I'll take it for you. Okay. That's fine. Thank yeah, you, not a problem. Um, where is he? Yeah, there he is. He's what a polite young right lad. Um, He's a nice fella. And I wouldn't have busted that group of people because they had a small baby with him anyway. Because uh, he's a nice guy. Yeah. Did he ever come back? No. The man did not.
He just sat there for 10 you. minutes on the phone with the cops who said, sir, we don't have time for your shit. Said, sir, we have no fucking idea what you're talking about. What's Pasadoers versus Pasadonters? Let's watch it. At this oh, point, yeah, it's one. typically going to be done. Pasadena? Pasadour, Pasadena, Pasadonta. Amen. No. Pass participle. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> Let's go a little further. A little further. See where that one is? I have <laughs> asthma. You walked, you walked pretty darn far to have asthma. I'm sorry? Yeah, you left your car in the middle of the handicapped walkway. I have asthma and was in the hospital. Do you want what I have right now? <laughs> because I'll give it to you happily. You're giving I'm me the not, card already. I'm not moving. You're anything. sure talking a lot for someone who has bad asthma. Some of you have cart knocks. Cart knocks, please, actually. You're blocking the way for a handicapped person, though. What if a lady. Dude, Ninja star. Dude. And by the way, you don't know who you're fucking speaking to. So I, I know I'm talking to a couple of lazy bones right now, actually. You don't know who you're Watch speaking to. So, man, I am a handicap. <laughs> now a person with a chair. You want to speak to me with respect or you will die. Uh, you flip me off. I don't believe what that you want me to have a wonderful day. Let's see. They're going to do the, uh, the drive and dash. See, this is what we talk about in Architeers is the people who are truly, truly has something. We're just about to show you a different video from Pasadena here of a guy who truly has an issue with getting around. They're kind, they're gentle, they're matter of fact. When you're making an excuse and or in this case lying about how bad your asthma is that you couldn't you could walk it that far but you couldn't walk at the five other feet and you could you could get up and yell at me oh they're gone they're out of here uh you know they're lying you know that's a lie and the defensiveness and the anger is the first and easiest giveaway yeah literally asthma but i'm wearing a big ass mask on my face <laughs> it helps me breathe <laughs> look at move this for these lazy bones uh, a couple things are going to happen. Number one, he might qualify for our old man exemption. <laughs> which is, we have an old lady exemption, old man exemption. Yeah. Uh, he's moving okay. Another thing that's going to happen in about five more steps is those wheels are going to lock up on him because of the anti-theft devices. So right there. Yep. Uh, it's, it's, I see it a lot around here, but it's, you do see it everywhere. So, and I never best, oh. yeah, yeah, exactly. But I'm watching this guy too. That's crazy. Um, so I'm not going to bust him because obviously it's a pain in the butt to move that cart now. <laughs> Can I help you with that? Yeah, the wheel's locked up. Yeah, I see that, man. That's new. Yeah, see those lines over there in the, uh, in the asphalt? They trigger the, uh, the locking mechanism on that wheel right there and that wheel right there. That's good, man. Well, because you, you'd hate for people to walk off the lot with exactly. it and leave it in the, exactly. on the sidewalk. It's been a while since I've been over this way, you know? You weren't about to do that, were you? No. You weren't going to leave that sidewalk? No. I'm just gonna sit right there, wait for my wife to pick me up. Okay. Well, I, I, I can move it back for you if you want me to. Okay. Do you want to grab your stuff out of there? Oh, I, I can't hold it. You know, oh. That's why I'm, I got it. Well, I'll, I can walk it over with you if you want me to. Thank you, sir. Over right over here. What a nice guy. Yeah, they gotta come out with like a special radio transponder to unlock it, so it's gonna it'll yeah, because because otherwise you know they go they go everywhere and you get stuff like over exactly. there. Yeah. Exactly. I've seen them over there too. No, oh, I believe it. Thanks for stopping. I appreciate it. That's the other thing too, is the sort of the inadvertent psychology of it is. Uh, actually, there's, a, there's an easy way to do it. It's the, it's the unicycle. <laughs> Done this plenty of times. Uh, He's an yeah, expert, I, I he is. Because like, I, I, you know, I trust him a little bit on that, right? But see how he was smiling and you know, said, oh no, I was just gonna put it over there waiting for my wife. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. <laughs> um, Bro, y'all are hilarious. That's, that's the other inadvertent psychology of it. But when people lie, that's when they get angry because again if you look in thousands of studies have been done about it. like it's, it's it, it it stresses your brain to lie because you're having to create new information that yeah. you know is wrong that guy told the truth you could tell because he was sweet and nice about it yeah. no problem helping him out um that's the other thing too like he's I, I very rarely have i busted somebody who's been a sweet and nice liar <laughs> it's always the other way because they're trying to defend their ego. Not that dude. So I appreciate what he did. Uh -oh. Amen. Uh oh. Classic oh. curbing, a two wheeler. Come on over here, buddy. Car returns right there. Yep. See. <laughs> Every opportunity in the world not to do that. You might say, well, it's not that bad. I agree. We go to the other side here. But it does knock off a good couple foot or two. Woo! 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 It's not where the carts go. Carts go to the cart. Oh, well. 
We've got these newer uh, larger style shurikens. We'll just go right, right there. Um, Take that shit off. Well, you left, you left your cart blocking the pathway. Take it off. Will you move your cart? Take it off. Move your cart. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. Let's see if he does the old drive and toss. <laughs> These lazy bones never want to have In a conversation. The handbook, that's they a want to yell their own request. <laughs> <laughs> Pay no attention to my request, which I would I would argue much, much more legitimate. Let's see if he's... The cart narc. No, he's out of here. Don't be leaving your carts hanging okay. around. He's Audi 5000, as the kids would say. <laughs> Too bad. Pasadena really. seems like a lovely place. Was, uh, Put a number in the chat if you're stinky. And I think I'll move there. Where did he go? I'll be moving to Pasadena to no, triple my gone. rent. Man, he's fast. Oh, does he come back? Tears. That door's about to close. Thanks for the prime. And that's their cart. Cart turn there and also there. Every Ford. Up here. Come on, Car. Ford driver. Take her back. <laughs> Take her back. Oh, the cart goes. Lazy Ford driver. Splitting the spots right there. Hey, you left your cart out. I could normally hit someone's truck, but uh, thanks for getting it. You want to head right over this way? You're about. <laughs> One, two, three, four. Who do you work for? Oh, the cart narcs. Courage for? The courageous and powerful and sexy cart narcs. Oh, so you're now. I'm uh, sorry? So you're now. Well, actually, sir, the a-hole would be the person that leaves their cart out and doesn't care about the next person who wants to park there. But thanks for taking it back. Appreciate that, sir. Yeah, fuck you. Oh, that's not very nice to say, sir. You could say thank me for helping you be a better person. Next time, okay? See how simple that is? This is. Bye. <laughs> Well, unfortunately, it goes on every day, ma'am. That guy left his cart in the middle of the spot, and he uh, decided he's going to drive off, you know, just letting it roll, maybe hit your car. That's why I helped him out. That happened to me once at another Ralph at Hastings. Yeah. They dented my door. Oh, happens all the time. But see, once they're done with their car, they think, uh, oh, I don't care. The next person deal with it. How many hours do you have to be out here? Oh, well, you know, it's sort of a, it's a volunteer position, so it's, you know, come as a please. But uh, I wish I could do all 24-7. But thank you for being vigilant, ma'am. Uh-oh. <laughs> <laughs> no. How many hours do you have to oh. hang out with a guy 20 years older than you so you can ride around a BMW? I think this is a great example broken carts theory. Because the cart turns right there, right? But someone else left their car. Oh, now it's blocking the spot completely. That's not where the carts go. It's locked. Oh, it's locked up? Okay. I tried. I think I've seen your video. No, I, will, I will move it for you. Yeah, yeah. It's you see? That's not your fault. Yeah, what happens in your... Will a sticker? What happens is they bury, there's a little line at the end. Oh, sorry. Because they, they put it that way to go to the back. Right. <laughs> Not your fault, exactly. There's a little line at the end of here that I, that I think they should put like a few feet back, but I they know. don't sometimes. So it's not your fault. I'll get it for you. Don't worry. Thank you. That was an honest yeah, mistake. Uh, honest actually, there's mistake. A, you need like a little radio you transponder. Know, yeah, yeah. So I'll, but I, I have a little way I can move it, so. I, was like, I, would, I would tell him my leg's locked up. I got a little radio transmitter in my leg. <laughs> my knee won't bend. <laughs> well, you know. The thing that the courthouse gave me around my ankle is locking up right now. I'm not able to take it back. It's tightened, and I can't, I can't bend my ankle. It's shocking me to death. I can't move. <laughs> oh, fuck. No. The one Thanks time. for the, the three months in advance, but so you know what I was, I Adam. Tell people, appreciate like, it. If you're telling the truth, you have a good, you have a good attitude. Like, you have a good attitude because you're not lying. I was like, touch it. It's but when people lie, that's when they get all angry. Like, they're not, like, happy like you are, you know? It's, I mean, I, I yeah, because you know you're not like what can I do? You know, you're not like saying oh I'm busy or whatever. You know, yeah, exactly. See, but that's that's basic. I'll take it for you though. Fair Long point. Long story short, see, so just do this right here. Oh, that's okay. I use my spe uh, my special Cartnark strength to help you out. Cartnark's out. Beautiful. What a guy. Beautiful, what a guy. Beautiful indeed. moments. Beautiful moments. What a guy. He is. Cart return right here in Arcateers. West Milwaukee. Right there. Looks like this lady's. Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> Come on! I think she said, "What am I following you for?" Don't be oh, a dickhead. I thought you had a cart, and I think you didn't put it away where it belongs. Oh. <laughs> it's Milwaukee, nice. You didn't leave your cart out, did you? Milwaukee. Let's take a I look. I think I'm Milwaukee there. Goodness oh. gracious! I'm on the list. You know what? I say not a terrible cart placement, quite frankly, but at the same time, not where the carts go. If you wanted to, let's say, load something, in, oh, how are you doing, sir? Great T-shirt. If you wanted to load something in that back door, for <laughs> instance, like, leave your me the rear stuff, driver's Shut side door, up. that cart is. I'm oh, sorry. I'm telling the marketeers. I'm saying that if we take our carts back, we don't leave them in the way of other people. 
could be somebody old that needs to grab a card. Yeah, there are, there, right are, there are plenty of cards, but what if there's somebody old who's in that back seat that wants to open their door? Cardinard. Cardinard, yeah. What if somebody old's in that back seat and now they can't get out because your cart's in the way? Um, no, it's not. Yeah, it is. No, here's a magnet for you. No, it's your job to move it because you're the you're the lazy bones. That shit on my fucking car. It you fell off. Your motherfucking mind? No, my mind is the one who yeah, you lost your motherfucking. The mind. one who lost their mind is the one. Car, nigga. You got me fucked up. Back the fuck up. I don't give a fuck about none of that. Well, you should, because what if that's you someday? I don't give a fuck. What if someone left their car? You doing too much. Get the fuck out of my. Man, you're not doing enough. What if you left? What, you're, what if someone put their car right there? Brought up. Ah, didn't didn't stick. I got tears. Unfortunately, let's see if she might have. Where'd it go, by the way? Watch out. People crazy out here. Yeah, people right crazy. Here. Exactly. Gotta watch out for these crazy people who love that. Love the... you want me to fight? <laughs> no! <laughs> I wanted you to push your car back. <laughs> don't have a gun. I, I don't, don't have guns. <laughs> oh, I mean, you can have a gun. I guess it's, I don't know what the rules are in Wisconsin, but <laughs> where's she go? She's gone. I'm trying to now, where'd that magnet go? Kind of like bounced off, flew somewhere. Now I can see this is always it's always funny because like I'm scanning the, the how you doing? I'm scanning actively in these areas for where they put it and like and you guys always you detectives always find it later on somewhere. <laughs> we'll find out. Detectives. Yeah. Love it. In house. <laughs> I don't know what's going on behind me either. Did you have some questions about the card narcs? Can I help you with any information? Well we get a lot of people around here, so we just don't Don't know who they are, what's going on. Oh thank you. Well, here's, here's some stickers if you want to give them to anybody who might be a fan. All right. Thank you, young lady. Y'all have a great day. Man's got a pre-placement going on, but he saved it, I think. I think. Uh-oh. Is it too hard for... Oh, no. He... See, he wanted to do the right thing. He wanted to get that cart out of there and pull it over to the cart return. But... Uh, Thank you for the thousand beans. Don't let Just him get away with pushed. that. Give him hell. Ooh, whip, skip, woodle, woo. Oh no, that's not where the cards go. Cart returns right over that way. Great job, man. By the way, bringing it back. Gotta love that. Yeah, that's okay. Yeah, right around this way or that way. Whichever way is. Uh, well, we're through the spots. So that's the most difficult way. Thanks a lot, man. Uh, awesome job, sir. Thank you so much. I saw at the corner of my eye. And we have a fake cart, the biggest cart return. The front of the store is right there. This lady going. Uh oh. Uh oh. All right, she can make it. She can make it. Huh? Oh, I was, I was, I was saying a prayer for you that you were gonna make it all the way to the cart return. Oh, I was praying something. Man, I'm so high. Would you like me to do it for you? Please. You ask nicely, I'll do it for you. That's sweet of you. Please take it. Back yes, ma'am, I will. Because I'm so high and I'm tired. I hear that, but you were nice about it, so I'm happy to do it. Great job, Thank sir. You. Thank you. You're very sweet, young lady. Okay. Look at that. Two Out good here doing the Lord's band. work. <laughs> doing the Lord's Bad work. Results. Turned into two good results through the charm and niceness of the car. Uh, how does he choose where he goes? I really want to talk to this guy. Oh, Narcoteers, you can see great view here of the uh, stadium from the cart return. Uh, west Milwaukee. Uh-oh, this is going to have a spot split. Somebody's, somebody's yelling about something. Let's see if we can help out. That's not where the cars go, that's a spot split. So the cart returns right over here. It's just two spots over that way if you'd like to take the cart. Yeah, awesome. Thank Thank exactly, it's not that deep. No, no, it's a volunteer position. So basically, what, oh, thank you very much, by the way, you're doing a great job. So basically, we help out to keep, like, it's hard for these people to open their doors now, but thank you so much for doing the right thing. That's awesome. You know, it just helps keep everything clean, orderly, helps keep the places nice for uh, the next person. Appreciate y'all. Oh, look at this. Full insertion. Great job. Thank you so much. You like a sticker? Great job. Thanks so much. Now, in our tears, I'm not These people sure are so pissed. Here. <laughs> There's three guys involved, so you got to figure that's not an active car theft. <laughs> and they're having a hard time doing it, too. Like, real car thieves are boom, in and out. Smash and grab, you know, professionals. These guys are taking their Can you imagine? having a hard time of it. So even though the cart narcs are not car thief narcs, you know, it's always good to have an extra pair of eyeballs out in your lots. Yeah, those guys, I mean, they are car thieves, they're really bad at it. Do you see what just happened? 
four-way spot split. Cart return there, cart return. It's kind of a cart return over there, but one right there as well. Certainly not supposed to go right there. Let's see if we can line them up. We'll address this in a minute. That's not where the carts go. Get the hell away. Got a cart return right over that way. Oh, it's awesome. Department Thank of you. Transportation. Running truck, right? In fact, I'll take it for you. I'll take it for you. You got it? Thank you. All right. Just wanted to watch the truck or whatever. There's a guy right over there if you want to throw it to him, too. Either or. Sure, sure. In our tears, as we always do. This is a beautiful life. Doing the Lord's work. It ain't really that hard. I want to watch uh, Idiots and Boats. We'll save this for uh, tomorrow. Yeah, good idea. All right. Let's watch some idiots in boats, huh? What do you say, chat? Thanks for the two months. If you're watching on YouTube, please be sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And put your damn shopping cart back. Don't be an asshole. Don't be a dickhead. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Don't be one of them dickheads. Yeah. Just put your cart back where it goes. It ain't that hard. Have you ever seen someone on a boat and said to yourself... Maybe they shouldn't be on board. Well, today we will be looking Every at day. some of the craziest boat-related fails. That was a so proposal. I've seen ado, that. Let's jump right in. <laughs> Gravity is not their friend. Did he try to slow it down with his hand? <gasps> oh, oh my God. God. Oh God. There goes there the boat. Goes. There it goes. There it goes. There goes Get out boat. of the way. Insurance fraud. Well, this is an interesting shortcut. Hell yeah. That's just Why pure are they skill. the balloon directly into the ocean? The fish below would like to have a word with them. Don't worry, wow. the dolphins will clean it up. <laughs> <laughs> they probably will. Use your prime. <laughs> it goes Why to the is ocean. The speedboat racing a cruise ship. Oh my god. Pro. He found a lazy way to steer the boat while lying down. Wow. Alright. Now enough. this looks expensive. <laughs> Oh my god. Jesus. Here is how not to enter the water in a kayak. <laughs> hmm. I don't think it was supposed to go down like that. Oh. Not bad. Thanks for the five dollar. I know more. Here we have a boat that got stuck, I but this guy just made things worse. When Lizzo trips. Oh my god. Just snap the mask Her off. Her dad is not going to be happy after this. Jesus. This boat has a wet zone and a dry zone. Stuff in the bow and stuff in the bow and stuff in the bow and stuff in the bow. Send them under. Is making me sweat. Bro, what is this? This is this is fucking Carvana. <laughs> Carvana. Carvana wet edition. <laughs> boat vana. Make sure you get that parking brake on. What the fuck is this? That's crazy. They got a sea keeper, it's fine. <laughs> With the thrasher hoodie. Someone made it back a tad too late. Say goodbye to that thing. See ya. Oh my fucking god. This is what happens when you take a yacht under a low bridge during a high. I want to see that again. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Beautiful this landing. This is what happens when you take a yacht under a low bridge during a high tide.
Thank you for the beans. Ha toccato. Tonk tonk si sta incagliando. Slowly, slowly, sounds like me sharding. In the toilet, yeah. <laughs> it's me every morning. This was his first time launching his brand new boat. There. Oh my god. What in the fuck? <laughs> this is beautiful. This the big red fucker. I think this through. What the fuck are you doing? Bro. And here's why you never want to be the. What was the plan? <laughs> what was actually the plan? What the fuck? What was the plan there? <laughs> if anyone could tell me what the plan was, I'd love to know. What the fuck are you doing? What was the actual plan? Did they just? Did they just? It like, must have like put it in park with no parking brake. It had to be that. What the fuck? This person did, did not. <laughs> Look at this. Look He's at like, I'm panic. just going to put it in reverse 100 yards away and get in the boat and see what happens. <laughs> Think this through. Oh, my God, bro. That, dude, that is and here's what why you, you never do not do if that is happening. Don't wow. jump out under the tire. You know, must get run over by your own vehicle. I'm going to be the first person off the boat. Quick shower. That was a very oh. stupid idea. Oh my god. Oh fuck. That is painful. That sucks. Lightly used truck. <laughs> yeah, right? <laughs> I think you went in a bit too far. Bruh. That back right wheel. Stop! I know my. Well, that's one way to get off a jet ski. Thank you for the five dollar. Yeah. It's one way to ruin twenty sure k. Not sure which hole the fuel goes in. Just pick one. I'm sure it'll be fine. Hey, what? I don't make this mistake ever. They put 231 liters. They thought this was the petrol. What am I watching go down? <laughs> he just. Oh bro. my god. Do you think maybe you'd get like to eighty dollars and be like, wait, you know, I feel like I'm I'm kind of filling this thing up here, dude. A little you bit. wouldn't see the gas coming out the bottom immediately. You, you wouldn't, wouldn't smell it instantly. It, it was like, a straight hole to the bottom. <laughs> you wouldn't like pull the trigger and be like, five hundred dollars. Oh, oh my god, bro, what, dude? Look at how the hole is straight down. Look, I love, the dude. This was the picture, bro. They're gonna have it's an open hole. It's, it the gas truck's gonna have to show up. <laughs> they probably just filled up the tank in the fucking earth. <laughs> like, god damn. It's gonna all seep back into the tank. <laughs> I just get a broom out here. I'll sweep it back in. Dude, that's crazy. Holy shit. Oh my <laughs> god! Whoa! Yeah! Where'd that Pathfinder come from? Subscribe. That's insane. People are really dumb. Insanity. What the hell is wrong with you? Thank you for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. Yes. Yes. We love you very much. Chat, thank you guys so much for hanging out with us for five and a half hours. Big appreciation time for you. We love you guys. Be sure to subscribe. Thank you. 
Leave a like, leave a comment, leave a how you doing, see you later. Chat, we're going to be live again tomorrow. We might do media share. We might do something, something, something. We're going to do a little fun shit, a little something, a little that, a little this. We will be back here tomorrow. So, well, I guess in a couple hours. Later today, yeah. <laughs> Later today. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Y'all have a good night. We love you. Peace.